We live? Yeah. We're actually live. Fantastic. Welcome to Fight Companion Calabasas. And it is for the Jake Paul Woodley fight live on Showtime pay-per-view only. And I have quite the cast with me. It's probably the best show uh, going on right now. We got Josh Thompson on my left. We got Brian, the kid Callan, finally making an appearance on Calabasas Fight <laughs> Companion. And MMA royalty, the royalty. legend, royalty. Rampage Jackson. <laughs> To make of course. Ooh, ooh, and he's go. super nice in person. Yeah. <laughs> he's really nice. He's so nice. And of course, my man, Bradley Martin here. Damn, I can't follow up after that one. I'm yeah. like, you know what? I probably should have. You should have you know? me first and yep. then him last. Yep. You, you got good. a diamond bracelet and you're pulling it off. Oh, yeah. It's, this, is some, this right here? I, I'm surprised you're not at the fight, man. Usually, like, you know, <laughs> you're at yeah. the. You, we, 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 where uh, were you Pretty last much time? all you're, the other fights. You were with, like, Sugar Sean. Yeah, yeah. Takashi. It was crazy. With those boys. Yeah, with the whole team. But this one, you, you you decide to lay low. Uh, I needed to be back in LA for some time. Really? Yeah. Because working on my podcast. Yes. Yeah, about key, time. Key. That's right. About you already time. know. You already know. About time. So, I've been slacking on that one. I can't slack on it anymore. It's been bad. Yeah, you got to stay consistent, yeah. my man. Let me make sure these light bills stay on. Uh, we got a <laughs> bunch of smooth operators around the table tonight, thanks to Manscaped, the official electric trimmer of the UFC. You know we've got the viewers from around the galaxy. When your balls are bush-free, it's an out-of-this-world experience. <laughs> so get ready. Take off with Manscaped and their new Lawnmower 4.0. Join the 2 million men worldwide who trust Manscaped and trim with confidence. All the thick boys tonight get 20% off and free shipping with the code CFC at Manscaped.com. The 20% off and free shipping with the code CFC at Manscaped.com. we got the link and code in the bio. All right, boys. It's going down. This is the biggest fight in a long time. I mean, UFC's kind of been laying low. Also, you know, biggest fight. I saw you're like, what? But I'm just saying, like, well, I'm I'm just saying, like, as far as, like, the UFC hasn't had any, like, big pay-per-views. It's been, like, fight nights, fight nights. Oh, yeah. So this is kind of what everybody's been waiting for. I thought the uh, Conor McGregor fight was pretty big. That was was last time, yeah. Two two and a half months That was a big one. Yeah, that was a big one. That was a big one. But I'm just saying, like, since then, there hasn't been, like, a blockbuster. You're like, what have they done for me lately type of guy. That's what I'm saying. Okay, I feel you. Yeah, I like the fight Does anybody have any inside info on this fight? Does anybody know... Like anything about uh, Jake Paul's fight camp? I mean, I know a little bit. Okay. Uh, the guy that's fighting on the car tonight, he's fighting a, a Tyson Fury brother. Yeah, Tommy, Tommy Fury. Fury. Tommy, Tommy, Tommy Fury. Oh, okay. Uh, he was on. He was on Love Island. Yeah, yeah. I saw. I saw. I saw, I saw the guy posting something about him being on Love Island, like yeah. making out with a dude or something. Uh, I it's, watched it's, that episode. Well, anyway, Maybe that was behind the scenes. Oh, uh, I don't know. I saw it on on that the guy. Sounds like a rumor, rampage. Uh, no, no. I saw it on Pretty Boys. Um, Instagram page. He made like a, a meme, like a funny thing. The guy's funny. Like clowning him? Yeah, he was clowning him. But anyway, I trained with that guy at Tony McKee's gym. And, and, and he said he's been sparring with, um, that's how he got in the fight. He's been sparring with what, Jake Paul. Yeah. And he said, he said, he said Jake Paul's a real deal. You know what's weird is every single person I know who's like worked with Jake Paul mm-hmm. or watched him spar, everyone's like, dude, the guy's the real deal. That's Everybody. What, that's what he said. I haven't heard one person like, I can't really fight. Never. Do you know what I keep going back to when Rory McDonald fought? Tyron Woodley got in his grill and just kept jabbing him, and Tyron Woodley had some trouble with that. So and you, and you think uh, Jake Paul's as talented as Roy McDonald? I do McDonald's? not think. I do not I think that. Can't. I do not think that, and I'm glad you said that. However, no, I see what you're saying. I am saying if I'm Jake Paul, I'm thinking to myself, that jab when he was in his prime, he had trouble with that jab. Now Jake Paul's got a long jab. I haven't seen him box really. Let's be honest. We haven't no seen one, him that, yet. But that's my thing. Like yeah. no one, like you, no one at this table can tell me that Jake Paul is no. a real boxer. Like no. we saw him starch Nate Robinson. That guy, you know, he's, a, he's a basketball player. Starch Ben Askren. Ben Askren is there p- for a paycheck. So my thing is, we have no idea how Jake's gonna react when he gets hit. If he gets but, dropped, if if he starts, if he's behind four rounds, like that shows a true fighter. You right. know this more than anyone. Like right. when you're down on the cards, like a fighter's heart is what's gonna make it or break it. And I'll say this. And the reason why I put a lot of money on uh, Woodley is because you put money on Woodley. A ton I of love money that you did that. Because a he's UFC alumni, but also b if he comes ready, like if he's if he mentally wants to be there and compete, he should beat the shit out of. Jake okay, Paul. so now I have to ask this question. Bring it. Is this a real fight? How dare you? <clears throat> what? I, How dare you? I, I'm just saying. Listen, if this guy gets more fights, it's worth more and more money. He's a prize. He's he's making himself to a prize boxer. You're right. So like I can I just see have how to... that's a narrative, but my only thing is, is Woodley. Oh, this would be such a black guy on his entire career if he gets knocked out by the kid who had a Disney show. You know what I'm saying? Like I, I Woodley's not going to play that game. So when they come to Woodley, go, hey man, here's five million where they're paying him to take a fall. Well, how much money is it? Woodley's probably making probably ten million. I bet. 
Is but, that the biggest payday of his career? Yeah. yeah. And is he done oh, yeah. with his career, seemingly? Yeah. Yeah, but here's the thing. So. He'll make more if he wins. There's a guaranteed oh. rematch clause. So if Woodley wins, they have to fight again. That's the deal. Oh, okay. So that does make it more interesting. Yes. I didn't. I didn't even know about that. And, and if you know, and Woodley's a good buddy of mine. He doesn't. He doesn't play those games. Okay. So he, then I'm telling he's not. Yeah, yeah, okay. He, so he, he, he's he, a real. Yeah, yeah. He yeah, won't shout out like okay, that. Let okay. Ask, let me ask you a difficult question. He, he's. You got money on him. You love him. He's awesome. It, it, would you say in the past four years, maybe three years, he hasn't been. He, his enthusiasm for the fight hasn't been what it was. And I taught, he was on uh, Food Truck Diaries when I went to Miami before the Logan Paul Floyd fight. Right. And we did it next to the pool. I said, that's why I told him, I said, bro, I'm not trying to like make fun of you nothing, but I said, sometimes you just, you, I'll see you in the middle of the fight, like look at the clock, bro. Like you just seem checked out. And he's like, yeah, I am. He's like, wow. I just haven't, haven't felt like doing it. I've been, and he was like, I've also been wiling out, bro. He's like, do, do you think he had like, enough time to train for this? Time. This one, he's taking serious. From what I hear, he's been taking it very serious. Text with him, he's taking it dead serious. So, and also, I know Woodley's background's wrestling. Woodley can box, dude. He like he, box. He's been at wild card for a hot second, man. My friend said, my friend said, if I was in Woodley's corner, I would pay Jake Paul to say as many bad things about his mom as possible. Oh, you don't That's, mess with Mama Woodley. Yeah, yeah. A thousand bucks. Jake Paul is gonna win. Oh, deal. Okay. Yeah. I couldn't like pass that. it up. Just I couldn't like pass that. it up. Yeah, yeah, you're taking yeah. Jake Paul. That's I love yeah, I couldn't. Saying. I couldn't yeah, pass it up. Fuck. Sorry. Now, now am I out eleven grand if Jake Paul wins? Yeah, I am, dude. Yeah, I am. <laughs> ooh, ooh. Ten you know what? Woodley, I yeah. love that you're going with with your boy Woodley. I got it. I'm man. going with Woodley. You can't turn your back on the internet. You know no, what? You I can't. suffer from peer pressure and I don't have a lot of. Characters. Okay, but what about what about the size difference? Yeah. It's a he's, big he's size taller, difference. but Woodley's a big dude, man. Like Woodley's Jack. Yeah, but yeah, I mean, literally, jacked, this other thing, Woodley has power, dude. Like Woodley's an athlete. Go ahead and yep. take a look at Woodley's legs and ass. That's no, what look, I know he's got power. I'm not saying he doesn't power, but, hey, but I'm just saying but, physical body weight. Yeah, yeah. But, but tell me, tell me, who have you seen Woodley starch in one shot? Not once. Uh, I have. Uh, no, what's, 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 what's that kid's name? What's Koscheck? Nope. Koscheck. He, hit him with, he hit him with the three piece. Well, that was a three piece. He, yeah. he hit him Robbie one Lawler? time, kind of stunned him a little bit. They and had to finish him up. Robbie Lawler. Robbie Lawler. Yeah. Robbie Lawler. He knocked nope. Robbie Lawler into into the corner, and that was that. Yeah, Law yeah, I guess you would say Lawler would be probably yeah. the next one. Yeah, yeah. He, hit Robbie, yeah, he hit Robbie with a nice shot and yeah. actually set him back on the on the fence. And he hooked somebody else into So you don't think uh Woodley has power? No, I don't think he has the one crunch power. Now what you have to remember though too is we're not wearing he's not wearing four ounce gloves. He's he's gonna be wearing ten ounce gloves. So that's the other thing. Are these so you're saying Paul, you saying Paul got the knockout power in this fight? Well, I mean, look, Ben Askren hasn't been knocked out except with the flying Man, knee. His chin no, no, was gone and, and after he, that. But now he is. His chin was gone after that fight. So and he didn't even train. Yeah, yeah. yeah, you know what I mean. So like, yeah. but chin, he's been known to have a good chin for all the damage. So look at the Robbie Lawler fight. He got rocked. He was getting his ass beat on the ground everywhere, and he still didn't go out. Still came back. Suspect win, you know, with the choke. So, you, and the so it sounds like you're siding with Jake Paul. I'm not siding with you're Jake Paul. I'm saying no, 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 <laughs> no. The I'm work. saying, I'm saying so up to, I'm saying up to the first three rounds. No, I got no. T Wood. So, so after the th after the third round, oh, I, think I think it's going to start going. Opposite. Yeah. Uh, oh no, my god. Twenty four years old versus thirty nine years old. Talk to me about twenty four year old who's never, never been in late. Thirty nine year old, thirty nine year olds that never has balked before. Box before, but he used to five minute but, rounds. But though. I get what you're saying, but yeah, boxing but rounds, boxing rounds are not the same. There's no clinching. There's no holding. There's uh, no wrestling. Ho 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 I've, sp I've sparred with Robert Guerrero, the Ghost. I've sparred with a lot of top boxers. I'm telling you right now, once you once he starts trying to grapple up. him, they break it up. They break it up. That's no, gonna be the rest. That's that. his rest period. Is when he gets, starts to get tired, he will tend to Josh, hold. Josh, so you tell me, you're banking on uh, uh, I think uh, Jake Paul, who hold up, who's who's never been in championship rounds ever. And mentally, we have no idea how he's going to respond. Yeah, I agree with Let's you. Say he gets I agree with you. You're going to side with that. He also, over he guy also in Woodley, who's a Hall of Famer. He also trains with a lot of top level boxers, and professional. Uh, what's it called world champions, mm -hmm. former world champions, and they've said no. He's got the gas tank. He's got the go. But are they like, you just, are they cracking him though? You Josh? just told me a second ago. Everyone you talked to say he's a good boxer, but this legit but inside the ring, inside the practice. Yeah, yeah. we're talking about yeah. practice. Yeah, yeah. I'm we're talking about practice. Said, but but said when was the last time you saw T Wood go real hard on the paint for the full duration? Really. Uh, three not years. too long ago, yeah, yeah. Oh. and, that, and like and I, I, I've known T Wood for a long time. Train AK, train with him out at BJ Penn's place. That's We've been friends for a long time. It just at 39 years old, like I have to touch back on what you said. The motivation, I know, sure he's motivated for this, but how much does motivation get you through when you're 39 years old? The conditioning, the body, I he's carrying like the lot. muscle. I feel like a lot. We're gonna find out. Uh, yeah, my we're gonna find. You think out. it's a 100 percent real fight? Oh, I think 100 yeah. percent. No, he's not like just getting no, it back. No, no, no. How do you sure? I know really, Woodley, with man. boxing, you'll and, see and that. Showtime when I play that game. I'm telling Showtime when I play that game. That gets out, everybody's screwed. It just seems like it just. 
Makes sense. Sense. You, you know why? Because you come from the YouTube world. You know yeah, what I'm saying? Well, that's Where what like, Jake and Paul lives in that world. But you know what doesn't live Chin. in that world? The fight game. Oh. Especially yeah, a guy like I me. Mean, is it changing? Can I, can I have no, the they're even talking about in this that the fight game is changing. The whole thing no, is about this that. Is bo- this is, they're going to try to knock each other out. <clears throat> you, you know what's weird about this Like this YouTube crossover with the fight world? Thanks, is oh, I think oh, all that stops if Jake oh, loses. If Jake gets starched, there'll be a rematch. That's what I'm saying. It all stops. You think so? Yep. That's what I'm saying, though. Uh, Jake Paul's the the face of it. Well, why would they want this stop. to stop then? They don't. But I, but again, it, you can't. I don't know, man. Nah, I, I see where you're coming well, from, but I just don't think I, like Woodley's not going to partake in that because this would be the biggest black guy of his career. No pun intended. It'd be the biggest black guy if, if he gets starched by Jake Paul. No, this is a real fight, dude. No, it's a real fight. This for sure, it's a real be fight. A real fight. This uh, is not for like. For sure. You'll see. I mean, Let, let's say swing. it is real. Who do you have? Fuck. Woodley. Yeah. I go with Woodley only because I've seen him fight a ton. I've yeah. never seen That's my thing. Jake I'm Paul not going to put money. And I love notice, Just yeah. notice I bet a 1000 on Jake Paul I because I so believe in the fact that they want more fights like this. Oh, for business? Absolutely. Yes. Jake, Jake's yes. their cash cow. Yeah. Jake's yeah. their Conor McGregor. Yeah. Like, the I, better I, he does. I understand what he was saying because uh, what he's saying because you think, look at his last opponents. Though. It's been like, he hasn't fought like yeah, someone who's fought lined up. They can, they can actually beat him. This is his first time somebody actually – Possibly can be, and it's still test. someone smaller yeah. though, and it's still someone smaller exactly. and older, He's and got, also not. Oh no, it, it's it's right. it's brilliant matchmaking, but like Jake Paul's yeah. team's not stupid. No. Like people think these guys are stupid. Of course, I don't real, think they're stupid. He's got at all. real sparring partners who are, who were former champions and stuff. Apparently, in his in his ring. Yeah. Oh yeah, two yeah. of the guys. The the question I was I asked him is the question is are those guys. Like when you're sparring with those guys, are they moving around with you, or are they actually giving you real Box, business? Box, those, those boxers do real. They, they yeah, 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 yeah. They, their first four rounds, they're like kind of like Muay Thai guys. They take the first four rounds to kind of warm up with each other, and then after the fourth round, third or fourth round, they just start piecing you up. So as as a guy who's a, an MMA guy, you're going in there, wrestler. You're not if you're going in with guys who've been throwing a right hand since they were seven in that mid distance as boxers. Obviously, what happens? Two guys like you when you go into but, the train with real boxers. So th- this is what I want to like. So, so I would go and spar with Robert Guerrero. He'd do right. 12 rounds. I would do the first four. Right. I was like his warm up rounds. Okay. And I was in like the best shape fighting 25 minutes with. But he's not uh, trying like to fight, knock your Getting head ready off. to fight for Gilbert. Getting ready for like the third or second or third fight with Gilbert. Phenomenal shape. By the fourth round, I was exhausted. Yeah. Exhausted. They're just, their angles, them, their of movement, course. the course. way they touch different you. Sport. I mean, they put me on the stanky leg anytime they want. They not have, you know, it's like it's they cut the sport. angle and I turn right into it. Boom. Yeah. It just, it doesn't, the style of boxing. Now, I'm not saying that Jake Paul is that guy. Right. What I'm saying, though, is that one guy, when he is just focused on boxing, you're learning how to cut the angles. You're learning how to step off. You're learning how to counter off of the slips. Those are things the MMA guys don't do. They don't, you, they don't you, you just don't think focus can pick on. pick that up, though? I, no, he's the, been at wild card since 2009, 2009 with the highest level trainers. okay okay but how, how has it looked lately that's my point like, like, but look who's been fighting vicente luque Th- that wasn't a good fight i know it was a great fight it was he, a great fight he, he, he wobbled him i i get what no, you're but, i get what you're saying take but vicente he's, luque who's a striker and that was actually a good fight who was before, before that? that you have colby covington right who just uh-huh. kind of mopped the floor with him gilbert burns right mopped the yeah. floor with him but all grapplers yeah mar usman mopped the floor with him all grapplers but didn't but all uh grapplers. boy wait, 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 but i want to go back to the, but the, the grappler um which one uh the one, gilbert burns, gilbert burns. <laughs> dropped him yeah hit him rocked him yeah like, yeah, Four ounce gloves makes a big difference. Young, and Blocking. crazy, explosive. Yeah, I mean, he ain't that young. He ain't that young. And he's a jiu-jitsu guy. Now you're yeah, comparing. Now you're saying you're saying a, a world class ah, jiu-jitsu guy yeah, I, has good enough hands to piece you up. Well, he did to Wonderboy Thompson. He caught Wonderboy Thompson with with well, an overhand right or whatever. Uh, not really. He hit him. He caught him. He's, no, he he wobbled Kamara Usman. But he also wobbled. He wobbled. He, wobbled, he, wobbled, he didn't wobble. I promise. He no, but no. But what I'm saying though is, you're I'm saying a guy who doesn't really he doesn't really train boxing. Yeah. Jake Paul's been dedicated to boxing now. Let's just say five years, four years. Right. Okay. He's been and now he's obviously he's taking it very serious because this is cash cow. I think Showtime's paying him fifteen million dollars. Yeah, he's making money. Yeah, he's making Who's money. Fifteen million. Jake. Jake. You know, I think Bro, can we talk about? Time. Have you ever seen the the? So I'm all about building a guy up. Yeah, I, I thought build, I, I thought I was straight. Yeah, yeah, no, I'm not. When it comes to Tommy Fury, but <laughs> <laughs> but I, I'm all about building guy up. Especially as you know, he doesn't have a ton of experience. Obviously, his his brother's Tyson Fury, who's the best boxer in the Amazing. world. Have you seen? The record of opponents that Tommy Fury has fought. No, the, this I, is. I, I'm not I even trying to make, make you guys laugh. The first, the first <laughs> opponent he's fought is 11 and 120. <laughs> Jeez, wow. that's a big problem. Why is the that next guy? Still guy hold up, quit. hold up. Look at this. These are his opponents. I, again, Tommy, I love you. 
10 and 102. The <laughs> Holy next, the next guy, The next guy's 0 and 26. Okay. The next guy was 2 and 26. Exactly. Then you found a guy who's 0 and 11. Then found a guy who's 0 and 9. Tough then numbers. Then a guy who's 2 and 0. Tough numbers. And now he's fighting a guy who's 0 and 1. Yeah, I heard the 2 and 0 guy took the fight in like a three days notice or something like that. <laughs> Jeez. That's, what, that's what Pretty Boy told me. Yeah. Those, those are not good numbers. Because I trained with his opponent. Oh, you want to yeah. bring a yeah, guy yeah. up And is he slowly. good? He's an MMA fighter. Okay. Yeah, man, I feel you. Well, what's with the <laughs> what's with the coddling? Why do they coddle him so much? Because in, in boxing, that they, they, like yeah. I've heard of like building yeah. up, but that's yeah, like, yeah, yeah. like you got to remember like who is Cesar Chavez and then who is Cesar Chavez Junior. They had like oh, hundred yeah. something yeah. fights before they even fought anyone with a winning record. Holy fight, fight. Yeah, that's what boxing does. So boxing, what they'll do is they'll they'll have you fight like your first twenty fights are against guys that are just cans. Just get get the go out there, get the win. Build your name up, pad your record, and then they'll start getting you some more money fights, and then bigger money fights. And as you start winning, and you start getting the money fights, and now you start dedicating your time Jesus. mainly to it, then yeah. You don't fight like would, a real opponent until like 20 yeah. fights. I, I wish they would bring MMA fighters. I think they're doing that with Sean O'Malley. Like they're, they're, they're bringing they're them up smart. slowly. Yeah, yeah. they're playing it smart. Because I remember, I never forgot when you said, when Yair, Yair Rodriguez was so exciting to watch, and they give him Frankie Edgar, and you were like, Give him anybody but Frankie Edgar. You can't remember that when they got well, announced as a guy. Yes, right, and, and it ruined him for. I mean, I hope no, no, he, I it hope didn't ruin. Didn't ruin him. What ruined awesome. Yair? Now, when we talk about guys that that, it's funny. I get a lot. I get a hard time. People give me a hard time about not liking Sean O'Malley. I love Sean O'Malley. I no, actually, I think he's, I, I he's a phenomenal coach, he's like, fight. Tell us what's Josh I, I just Sean, if you listen, if you're watching this, man, I, I love you, man. You, he, he's, I love watching him fight. Yair Rodriguez don't like that guy at all. Why? He's the guy that. He's the guy that will talk all of this, and then when it comes down, like, hey, invite him to beat. They gave him to beat four or five times. He have left the UFC because he didn't want to fight. Well, I get that. Though. Then he came. Nightmare. Then he yeah, came back he with his tail between his legs after he threatened to leave. He let they cut him and let him took him out of the rankings. He actually had then a he conversation came, with Bellator. Yeah, he came. Oh, yeah, he had a conversation shit. with Bellator. Came back, but then he actually no one picked him up. He wanted so much money. He was asking for like a million dollars. Da 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 da. And Bellator was like, yeah. Wow. And then other promotions too were talking to him. They're like, he's, they're like, yeah, no, he's asking a ridiculous amount of money. UFC brought him back because his manager went back to them and said, hey, yeah, you know, we, we, he's sorry, he wants to come back. Da, da, da. Basically, that's what happened. So what, and then now we're having the same problem with him. He don't want to fight right now. He doesn't want to fight. He he, fight he's, right now. he's a mental midget. Yeah, really. Mm -hmm. So what's oh, the point is. of building up fighters though, like that, giving them easy, easy dubs? Because you, because you dubs. take a guy because that's look, young and exciting and not that experienced, and you give him to a dude who's a veteran like Frank Edgar, who can just he just knows shit that your fancy stuff doesn't work with, and it's not, they just chop you down. Yeah. But, but you want to really build a guy you. up so he gets in ring experience, so he's seen like a southpaw. He's been, maybe maybe he had a round where he didn't do well, and then the next round. So by the time he faces a real guy, he's been in those situations. Because if not, you're gonna ruin him. Yeah, the thing was, so they offered Sean the Frankie fight, and I think they turned it down. Smart. Yeah. Where I, did Zabit go? Did he went so he's having some team? injury. He has some serious injuries right now. Uh, he's, he's retired. Just, he's talking about retiring. He basically said he's yeah. retired, but wow. they, they're they're still working with the doctors trying to get something fixed. Because he something's he was, wrong. Yeah. Something I haven't been able to hear about like, what it is. Yeah. I just know out of his camp and out of people that train with him and stuff, they're like, yeah, something's really wrong. They're just trying to get it all figured Damn. out. I don't know if it's like a stomach issue, or, you know, because there was a lot of. A lot of fighters have been having that, like Mike Swick had. He had something to do with like his esophagus along with some stomach issue. Really? He couldn't eat any spice, the couldn't weight? eat any pepper, couldn't eat anything. Is it man. a weight thing? It, I, don't weight know. I don't know what it is. Because he's, he's a special. He's a stud, man. Zabit looks like the whole he's a stud. Nonsense, I, think, I thought he was going to be the next 45-pound champion. He should, he should be if he just keeps yeah. fighting. He he's still young though. What is he like? Twenty eight. He looks forty seven. But <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> so do you think you think Cody smokes Sean if he fights him now? That's a good fight. It's, it's actually that, but that's how talented Sugar is. Yeah. It's yeah. a good fight, but Cody hits fucking hard, dude. Yeah. Like, like, the, like Sugar's that, last man. fight, he fought just a you know a zombie. Of, like, <clears> yeah. This guy was a zombie, wouldn't go down. Yeah, I was shocked. He but told me he, Sugar told me that his his knuckles, his middle knuckles, still hurts after that eight weeks later. He's, well, he's he hit that guy a hundred times. Can't he hit him a million right times. See, Sugar, yeah. you can't say things like that and expect me to like you. Okay, you're soft, buddy. Come no, on, he don't told do that. that. To me privately. <laughs> <laughs> the, Come on, the, the, Sugar. The only, the only thing is, is like how he took those hits against that other dude. Like if Cody hits you, you're not getting off the camp. Yeah, that's he true. He hits like a Mack truck. Yeah. yeah but, but there's also no reason for Sugar to fight him. Like Sugar's do, doing the right moves, calling those guys out. Yeah. But it doesn't make sense for Sugar to do that. Like he's just do, keep he just stays money. in his lane, keep this, making money, and then become on the man. He's so dope. This is what you have to remember. This is what you have to remember. So this is what you have to remember. Why? Why? With sugar, right? Why would you want to fight someone like that right now when you're still on your first, probably first or second contract? You're not making top. You're not making money. shit. Yeah, so yeah. just no, wait. I know that. Keep keep beating these guys. Right. Keep beating the ones you should be beating. And then when you get he's to that next, more fights, right? Does he? 
He has three more fights and then. Okay, I don't know what his contract is, but yeah, he's got to be coming more. there. So he's. Trust I wouldn't fight three, any of those the, guys. Trust me, in those three, the the UFC his set his last one. They're gonna throw him a dog. His second they're to last one. Let him coast through those. Yeah, three. his second to last one or his last one. They're gonna throw him someone hard. He's yeah. gonna get a dog. His for that last one. his second to last one. They'll give him somebody that he can beat as long as he's ready to resign. If he's not ready Maybe to resign, yeah. they're gonna get him beat by his last one because they say, "Hey, you just got, it's you fucked. just lost." That's oh, the, that's the business, that's man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's, that's the man. business. Man, I'm not. They give you the me, worst matchup possible no, if yeah. you're trying to get out that contract. Let me educate yeah. you, my friend. In the, after no, they I mean, after they get business. you, they beat. After they get you beat, they hold on to you for like another year until they're ready to let oh, yeah. you go because <laughs> they have he's, exclusive he's, rights to negotiate like with you. Yeah, you know, does he want to come back and he's not allowed to? What's going on? He can come back. He just always teases it because to see him fight Peter Yan is the fight I'm. Actually, the most oh, uh, or Brandon Moreno, uh, Sugar Cejudo going up to 35 and fighting. No, Oh, so this guy looks like he's coming. never got hit in the face. I want to see him Tommy fight. Uh, yeah, I saw Peter Yan. So they're saying there's opponents. Peter Yan is a nightmare. Dude, 11. I want to see him fight. Was it Owen and 111? You want to see Yan fight Volkanovski? No, no. That's the worst journeyman ever. Oh, wow. Volkanovski might be too big for him. He's the best journeyman. Yeah, I agree. He's doing shit. But I want to see the first three division champion. That'd be, and and that'd Henry, be, with his wrestling, I think he has the ability to stuff everything he, he does. But Volkanovski, I mean, Henry's too small for Volkanovski ultimately, He right? would be, yeah, but he can out-wrestle him. He can out-wrestle him. He can out-wrestle him, man. God. I would not doubt Henry in any situation. No, I, I, no. I wouldn't either. Hey, no. hey, real quick, we know, uh, so you, I know the guy that you know who's fighting Tommy Fury. Yeah. You know uh, Tommy Fury, I think he's the biggest favorite on the card. Or, or Serrano might be a bigger favorite, but he's like a minus... 2000 or some shit like he that? He is. Yeah. Right How much does he yeah. weigh? For real? Yeah. He's a big kid, right? He's about, he's yeah. The guy he's tall. fighting. He's the guy short. he fights. No, he's, no, he's not. He's, he's not heavyweight. No, oh, Tommy, no. Tommy's no. not heavyweight. No, he's not oh, wow. heavyweight. Yeah, well, here we go right here. This kid on the right. 179. Oh, Holy wow. fuck. Wow. Look at that age difference. Yeah, he's young. Yeah. Man. Bodied Ten up. 10 years. Bodied up. He was great. He was six and a half. This Anthony Taylor guy, he fought James Gallagher. Those are some long arms. At 145. That guy's 2-0 or that guy's 0-2? You got five. The guy's five. The wins come first. So I didn't see what it was. Was it zero and two or was it no, two no, and zero? No. This guy is seven and five. He's seven and five. That's his MMA, MMA record. That's his MMA record. Does he have a boxing record, Chin? Yes, I don't think he has. Zero and two or zero and one. Zero oh, and one. Zero yeah. and one. That makes sense for Tommy. Zero and one. Zero and one. Okay. <laughs> oh, he had a he had a boxing match. Yeah, he had one, one. and then he lost. Do I tell you how he lose? Said 2017. Dante Stubbs debut. Doesn't say. Oh uh, no. Oh, split decision. Split, yeah. Oh okay. So he didn't get knocked out. No. I think he has a good chin. You know what? In the gym, I don't know what he's doing, but it, I always see him let, letting people beat him up. Who's oh, this? Who's this? Um, Anthony. Anthony. Huh. He, he lets people letting beat, people beat him up. It looks like he he can get out of the you know he be getting ground and pound. Rope a dope. This is an look, M- he's into an MMA. Yeah, he does MMA. I never seen him. I never seen him box. Oh, okay. oh okay. you never seen him. Callan. Right, right. Does I, it upset you that there's guys like that that look like that around the world? It bugs me. It bothers me. It hurts my feelings. Yeah, that's <laughs> a little disrespectful. And it hurts huh? my feelings on a lot of levels. Number one, if if any woman I've ever dated is gonna fall, you know, she she's gonna leave me for him secretly at least. Yeah. And then. I'm a little attracted to him. Yeah, I mean, look at his mouth. <laughs> <laughs> this is what's weird. Yeah, and that bothers me too. Oh, geez. you're just learning this about yourself. Now? <laughs> yeah, you just yeah. Co- you coming out on and this show. I know show. I can trust. Yeah, you. Nice. I know that you have. I know you feel like yeah, it's going to stay you have therapy kind of energy. So I feel like no, yeah. I'm just asking questions. I feel safe talking. To you. Yeah, I just yeah. like to ask questions. So, I'm learning. So him, him and Tyson Fury, you know the the champ right now. Him and Tyson Fury have the same dad, but they have different moms. Yeah, because they don't look nothing alike. Nothing. Yeah, nothing. No, Tyson Fury looks like he, he looks body. just like his dad. He sounds like him too. Yeah, they look identical. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's... Oh, him and his dad look identical. No, no, no. Tyson oh, Fury and his dad. Yeah. They look, oh, they're yeah. spitting so, so he, he looks like dads. the mom then. I thought he had different dads. No. but then how would the la- yeah. how would the last name be? Yeah. I thought he was writing his brother's last name. There it is. They look. I mean, they look identical, and they talk exactly the same. Exactly the same. They talk shit all the time. Wow. Strong. Two K- they bring up Tommy Fury. Oh, damn. Mom. Look, at, look at dad. Dad the looks dad's way bigger than. Yeah. T- oh, the dad's what enormous. The fuck? They're giants. The dad, called out, the dad called out Mike Tyson. How tall is he the lo- dad? I got to know his height, man. Is, is he seven Big guy. Foot? Big guy. His dad's every bit of six. Now, wow. Tommy, now, how long do we pretend Tommy Fury's mom's not Mexican? 6'3. Six six three. Three, what? Uh, no, nah, he got to be tall than 6'3. Yeah. He's way tall than 6'3. I think Tyson was just slumping when he. When he was sitting next Tyson to his dad, like, he's like six three. Yeah, himself. No, I thought no, Tyson bigger was bigger. He's six oh, six, he's I think. Like, yeah, yeah. He's, I think he's like six six. Oh yeah, he's look at his mom. Yeah, Polynesian. Wow, she's oh, Polynesian. She's Polynesian. I don't know. I just said that, but she looks Polynesian. Well be. That, that is well <laughs> 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 Hey, look, that's oh, his mom's combo. Moana. That's cool. Moana. English. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Oh wow. He's up. He's up there, man. 
Yeah. All right. People got to get you in close. You guys are bumping. You guys are bumping. Yeah, you're all oiled touching, up. You're yeah. touching yeah. nipples right there. Everybody calm when down. When a guy's this pretty, you got to make it ugly. You got to make it ugly. Yeah. Yeah. We call them trans, uh, Transors Rex in the gym. Oh, really? Because there's little arms? <laughs> he got some short-ass arms. <laughs> really? T-Rex, as we call them. Oh, is this some short arms? Well, his arms are a full 10 inches shorter, ladies and gentlemen, I think. Yeah. So. Or at least now, now your boy Taylor's win. not on this card to um, win. to win. No, no, no. They, no, they want a knockout from we know Fury. This. Yeah. Oh, because you know, Fury, Tommy Fury, and Jake Paul have beef. So they're hoping Tommy, if this he wins this. This is what I'm saying, though. You're right, saying this yeah. guy's not here to win. Like, how do we not? That's know? boxing, though. Bro. Oh, okay. That's, it, that's what boxing does. They're trying to build Tommy Fury up. But is Jake and Woodley boxing, or he backing up already? Look at the size difference. You got to get close to him. I like the feints. He got his hands down. I think Taylor. I think Taylor oh, waited. Yeah. Well, he waited American, with quarters in his pocket. Are those the guys? Oh, you're right about this guy's arms. Yeah. Oh, oh he has extremely little short. Arms, no, yeah. I swear to God, it's like shocking. Oh, he has short. a weird body. Oh, he does look like a baby T-Rex. A little, that's what we call him. No, no, it's for real. Kind of reminds you of like Sugar Shane Mosley, right? The way he stands a little bit. No, that's what we call him in the gym, T-Rex. Oh, oh, don't sleep on him. You guys can make fun of his arms. I think you take a punch in there. Yo, do you think you can take him? You think you can take uh, T-Rex? Yeah, I, the way I move, I'm very sneaky. Yeah, I'm talking about T-Rex. I catch, I catch angles. They call me the ghost. What's they call that? you the ghost. Who's that? Yeah, because you don't see me. <laughs> well, who's the that? people, the boxing. If you're name, feeling name froggy, B, little T-Rex is up the street. Dude, I'm here. Look at my hands. Are already kind of feeling up, up, up. Okay. And when I box, I go like this. <laughs> I whistle. You, you whistle when you box. I whistle when nice. I box. That's cool. It is. He's wearing the American. Well, I guess it's British. It is British. Yeah, it is British. That's British. That's British. From the side, they look American. Oh, there you go. Slip that shot, sort of. Say hello, make oh, yourself smaller. Well, the oh, size difference keep is your hands up. Keep your hands up. See, because their game plan is if Jake were to beat Woodley, oh, you know, oh, 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 if that lands, that's trouble. Yeah, that's uh, trouble. The game plan is... Oh, he's going oh, for it he, Dude, he's close to getting it. That's probably Look at those little plan. arms. Don't yeah, work. those little body <laughs> shots. <laughs> Whoa. He's tough. I love this right now. You guys are, you guys are <laughs> sleeping on T-Rex, and that's not Whoa. right. This is dope. I'm Taylor. I apologize. This is dope. Taylor, yeah, but so Taylor. the game, the game plan is, is if Jake beats Woodley, then everyone goes, Ooh. he needs to fight a real boxer. They think, you know, they call Tommy a real boxer, so he'd fight Tommy next. Yeah. With, with yeah, that record? Smart. Yeah. With that, oh. Yeah, well, somebody's yeah. going to gas at this pace. <laughs> Everybody calm down. It's now. only four rounds. Oh. Yeah. All right, so wow. we're, bringing up, we're bringing Fury up slowly here. Bro, that guy's arms are... Oh! oh he rocked him on that. Oh, that Big shot. Good. All right. Rampage called it. He has a chin. Yeah. Bro, he has the tiniest arms in the world. Guys, it's so distracting. Maybe boxing just wasn't the sport. Please, guys. Please. <laughs> it's distractingly. Yeah. Sir, if I, if I may. He got to live inside. Look, Joe Frazier didn't have long arms either. Yeah. Long yeah. Arms that short. That's why I yeah. tell him. You got to get in there. Yeah. What's your reach, Rampage? Oh, oh. oh. he you does. When he gets in there, though, he does good. Yeah. Yeah. He has no yeah, choice. He, he gets in there. He's a bulldog. He's a bulldog. He's not a T Rex. Now, maybe on that, <laughs> that, that next Jake Paul no. card, what, would, he's would tired. we he's see up. Rampage versus uh, Shannon Briggs, do you think? What's I up? I don't, know. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know what, where's oh. going. Oh. It'd, be ni- it'd be nice. Oh, what? But um, Shannon's That's a trying, fight, he's trying man. Yeah, he's trying to. Uh, he called you out. He called me out. He's trying to promote it. He's trying to promote it himself. Dude, Who, who's this? No one will you fight know, him. Shannon that guy Briggs. slid in my DMs to try and fight me. Shannon Briggs? Yeah. He wants to box he, he you? Swear to God. He can yeah, box. I believe you. He's trying to fight anybody. Yeah, yeah he, he's been trying to fight forever. For Rampage, he's trying to fight he Wilder. To box yeah, bo- he want to box me then the MMA. I'm now talking to doing an MMA fight next after the boxing. Jeez. Oh, so, so you want, say, I'll do it if I'll you do, do MMA if you, after. If you fight me MMA. I'm tired of boxers calling us out to go box, but then they don't ever step in They won't do it. Yeah. yeah. I'm so also said, tired of seeing that shit. Yeah, he said he'll do it. Not that I'm a UFC Hey, that's that's all natural right there. He is jacked. That's all natural. He's going to be 50 soon, too. Quentin. That's natural. That's natural, baby. He 50, was very much natural, fifty though. some years old. He's, he's fifty. He, no, he, he's four, he's forty nine right now. Is he forty nine? <clears throat> all natural. thing you come all on, natural. champ. Yeah, let's Get go, him. champ. That's what he That's said. Right. I told him if I beat him in boxing, he can only say that shit once a month. <laughs> <laughs> Are you serious? I told him that damn yeah. like, I'm gonna make him. I'm gonna draw. Yo, I'm tired of hearing him, him say that shit. That's his whole brand. Yeah. That's his whole That's brand. So he funny. sells shirts. Yeah, 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 I know. No Hats, shirts. You swear you said that? I promise you. It's out there. It's out there somewhere. Yeah, right said that for sure. It's out there somewhere. That's hilarious. I'm tired of hearing that shit. Oh my God! He says it as soon as he everything, everything. Dude, everything. Dude, everything. I saw him in Florida. Same thing. We got him on the camera. Let's go, champ! God, oh no, my God! No. I, I'm pretty sure his wife tired of hearing that shit too. <laughs> dude, you got <laughs> Yo. chill out on that man. Yeah. He fucking behind God, her hitting so and shit. Like, He's like, let's go, <laughs> champ! <laughs> He's like, let's go, champ! <laughs> All right, guys. He's hitting guys it. Let's go, champ! Here it is. Come on. There's my fighter, Taylor. Let's go, Taylor. That's your guy right there. Let's go, Taylor. That's my guy right. You're talking there. about T-Rex, Taylor? I'm putting yeah, all my money on Taylor. Taylor. Come on, Taylor. I'm the dog.
He's cool. yeah, he's trying to come get over. In there. Oh, yeah, Fury's yeah. uppercut's landing though. He's getting the body. Yeah. Hey, this is the thing that y'all sleeping on though. He got Antonio McKee in his corner. Um, Antonio McKee is surprisingly uh, he can be a good boxing coach as oh, well. Oh, for sure. He, Anthony's corner. He's been yeah, in the yeah. game too long. Yeah, he's T-Rex a good, he's a good coach. T-Rex corner. Yeah, he told him. Crowd him. Okay. Well, he is. Catch his catch, Polishing those shoes on Catch the leather on your gloves <laughs> and then answer back to the body. Work his body. That's what I say. You got short like a boxing arms. coach, dude. Pretty Work. good. Oh, uh, look, he's putting his weight on him. Yeah. Uh, he's he doing a little dirty tricks. He's, he learned bullshit. it from his brother, I bet. Yeah. Damn. Look, uh, Fury doesn't look bad at all, though. Not great, though, huh? Not, not, all right, not what do you think of this matchup. Hey, not at all. hey, after seeing this, does he beat Jake Paul? <laughs> we'll find out if Jake well, we Paul. We don't know. Yeah, we, we don't know. We've yet. seen Jake now, Paul. Now, for... it could just be the conflict of styles because T Rex is doing work. Hey, like, man. He's making him work. Taylor, uh, stop calling him. He's T Rex Taylor. That's his nickname. <laughs> <laughs> That's not a bad thing. It's, it's, it's not a bad thing. It's pretty boy. Oh, oh. oh. His name oh. Is pretty he's shaking boy. his head. Bro, he's getting tired. Who gave him the nickname Pretty Boy? I think he did. He did. Hey, because he looked like yeah. that dude from New so Jack City. Did. That's why I call him. Oh. <laughs> Y'all remember that movie? Yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. Oh, 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 Yes, I am. Wow. <laughs> I mean, if you gave me a lineup of guys, I would not be like, that's pretty boy. Do you see it, though? Do you see it? Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, yeah. Damn. Look, he's cute. Oh, damn. I mean, I'm just saying. How's Tommy Fury's nickname not pretty boy? Yeah, I know. They got two pretty boys. Fighting yeah. each other. Tommy, that, those, that hair okay. on Tommy is fantastic. Uh, <laughs> That's Brandon Schaub hair, and his hair hasn't moved. Oh, dude. His hair hasn't moved. Yeah, there's some gel in that. Oh, it's a lot great. of gel. It's like cement. He's <laughs> got cement in his hair. He's yeah. got your hair, Brandon, but his hairline is a yeah. little bit. After like, watching this, Tommy has, he has such a long way to go. Really? Yeah. Oh, dude. Really? Before he You're gets seeing a lot of. I can't, I can't really tell. This guy's an MMA fighter with tiny arms. Yeah. <laughs> I, mean, I hate to keep calling it out, but... Yeah, yeah but he's tenacious, Especially if he's man. fighting at 185. Those he's boys are some killers, man. It's, he's tenacious, though. Look, he's... No, he has a heart of a... What's what's his reach? Oh, what, what's what's Taylor's reach? Oh, he's fourteen. Right fourteen. Now. <laughs> fourteen. <laughs> fourteen. <laughs> like sixty-two. Sixty-four. Sixty-two. Sixty-five. Jesus Christ! Uh, Taylor's See if we can find his reaches. Yeah. Sixty-six point five. Sixty-six. Yeah, that's not. Point five. Oh, that's shit. not good numbers. So not then, what's numbers. what's Furies? What's yeah, Furies? Let's see, let's see Furies. They say they're paying him eight grand for this fight. No, no, no. He getting paid more than eight grand. He better. Who? Uh, pretty boy. Pretty oh, he landed that was there. Good. Good, good. Oh, uh oh, oh. He's getting tired. Who, who's who's oh. winning? Is Tommy winning? Tommy's winning. But see, Currently, yeah. Okay, so Brennan, this is what I'm talking about. See, even though T Rex Taylor is he's got some boxing, he's got a lot of MMA fights, he's already getting tired. The boxing type yeah. cardio is not the same Agreed. as the MMA cardio. But, but, but remember, this is also four rounds. So no, I didn't push oh, the base. But, but what I'm talking Tommy's about is this. Tommy doesn't look like Lance I'm Armstrong talking about now. I'm talking about Woodley though. I'm gonna say something though. I'm gonna say know? something though. I uh, I could be wrong, but from what I saw of training in the gym with Tony McKee and stuff, I don't think Pretty Boy had like a straight up like boxing camp for himself. You Got know it. what I'm saying? I don't think yeah. he had a training camp for himself. Yeah. You know, I saw mean? I saw him training on on his own in the uh, gym while we was doing yeah, he just like other stuff, jujitsu and all this stuff. He's in the corner jumping rope and hitting the bat. He was doing mm-hmm. it himself. I didn't see him with no coach. Uh, I think Antonio McKee was uh, was kind of busy because AJ had just fought. Yeah, oh, I think Antonio mm-hmm. McKee was kind of busy doing some. Doing so little T Rex had like that seventies boxer camp. Yeah, I think he was doing. From what I saw, hit the, the road, days at the yeah. gym when I was there, I think he was doing it himself. I could be totally wrong. We so. can tell he's just a dog, man. Yeah. Like, he's just yeah, he's he's tough. He's the dog. reach is seventy six. Yeah, for Tommy. Jeez, yeah, so ten, ten inches. Ten inches. Right? Holy ten shit! Inches. That's a full arm. That's a full arm. Uh oh. But nice. to, for, to to Tommy Fury's defense, <clears throat> this is an awkward fight to take, man. You mean just because he the little cool arms? Out. It didn't even reach. He's not a boxer. He moves. But isn't it? Isn't it a? Isn't he in like a a good? It's like good for him because the guy's so He's much. Wave that uppercut. Oh, you see that? well, that's why he's such a big favorite. But it's just an awkward yeah. fight for him. Yeah. Like, Taylor... He'd be better if the guy was a traditional boxer because that's all he knows. Oh, when I he see spars what you're traditional boxer. This guy's small arms, yeah. moving legs. <laughs> he's arms. also an athlete. He's, he's, he just he's leads with small athlete. arms every time. He's like, <laughs> well, well, you know, yeah. it's kind of obvious. Yeah, yeah, it is yeah. what it is. Man. You got you know, you to. You know. it, it, it's, it's kind of his tool He's five six. Well, you get, so he fought uh, James Gallagher. I believe they fought at 145. Uh, for, I don't so now he's it. fighting at 180? Yeah, they, he's just a yeah. fighter. <clears throat> I mean, by the way, I think Fury's 5'11". So he, he looks a lot. This is his MMA. He lost to James Gallagher. Yeah. Got How choked out. Tommy lost Fury? to Adam Borks. Oh, they gave him some dogs in Bellator. Yeah. But he, they, yeah, they, they go were, up. He went on a streak, though. Right Hell there. yeah, dude. He's yeah. won his last one. Dude, he had that salty record of 2-4. and four, <laughs> And then just went on a streak, bro. He's won one, two, three, four, five in a row. I mean, he 
know. Yeah, he should have probably lost the Chris Avila fight. Though. But what are the heights on these two? Damn, he rear naked some dude with those arms. Oh, he got he's dropped. Tired. No, 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 he's he got a slip. Oh. Slip. But he's so tired. He's so tired. He's slipping. He was late. Damn. That was a slip. That's not fair. Come on, Taylor. Five seven. Five seven. Five six. He rear naked choked somebody. I think it was five six and a half, guys. Tommy. Uh, Tommy is uh, six two. Six no, foot. He's six, five eleven. Six, six foot. Feet, yeah. Six. God, that Love Island he looks like fucking he's Shrek. Got, he's got long <laughs> arms. Long arms, Tommy. I mean, Tommy Fury. Yeah. It's tough when your brother's the boxer in the world. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, I mean, like your brother's impressive. Tyson Fury. The fucking. Would you rather be Tyson greatest. Fury? Or would you rather look like him? <laughs> <laughs> That's the option. You know what? I'd rather be Tyson Fury. Yeah, yeah. Tyson Tyson. Fury's banking yeah. account. Oh, he's banking I'd way rather be Tyson. I know, but I, I, it, it would be nice just to look that good all the what time. What do you think just this guy's week, making? Maybe just for a just week. What do you think this guy's making? I've been ugly my whole life. I want to know how, what it's like to be a pretty boy. <laughs> what do you think Tommy Fury's making? All the women come here. You get to hang out at the Vegas pool, you know, with your shirt off all the time. And women just come up to you. Yeah, just for one week, maybe. I agree. Just a temporary. I agree. Nah, I probably wouldn't trade back then. Yeah. Just walk around like what? This little. That's a good question, though. Because it, it's not like Tyson Fury is easy on the eyes. You know what no, I'm saying? No, he's not. His body <laughs> that is, is a good question. His, his body is, but, is there, you know. But, <laughs> but this kid. Damn. Well, apparently God gave one a ton of boxing skill and the other a ton of looks. You know what I'm <laughs> there you go. There you go. Damn, man. What's he's not bad, though. I'm shocked at how far this has gone, though. I, I, Tommy, me too. Tommy yeah. Fury's still in there, man. See, well, Tommy, I'm shocked that Taylor's still in there. He should have went to acting, not boxing. You know, you look look really good. You're going to acting or something. He might. Like that. I bet that's gonna happen. You know what I'm saying? Someone's gonna offer. Well, he was on role. fucking like, Love Fuck Island. This boxing thing. Yeah. He was on he's Love so, Island. Yeah. So that show Love Island in America, it's whatever. In the UK, it's huge. Bro. Yeah. There's like 90 episodes and like millions and millions of people yeah. watch it. Yeah. So he makes like millions of dollars off his Instagram. Yeah, it ain't shit to do in the UK. So I'm sure this show yeah, is yeah. Yeah. real, real popular. Fucking rains nine months, rains 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 nine months out Island. of the year and yeah. the food's horrible. Yeah. Fuck. Yeah. Yeah. It ain't well, shit to do. Well, he's from Manchester too. That's a tough part of the UK. Oh, it's nice out there. Well, my girl follows him. That's fine. Yo. That's way, funny. That's fucking, <laughs> fuck, it's funny as fuck. <laughs> so Yo, this is the best part of the show. That, he sees the name on. That would bother me. <laughs> How you know your girl <laughs> Yo, it says it right there. Oh, right wow. There. Look, look, yeah. look, 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 look. The one with <laughs> Joanna <laughs> Zanella Shaw. Yeah, uh, <laughs> that shit just totally comedy, threw you under. Dude. You can't make this shit Come up. on, T-Rex. <laughs> 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 but you know what? Wow. God bless. Wow. Your girl. Oh, oh man. I have talking to her. It's all right, Brennan. Yeah, yeah, that's that's right. Right. That's you know how girls great. get mad when you, follow, when you follow hot chicks and like their pictures? Yeah, if I was following some hot chicks, you'd yeah. freak the fuck out. But you know out. what? Bobby? He's, he basically could be your younger, better-looking brother. Yeah, I'd beat the shit out of him. But, you know what yeah. I mean? Yeah. You dog that guy. What? Dude, next to him, though, I look like... Well, he's your younger, I look like better, a he's your younger brother, and he's like, this is my looker brother. Yeah. He's he's like, well, you're good looking too, but yeah. But, but not com compared to him. All, that's what I mean. You guys could be brothers. Same skin tone, <laughs> I'm same like hair. a Chrysler 300. He's like a real Rolls Royce. Royce. <laughs> you're, you're fine, but he's just, yeah, he's, he's a cutie pie. And you're, <laughs> you're a big daddy, and he's a cutie pie, and that's how it is. Don't and be that's big all right. daddy. I don't want to be big daddy. <laughs> well, you're becoming yeah. big daddy. You're, oh, you're enormous, and there's nothing I'm wrong with that. Daddy. You're <laughs> rich. <laughs> thick daddy. You're rich. You're big. Yeah. And you're getting, you know, you're getting up there. I'm getting older. That's yeah, all. God bless. Yeah, he's better looking, man. Nothing wrong with being big daddy. Scott I mean, accepted. You seen his girl, Molly May? I've not. They won the show. Uh, they didn't win the show, but they came in second. His girl, guess, Molly May, is easy on the eyes. Okay. Bring her up, chin, so they know what's going on. There she is. Very blonde. I would have guessed. Well, I'm about to follow her now. Okay. <laughs> uh, it's only right. It's only fair. It's only fair. It's only fair. Equality. I get fair. one dime piece follow. Look at yeah. them. Look at that gorgeous couple. Yeah, yeah, it's a beautiful couple. Guy, what are you wearing? Under Armour? I mean, dude. <laughs> Shoulders for days. You think she's in the crowd right now? You think what? You think she's in the Oh, what was that? Oh, oh, go back, no, no, no. Go back sure. to that last. Oh, no. Yeah. Ugh. I know what you're going to say. What the fuck? Yeah. Dude, oh, my you, you, God. So you, you know what the thing about uh, the she UK? She's not hot. I'm sorry. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Well, not that picture, she's not. No, fucking, another picture, she is. No, she's a baddie. That's all the plastic surgery. No filter on her. No, 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 that's the best. That's Quinn's right. That's the real her, though. That's yeah. the one you're going to oh wake up next to. That's the problem. Imagine having kids with that. No, no. So she had a jaw on her, right? Before, uh, when she was on the show. She had, she had, she had all the jaw. This show is because. No, she looked like Quagmire. Yeah, here's the thing. Quagmire. But no, so. Giggity? She looked like Giggity? Yeah. She had that jaw. She had but when you go, there, look at her face there. So oh, when you go on the show, oh. she looks like a Dick Tracy character. But when you I'm go on the angry. show, please let's not. The, do when this. you go on the show, <laughs> they they give you like doctors give you plastic surgery. Like at, when you get off, they give you all these offers to do plastic oh. surgery. What? So everyone who comes off it is promotes a dime brand because it promotes the doctors. Yeah. So they all get this free plastic. Look at her now. She's very pretty. Look at her now. She got her jaw. She's removed. so pretty. She's
You think Tommy had plastic surgery too? No. no. <laughs> he said that's so proud. To kill I, know, that shot. I know. He defended his boyfriend, <laughs> nah. bro. Nah, man. Nah, man. On, man. Never, that's about too my man far, like man. That. Yeah, he jumped. He jumped yeah. on that. <laughs> Fuck no, he didn't. Huh. Come on, pretty boy. Don't fall, pretty boy. <clears throat> How much time? Twenty seconds left. I'm surprised that, that yeah, come on, his Taylor, eyes. I know. Get him off the screen. How did Taylor not get hypnotized by his eyes? Tommy, just look in his eyes, bro. Stare him down. Yeah. Like, come oh, on, pretty boy. Let us some good shots. Thirteen seconds of your life. Man, you know what? Taylor's game, and he did a great yeah, job. Yeah, he, he's a, he's a dog. He's man. Yeah, he's tired. He's, yeah, he's a dog, but he did a good job. My decision, Tommy Fury. <clears throat> yeah, yeah, you know. Tommy yeah, Tommy won. Here it goes. Decision. Caught him. So that's not the best outcome for Tommy. But he'll, he'll, even if he wins, if Jake wins. That's gonna be Jake's next fight, I bet. Yeah, yeah, that would be it. fucking. And then I, that'd Jake be so would so lame. Probably beat his ass. That'd be, yeah, of course, it'd be lame as fuck. But Tommy's a real like boxer. Yeah, but you go from fucking Woodley to this guy. That's that's fucking stupid, dude. And he has a huge name in the UK too. Yeah, well, I mean, that's what I'm saying. It's, this shit is all about that. Oh yeah, it's not. That's it's what I'm. Eyeballs. That's why I'm so convinced. That's beef, what it's about. Beef? Can Tommy talk? Uh, Jake just talked shit about him. And Tommy's like, dude, keep keep my name out of your mouth. Like even at the press conference. And can they? Does Tommy talk trash? Is oh he, yeah, he's, he's good. Oh no, he's not great on the mic. He's right. not like his brother. Yeah. His brother's the I his think the best of all time. I agree. Him he's and Muhammad Ali, Ali and him. Yeah. yeah. Do you think so? His brother could host a late-night talk talk show. Like, Tyson Fury's a monster. Hey, he look kind of like Tyson Fury. (laughs) A little bit. Yeah, a little bit. A more narrow face. But a better-looking one. Mm. Yeah. Yeah. Tyson's face is a little... You're right, though. You guys could be related. Yeah, you guys could be. Yeah, you might be related, huh? I mean, yeah. your guys' bodies Maybe. are exactly like. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> sure. We got the same. Yeah, right. yeah, right. Josh, do you still train a lot? Or yeah, I own gym, so I have to. I, still, I have to train with my students, oh, members, that shit like Jiu-jitsu that. Jiu-jitsu mostly, or? Uh, no, I do. I own a fitness gym, then I own a martial arts gym, so I do kickboxing, jiu-jitsu. What's and the fitness gym? Just all fitness. I do like hit training, boot camp style. Did That's you cool. watch? Yeah. Did you watch the Kevin Lee? Uh, uh, yep, Rodriguez. No, yeah, no, yeah. not that one. The, the Giga, <clears throat> the Giga Barbosa. Yeah, Barbo- yeah. Giga, Giga has a very interesting style he's he's gonna be his background for anybody yeah, yeah he's all anybody, kickboxing anybody who wants to stand a bang with that guy's gonna have some trouble yeah i i completely yeah there it is so i completely out um i, I didn't think i didn't think he was gonna be as fast as barbos i thought barbos was kick oh, i thought his boxing was yeah he was way faster and then but then big john when i was talking with big john the, last night about it was that when he wasn't worried about the takedown didn't matter right didn't matter what was going on. So like he he didn't, like normally he's worried about everyone trying to take him down. He didn't have to worry about, about Giga. that. Yeah, Giga. Yeah. So then he knew Barboza was just gonna stand with him the whole time. So that's mm-hmm. all he had to do. Yeah. Just he just got into his kickboxing stance and he was good. Right. He was on point. Boxing. Did, did, uh, did you watch the Rodriguez Kevin Lee fight? Yes, I did. What, and I was I was with my kids, so I'd see some of it. But from I thought Kevin Lee kind of won the fight. I thought the he, take I don't think he won he the got fight. Rocked, I don't though, think right? he caught. I don't think he touched Rodriguez. He didn't punch. Not him. He, really. I know good, Rodriguez. Good takedowns. Do you watch take it? I watched it. I thought yeah. it was. It should have been a split, maybe. I don't a think split. So. A split. Not, not Rodriguez. Rodriguez, right? Rodriguez yeah, was yeah, catching. Yeah. Yeah. Rodriguez I was. was I mean, catching. from what I saw, I was fine. Rodriguez win, but uh, when I was looking at TV, I'd see Kevin Lee with takedowns. I'm like, that's weird. As far as the sport, of MMA, I think it should have been a split. Yeah. Yeah. Not not a UD. Well, he he took him down a lot, and but but I think that Rodriguez got the better of him punching wise he yeah did. but that doesn't mean you win the fight yeah but your takedowns don't win you fights either though that's the issue yeah you and know, like, Lee if caught you him. get taken down takedowns do win fights but no yeah. they that's gsp they they no, they they do but in terms of the damage now because now after gsp left before he beat bisping when he left the, after that they started changing and making sure that the that the judges understood the rules a little bit better it's all about damage being first we've had this conversation yeah you know and that's the thing yeah, big, big john's john big john's down. made it very clear that it's the damage that has to come first takedowns don't win you around mm-hmm. sure the, it's significance where you're taking your if it's the only thing that happens around then yes it, it will win you the round but you, you have to have the damage you take them down yeah, yeah. <clears throat> you've got you've got to do damage so not when so then rodrigo is definitely win the fight i would say that i would kevin say that kevin damage, lee, kevin lee did, might be a little bit just a little bit small for that but he's too big. he can't make the and struggles then, and then he's too big for 55, 55 so he's, he's gonna win he's that tweener he needs a 65 yeah he's yeah. that tweener yeah he's the, he's the he's the cowboy cerrone he's that that yeah. kind of thing he's only 28 man but he, yeah. he's coming off that knee surgery, I think. Yeah, but, but the issue with him, though, is that he has – I'm a huge fan before yeah. I get into it. I love Kevin, I'm, I love Kevin uh, Lee. I'm a huge fan. Yeah. His brother's a dog, too. His brother his brother fights in Bellator, Keith Lee. He's a dog, too. But he's got a little bit of that mental midget kind of thing going on right mm. now because of his confidence. Ch- the confidence thing's yeah. going on. Is, is there, there a, a live chat anywhere? 
I, I thought he was in the in that fight the whole way with so, Rodriguez. Rodriguez, Rodriguez is a fucking anywhere. nightmare. No, yeah, he's good. He should have gone short notice. <clears throat> yeah. If you give him a full camp, he finishes. All due respect. Yeah, without with all due respect. Without due respect. With all due respect. You can say whatever you want. Yeah, because he just has that, right? Rodriguez is Rodriguez is one of those guys. Go. You're right, man. You're right, though. Hey, but with all due respect. <laughs> I think Rodriguez did he start as a boxer because his boxing looks slick. He's with Joe Schilling. Yeah, he's oh, with that he camp. Okay. Yeah, yeah, he's a dog, man. Oh, hey, so um, I see Ariel's there. Yeah. How's that going over? And I'm here. No, 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 no. But how's how that? How do you think he got the job? <laughs> but how's that going? I don't want to do it. I, you know, I, you know, God bless them. I, I don't know. You know, Showtime does their thing. I do my thing, man. Yeah. I'm here. I'll see my bed tonight. I'm with you guys. Those Rampage, boys, you those like boys are in Cleveland. Yeah, oh, yeah, yeah, Cleveland. I, I, I like Ariel sometimes. Sometimes I just see you. Quinn, Quinn and I have the same feel for him. I like him. I, I, he just, you know, he likes to p- yeah. kind of yeah. kind of yeah. prop people. He's a, a good bit. journalist, though. Isn't he, he's not bad. He's yeah. not bad. Yeah. I mean, if, if we're gonna say MMA has, if there's gonna be a a, a good MMA journalist, I would say he's up at the top. Yeah. Of him, yeah. him, Luke Dave Thomas. Meltzer. He asked. I like Luke too. I yeah. like Luke. I like Luke also. I, when I say he got me sued from doing the interview, I'm telling the, the fucking truth. I got oh. sued. I, I got, he broke me up with. Uh, a girlfriend. <laughs> I remember that. Wait, interview, and he got me sued. <laughs> what? This guy, millions Ariel. of dollars. Ariel won. Wow. Did you lose the lawsuit? I settled. I uh, settled. I could have won the lawsuit, but I settled. Talk about this. I, I can't say much, yeah. but oh, I can say. Yeah. But I can say I got. I can say I. I, I From got sued. Ariel's interview, because of the questions. Because the question he asked me, and oh, I, I fight him. And I and I no, no, no. It wasn't <laughs> that. It was. It was. It was a. Per, it, was a right it was a person that sued me. They saw the interview and they sued me for. De- what you, what you call De- it? Defamation, defamation character. character. Yeah. You, is this wow. like the official call out? You can call him out right now. No, I don't <laughs> want to call him. Out. He, I, I want him to pay me back the money that he, I paid though. That I lost. Uh, well, hopefully Showtime. That's, that's that was a three. That was like a three million dollar um, interview. Fuck. Oh, damn. Dude. Dude. What the? With huh? attorney fees and. Does he know? Well, he, he's yeah, I told him because I, I had this the one attorney that um, my cousin hooked me up with, took the case, didn't do the fucking job, and then. I went and hired another attorney a week before trial. He dropped me in and he wrote an email or something to the judge and said, oh, um, he, he didn't pay me and um, he's uncooperative. Like oh, the guy wow. never, then that guy never. You had no communication with no, him? No, no communication. Then I hired this big firm. They knew they had me by the balls because, you know, it was trial. You needed So they took my case and everything. Then they told me, I'll just settle. Wait, so Josh and Rampage, how do you feel about when Ariel did the whole Brock Lesnar thing? What you, I don't know he announced mean. the Brock Lesnar fight, yeah, from on the UFC. Oh yeah, good. Da- him and Daniel were kind of like pretty him. cool. So they were doing the UFC 200, right? Yeah, yeah. And Brock was yeah. gonna be Brock was gonna come was in. Big yep. announcement, huge announcement. big announcement. So that's why Dana didn't like him because so he announced it before, and they were cool yeah. before. Uh, Dana gave him a bunch of interviews and all that stuff. He was like the so he did that. Moto before, yeah. you know. And he told him, hey, just don't say it, but that he still did it. He still did it. That's kind of like yeah. Journalists, they like they want the big scoop. Yeah, but that's why he got fired. Yeah, it's like bro, they don't like Like they asked, we said we asked you not to do this, so it's like. Now you have, you know, it, that's it, why I like Brett though. Brett's he's awesome, man. I like the way he. I like the, the way he breaks things down. They're all the same. <laughs> you think so? They've never fought. They're all the same. <laughs> oh my god! It's like a weatherman to me. <clears throat> you know what I'm saying? Doppelganger. Er, Ariel, er, he yeah, won't yeah. interview you if uh, on certain subjects. If you you've already done that interview, you know what I'm saying? If some say something big happened or something, and you went on someone else's and show, then, and then, yeah, and you and you do an interview like I. He, he he don't like the interview if you if you already done it you do it with him first so he don't want to do it that's why mm-hmm. I, that's why I, I pretty much yeah learn oh <clears throat> this kid this kid's the real deal AJ AJ, AJ oh, yeah. he's, a beast. he's the real fucking deal oh yeah I thought you were talking he about he just Logan doesn't Paul. have a ton of energy <laughs> yeah, that's, 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 like, as far as, as like <laughs> wait as being like, on like show like as far as marketing <clears throat> oh yeah he doesn't have a ton of energy yeah AJ you don't think so uh uh-uh. uh. I mean, he's I, such a talent, though. I don't so think good. it's going to matter. He's so good. He's man. such a talent. In yeah. boxing or anything? MMA. Any, yeah, he I, boxing. He's the world champion. He, Bellator. I did not know He's that. the guy. He's the guy that I would say if it was going to make a change over to boxing, yeah. even though he's a talented he wrestler, wants to. he could. He really he's, wants to. He's got Why the is speed, everyone talking the about, reach. The, he's got power. Why is everyone talking about Man Dragon? Because that's Brian Smith right there. Oh, they're saying Man Dragon. They're talking about the roar, though. They want to. Well, that's because I'm, the, I'm. They want to see the roar. I can't just give. You can't, I can't do that anytime. Just give it to. You got to earn it. You got to earn it. Yeah. I can't. If, oh, okay. if Woodley Maybe. wins, he'll do it. If Woodley, if Woodley wins, wins, I'll do the man it. dragon. Okay. I'll what, do the what roar. You promise. You, you promise. Breathe fire, man, and uh. it's scary. Chin, promise. Chin, yeah, is this? Uh, okay. Oh, this okay. AJ. AJ, yeah. AJ, yeah. AJ. I got you, Chad. I love it. Brandon was like, now that nickname's never gonna stick. Now anywhere I go, they do. Man dragon. And now your nickname's man dragon. I'm the man dragon now. So the two worst nicknames in the world is T Rex and Man Dragon. Dear sir. 
Sir? They're really excited about this. Okay, I'm just well, telling you right guys, now. Well, Woodley has to win. Guys, we're very have to excited win. about this. <gasps> wait, wait, don't you can't do it. I'm getting you warmed it. up. Okay. Okay. <laughs> okay. Oh, fuck, I'm dude, sorry, it's going to be big. I apologize. Why are you sitting next to a man? I, I apologize. Yeah, what if he catches on fire? Scary. Scary. Oh, he doesn't have the hair. Don't worry. Yeah. I got you. I got you. I'll okay. breathe it this way. Yeah. Okay. It's so scary, dude. You want to switch spots? I got fire in my belly. It might go across. Dude, they love this. It's hilarious. They, no. love they love it. Yeah, that's I, wish I, hear what, I, I wish I could hear what I love that kid. I've been yeah. knowing him since he was like three years oh, he's old. He's great, dude. He's yeah. a great Man, kid. Yeah. He, His he's dad's just, a badass, too. Oh, yeah. He's that kid, he, he, watch, watch, mark my word. He's going to be a legend. Really? He's what? One I don't of the know best. Who's going to really beat him? He I fights at what, 70? What's he fighting no, at? 55. No, no. 45. Yeah, he'll 45. fight at 45 now, yeah. But he's going to go to 55, I think, now. I think he's going to uh, do... I think right, he's like, was he heavyweight? I think, I think he's going to... I think that fight he just had was the 35, wasn't it? No, it's a 45. 45. He just won the title against Patricio at 45. Oh, okay. Now he's going to go to 55? He's going to fight one more time, I think, to defend his title one time, and then he's going to go to 55. Uh, to be honest, I never watch Bellator. I need to start. I never do. A lot of people don't. And I'm going to ask... I'm going to ask... Is, is Aaron Pico... Still he's making his comeback. He's, he's making his comeback. Making his he, comeback. He he's on. He, he's on a. Uh, he's a, on a terror right now. Yeah, he, he should be. He's, he's awesome. He Redemption. Got, he got with Greg Jackson's camp, okay. and they have shaped him and made him the fighter that he should have been before he fought. He was wrestling at 16 years old. He was wrestling on an international level. No, no I know this. I, I know he was. He was managed by Bob, my, my same oh, okay. manager. Bob I Cook. love Aaron Pico. Yeah, he's he's phenomenal, man. man. Like put it this way: when he fought, I'm gonna start. I'm going to start. I, it's no, not tell us why you don't watch it. Yeah, no, I just want to know. Yeah, why don't you I ask watch questions it? because I'm curious. No, because I'm remiss. Because remiss. I've been remiss and I deserve to be called out hey, for you it. You want me to answer? What does remiss mean? Because he's a, he's a UFC guy. He said, uh, what does remiss mean? <laughs> he's a UFC guy because. Default. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Mm. If I know the fighters, but there are a lot of fighters I know in Bellator that I should watch. Oh, yeah? Like who? Like uh, uh, Rory McDonald. That, that would be one. He's in PFL. He is in PFL. But keep going. He is in PFL right now. Yeah, but just keep going. Well, Lima. The Lima brothers. Which one though? The one who <laughs> fucked yeah. Rory McDonald, yeah. who, who fucked up Rory's leg. Uh, what's his I first know which name? is his first name. Yeah, because you know, there's guy. one in the UFC and there's one right. Bellator. Ricardo. Something no, like that. no, Douglas. Douglas. Wow, Douglas wow. <laughs> no, Ricardo. Ricardo's his something nickname, like that. But I gave him his nickname. Oh, that makes sense. Way. You know, okay, like yeah, okay. Right. yeah. And then okay. there's uh, you know other guys. For example. <laughs> 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 Quentin, Quentin, remiss. <laughs> oh, okay. There you go. Lacking care or attention, <laughs> Lacking care or attention to duty. Uh, remiss. I, I don't think I've ever heard that word. Hey, word you, you, know, you, know, you know how? Is it an old English yeah. word, like from UK? It's like an old man word. Oh, okay. Yeah. It's an old man it's, word. It's an old man word. It was in fashion when I was young, when I was your age. You know how all this YouTube stuff ends? It's going to end no matter what happens to Jake Paul tonight or in the next fight. He could lose two in a row. It's going to end with Logan and Jake fighting each other, and that would be the biggest thing. Yeah. They're going to fight each other. I, if they're smart, they will. They, oh, they're going to do it. They're going to do it. Man. That's the fight. Yeah. All so, the so, so about that. I think you were telling me the last... So which one got famous for doing a video of somebody hanging from a tree in Japan? Logan. Logan, yeah. Logan. He was famous before that. He got all yeah. the hate off He was that. very famous yeah. before that. Mm-hmm. He was famous before Hold on, that. Time out, time See, exactly. What, See? What, wait, wait. What kind of hanging from a tree are we See? talking about? There's well, a forest in there's Japan. Oh, you didn't hear about this? Where people go and commit suicide. See, I didn't hear about yeah, it either until so someone told me here. Yeah, and so and he, he went to a forest, and in the background you could see a blurry, a young man who would, was hanging from a tree. It wasn't and in the background. It was it in the floor. They were full like on here, filming it. You could see that. You could see that it was blurred out, but Jake was kind of. Yeah. And we, we oh. talked no, about it. No, he, uh, uh, this Logan. is Logan. 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 What did, what did he do? Logan was like 21. He was like making. Oh, like, yeah. it's right here. It's it was right here. a clumsy mistake. It was a very the clumsy The guy was mistake. dead already? Yeah, because yeah. in this forest, people Suicide go to like. Forest. Right. I heard about that yeah. forest. Yeah. yeah, it was a very clumsy. Look at his hat. It was a learning experience Jeez. for him, I think. What happened to him? What happened? He got a lot of hate dude, from there? Oh, dude, he got. Yeah. I think he got kicked off YouTube for a little bit. And he kind of got like canceled and then came back. Yeah. Yeah. And now, like, he now he does his. Uh, podcast impulsive mm-hmm. and he's gotten older like people realize he's like an actual human being yeah. and mm-hmm. a piece of shit yeah. he was young he was 21 yeah you know he made a clumsy 20 million dollars in the bank so he got canceled before the cancel culture yeah. yep yep damn yeah. how you do that <laughs> <laughs> yeah, when you're on youtube yeah. for long enough yeah. Well, it was like he he was filming like every vlog was hey, crazy. What is he wearing? Did like Stonewall jeans come back in style? Is this what this is? It kind of pulls him off. Wow. But that's the thing with youtube, right? It's like it's always what's next. What because you well, do a video and it's what's next. What's next? Yes. The, the, the one thing I'll say about the bro, the the Paul brothers, without doubt, they have a crazy work ethic. You oh, know? there's no and doubt I, about and that. I, and I think were they both standout wrestlers in high school in Ohio? Or no, just, just Logan. Just Logan. Just Logan. Yeah. Athletes. He was a two. It was a two-time I mean, state placer, yeah. I think. 
is yeah. what he was. Oh, he's a wrestler? Yeah. Why yeah. he don't do MMA? Because they know more well, than MMA. Actually, guys. Showtime yeah. signed him to the, the, the potential of him fighting one MMA fight. I don't know where, but Showtime signed him, so it must be in Bellator. But uh-huh. they're talking about him and Dylan Danis, which is a horrible matchup for him. Mm. He, he gets starched by Dylan. Well, I don't know if Dylan, Dylan, Dylan can take him down. His knees off. Yeah, but he's got a better takedown defense. I mean, he Dylan's leg off. He that's true. I agree. I, I would, I would agree with you. Yeah, I agree with you. Logan? Logan. In what? MMA. In MMA? Yeah. How's he going to deal with Dylan Danis' jiu jitsu? He's got better wrestling, hoping he can stop. Excuse me? I'm just saying. Dylan just jumped Don't don't kill the messenger, man. (laughs) I doubt they do that. He's a high school. He's not doing shit against Dylan Danis on the ground. No. No, he's not going to take him down. I'm saying he's just going to stuff the takedowns and get away and not box him. Dylan Danis got no stand up. But. Okay. Like this, like this. But if he cu- if he grabs a hold of you, it's going to be a big That's problem. A, yeah. Like no, I agree with you. I agree. It's not it's not a good matchup. It's not a good matchup. But do, yeah. do you feel do you feel pressure? How you have to always like one up shit? Damn. Like even your crate challenge. You're like, oh, yeah. everybody doing crate challenge, and this fucking dude does the crate challenge. Then he's holding weights, eating. Did yeah, it all I mean, it's it's social media. It's just like that's kind of the name of it. You do something crazy. It's not like necessarily one up every time. It's just something different. Yeah, you know. But for sure, that era of YouTube, where he was making a new video like every week, and it was crazier, and he was growing so fast. Yeah. I, I mean, I'm not saying why he got there was like it's a it was like at all a good thing, but he definitely kept that momentum and it just hit something that he thought was going to be crazy and it went and it went sad because when he started that video i don't know if you guys realize but when he started that video he filmed the whole video and then filmed the intro to the video which was him being like i did the craziest thing ever you guys are never going to believe this never been done before like he he knew he had done that there was no and remorse then, and then filmed the crazy video about how he's like the number one youtuber in the world and he's doing something that's never been done and then that was what it was. Wow. So it was like, it wasn't just but, some but shit what, that happened. But Bradley, like, I don't know in the background. What was the point of that? Like, I went to this forest where people commit suicide. How's that a video? It, well, this right. is my point, right? Like, I'm not saying it was a good video. Obviously, it was terrible. and it, it But he got so much attention. Point. But yeah, it, it, I don't know. He must have done it and had something in his mind at, at, at the younger age that, like, this is the craziest thing that's ever been done on the internet. Because if you saw like that going video. going to that forest? That's what I'm saying. I'm saying the beginning of that video, he he filmed the video, and then you could tell he filmed an intro afterwards and was like, this is one of the craziest things. I'm doing something no YouTuber has ever done. Like, he self-proclaimed all that and then got taken down by, obviously, the whole world that they filmed a dead body to hang your body. And I know he's grown so much from it since, but it was that necessity, like, I got to keep going. I got to do something crazier and crazier because that's how all his vlogs were, and that's how YouTube was at that point. But did you do crazy stuff before that one? Yeah, I mean, he did he crazy shit all the time. Right? Like, he, he like, of... would smash plates and do kind of wild shit, and his audience was very young, right? So, like, so they liked, like, <clears> smash the wild shit. Too. It was very fast-paced, like, high energy. Yeah, the everything. editing and all that. Yeah, everything. So it was just on this, like, mo- it's a steamroll, like, momentum, and it just hit, like, a pinnacle, a peak yeah. that was not a good one. Yeah. And then it crushed him, and then now he's come back, obviously, in a way different way, and, it, he, and he's, he's great at this podcast and everything. Yeah, he's really good. But that video was interesting, because I remember watching and being like, what the fuck? Like, why would you self-proclaim all that shit? Yeah. You and don't then, know you're gonna get canceled. Though. No, yeah, oh, no. It, it's not like you didn't yeah. think like you, you just thought it was gonna be like lit. Yeah, yeah. So it's crazy. This him throwing. But what's up with Dylan Danis trying to fight everyone though? But he never fights. <laughs> that guy talked shit to me. I said, "Pull up to my gym right now. We'll fight on the fucking street." Yeah. <laughs> Dylan Danis. Yes. Yeah, I would imagine. <laughs> yeah. but, I, but he yeah. never shows up. He's good. He just he just doesn't really fight. Good at yeah, he He's just like doesn't fight class. though. He's Who wins in a class. street fight? Me or Dylan Danis? Dude, why you gotta do this? I never see that. I never see you fight. Don't fight Dylan Danis. He's good on the ground. No. He's really good. World class on the ground. Yeah, yeah world he'll, class. He'll do whatever he wants to. Yeah. Real quick. You think so? Yeah. The Rogami didn't pull to my gym. Have you ever done any fighting? I dabble. Okay, so dabble. He, he dabbled. That guy made his life fighting. I promise you. Well, yeah. Have jiu-jitsu. you rolled with any? Well, I don't know about fighting. Yeah, he's made his life jiu-jitsu. training jiu-jitsu. Yeah. He made his black life belts, jiu-jitsu. 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 not fighting. He made his life jiu-jitsu. jiu-jitsu, not fighting. Like again, he's good. He's good though. But his he's had. But what's his body weight? Yeah, it doesn't matter about. It I, absolutely matters. I've wrestled with a fucking. Uh, uh, I've done Brazilian Jiu Jitsu with a black belt who's 180, how and long? I could pick him up and slam him on the ground like a kid. Really? How long have you wrestled and stuff? You've done a lot of Jiu Jitsu. I just dabbled in it, but like I'm talking about a black belt, Edwin sure. at Tarzana, Gracie Bar. I'm gonna just say guy way. Who knows? I don't know. About 180. He's in the gym. He's more than 180. Yeah, T. Uh, not T. Wood, but uh, 200. Doing the, the guy who, who comes to zoo, the black belt. No, no, no. There's a guy. There's, there's, there's Sam. That guy fucks me up. Okay. But there's a smaller guy, black belt, crazy at jujitsu, mm-hmm. and like he fucked me up if I'm on the floor playing with him. But like he got me wrapped up. I can smash him on his head instantly. Yeah. But I'm yeah, not doing it because we're fighting with like cars and shit. You and Dylan. I'm Dennis. talking about on the street. I think yeah. Dylan Dennis <clears throat> will take your arm off. How, I think. I think. I, I, I think. I think with a guy your size, he's going right for your ankles, your yeah, legs. No, he's he going right to leg. Or your neck. If, or his neck. Nah, be tough uh, to he's gonna be hard to get to his neck. Well, you know, jujitsu was invented for the smaller guys. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 I mean, I don't know. I, 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 I think, I, I think, I think he's going
Yeah, but Rampage, it's on my channel. Yeah, but Rampage is <laughs> <his> fucking. <laughs> Not too good. Yeah, but he's a world, <laughs> he's a, a Hall of Fame. Fighter. But I was, I was different. I was different at that moment. That's the only time I ever lost my temper in a fight. It's a when backstory. you picked him up and slammed. There's a backstory behind it. If you watch that video and you pause at the right it's time, so I, I come off the ground. Yes, yeah, I remember that. It's yeah. nuts. I lost so, my temper. So, I didn't so, care just about his safety. Just for context, he was fighting Pride, and this guy Ricardo Arona, who's a black belt, got him in a, in a triangle choke, and he. Yeah. Picks him up off the mat, jumps in there and goes, "Hoo Right here, right here, right here. No, I remember this. Well, so you're, you're, you're not allowed to do this. No, no, it's, it's, it's no legal, you are. but no one's ever seen it at no this time. We, this they try no to one ever seen this. Yeah, they try to get it. They this try guy's, to make it. It's like one of the best knockouts in this history guy's of a MMA. Beast too. They try to make it. Uh, the, they, those guys try to get me like fined and everything from it for this. Why, why for this you, move, for Rampage. This move. Why were you so mad here? What happened? It, uh, to, I'm gonna shorten up. I'm gonna shorten up the story. He had, he had did something to piss me off. He backed out of a fight when I got to Japan. And I had to fight Murillo Bustamante, mm -hmm. and no one to, no one told me about Bustamante's that. He's a monster. And then when we was in the That's fight, right, right here, he he healed he heals me in the face, and he um, dislocates my jaw. Right. Damn. So he's like healing me in the face. So I go down. He tells the referee right here. Oh, right, right here. there. Yeah. yeah. Look, Damn. I, look Whoa. at me. Look at me. I cut down and cover. He tells the referee I'm knocked out, right there, and the private referees hated me. Yeah, yeah. they could have called that fight, and that's a tournament. You know, so I could have lost that fight because of that, and that pissed me off when he did that. He told the referee I was right knocked now. Out. Your jaw's dislocated right now. Oh yeah, my my jaw dislocated. So, so that night so I had this to try to watch. This, this, is like, this is what I'm oh, saying. Damn. This is how the black belt jujitsu guy felt. Damn, like. literally felt like. God, damn. I remember this. This changed a lot of this. I remember everybody was like. Triangles don't work against some guys. Nah. If they're strong enough, look what Rampage did. This was crazy. I remember. If this. you if you pause at the right time, I come off Damn. my feet. I was really mad at this guy because the referees they used to always give me yellow cards. They cheated me when I fought uh, Vandalay Silva. Uh, yeah. When I you remember I fought that tournament. Yeah. Mm -hmm. This, this is, I'm gonna tell you guys something. When Chuck Liddell came over to Pride, I had, they had a meeting with me. Uh, Pride, the, the, rep, the representative Pride came. They said, "Look, Chuck Liddell's coming over from the UFC." And they said, oh, we made a bet with Danny. We got a lot of money. This, we got a lot of money on this fight. You need to uh, fuck Chuck Liddell up. I said, yeah, but you know, I got to fight Vanderlei Silva next because y'all gave Vanderlei Silva some some judo guy. And, and my dumb ass, I was young. I told him my game plan. I said, all right, I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna fuck Chuck Liddell up. But when I fight Vanderlei, I'm gonna have to take him down and ground a pound. Is is going you know it's gonna be a different fight. Yeah. I'm gonna ground a pound and I'm and I'm gonna fuck him. And you guys go back and watch that fight. When I, I took Vanellay down, ground and pound, like I just had a fucking war with Chuck Liddell. Yeah. Forty five minutes before, and I'm and I'm beating up Vanellay. I told him my game plan. I'm beating him up on the ground. They give me a yellow card, say I'm stalling, yeah. and I wasn't even stalling. I was beating yeah. him up. Yeah, so corrupt. I was, be, I, so I, was he, I was getting ready to knock him out. So what's the, why would they be like? Ten, so they want, they, oh, yeah, okay. and they wanted Vanellay. Vanellay had, had the been under, ran he was a man. There. He was a man over there, and yeah. they wanted Vanellay to win. They set the tournament up. For Vanderlei to win, yeah. like so the guy they fought Vanderlei was like they, they call him the axe murderer. He yeah. was like a le he was the he's Gracie, a legend. They call him the Gracie he, killer. Yeah, Vanderlei is a legend, dude. Legend, especially when he fought him. They're both like the yeah, that's the lit. Yeah, I wasn't a I wasn't nothing back then. That's no, I was I yeah. was coming up in pride. Yeah, I was coming up in pride. Vanderlei was like he was the a man. Guy. He yeah, he was a, he was a man back then. But and, and I was. I was dumb to tell him my game plan because yeah, you told me you were. I told, do. I told, I, you know, I, I was in experience. I didn't know that they wanted Van Lee to win. You didn't know that they didn't have I, your best interest. No, in I mind. didn't know that, yeah. and I shouldn't have told him my game plan. I should have told him like, "Fuck yourself." They they're telling me to go and take out um, Chuck Liddell. Yeah, they, yeah. No, they, they didn't tell me to beat him. They said, "Fuck him up." Show show the world that Pride has the best fighters. Wow. Because you remember uh, Chuck Liddell had knocked out. Um, Alistair Overeem. Mm -hmm. yep. Yeah. And they was upset about that. With the overhand right. Yeah, yeah. With the overhand right. Yep. Yeah. He was losing that fight, though, until he knocked him out. Yeah. And Chuck's one of my closest friends, man. Yeah. But he was losing that fight up until that knocked, until they knocked him out. He hit him with that overhand right. Yeah. Overeem was tough. He was tough. He was, yeah, he was tough. Yeah. I wish he would have stayed at 205 because he was fucking built like a Greek god. Yeah. Bro, he was Good heavens, man. I agree. Came with out with he that. So yeah. great he was fucking at 205. Like, he, looked, yeah, he looked long arms. Scariest heavyweight of all time when he came over to, uh, when he came over to the UFC. And yeah, he's he, fighting. Uh, he's he's fighting. Uh, Brandon called him out on Twitter. We were like young and he was still fighting. He's like, he called him out. No, I didn't call it over him. No, I called I No, no, I didn't call it called I called out Verdun. Oh, Doom. Yeah. Oh, that's right. And then you went running. <laughs> no, no, <laughs> like, I didn't. You call out one of those guys, and you were like, "Ah, shit, what am I no, doing?" No, Mark Hunt. Yeah, Hunt. Mark right. Hunt. That's right. Yeah. That's right. Yeah. Overeem was the only guy that I wasn't nah, looking forward to fighting Mark. prior. You would have beat Mark at two yeah. or five days. That's what I wanted. To do. They yeah. was going to have us fight each other at one point. And me, Overeem, we always been cool. But I was like, that, "That's a bad matchup for me." That's 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 
why I did so terrible against John Jones, like the the long arm the, reach. Yeah, yeah. The, the reach. Yeah, yeah. I trained so yeah. hard for John Jones with the reach, but I didn't think about the jiu-jitsu. Did he had long yeah, arms yeah. and jiu-jitsu. Did I he didn't feel mean. really strong? They said, like, no. Chill, um, Chill son said he strong? felt so strong. Who, John? I mean, John no. Jones cradled Rampage. Ryan Bader. Rampage is strong. Dude, I'm strong. No, no, no. You're no. not weak. You're not weak. You're Rampage is strong. I'm strong. I'm a werewolf, so I get it. I get as much. I'm a werewolf. I as, see, I love I asking mad. questions like that to get your brows up. When I, when I get mad, no, you're dead I get, serious. I get it's chin. I heard shit's <laughs> no, fucking funny. So it, it's so funny. No, nobody felt strong, strong to me. Even even when I because no one's as strong as you. That's I why. Thought, I thought, <laughs> I thought, I thought, that's I thought you're strong. strong. As you're strong as yeah. fuck. Yeah. Yeah, even Randleman. Jesus. Huh? Even Randleman didn't no, feel that strong. No, he didn't feel strong because I thought he was going. Because he looked like a bodybuilder. I thought that I was like, he's explosive. He was explosive. Kevin was explosive. Though he almost knocked me out. Kevin Randall almost really damn God, what a career you've had. Yeah, he hit me and I went down and my hands are still up. He didn't follow up. <laughs> he didn't follow up. I was, I was like, thank you. You gotta remember, remember, he fucking fucked up Fedor. With that slam. Yeah, and then he knocked out uh Mirko. Fedor he knocked out yeah. Mirko. He yeah. he starts Mirko. Oh yeah. yeah. Jesus man. Mirko fucking suplex, come. that crazy suplex. That was one of the the the, the suplex for Fedor was one of the Probably the best yeah. suplex yeah. in the game. Yeah. 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 Insane. Insane. Put him in an arm. And then, and then well, how he knocked, right. out he knocked out Mirko. No, nobody, nobody thought. Coming. Nobody. We thought, everyone like, thought. That was like. Prime. You told me that Mirko was. That was prime. That was prime Mirko. Oh, right. By far, not even close. Really? So Did you strong. beat Mirko? Yeah, knocked him out. Oh, you knocked him out? Yeah, so strong. Yeah, so strong. He's yeah, he's a beast. Mirko's a beast. Tough. Yeah, did y'all see the pictures of Fedor getting slammed? His facial expression didn't change. No. Dude, he's just chilling. Like, just right. <laughs> he's so good, man. He was so good. Man, I would hate to play poker against that guy. <laughs> oh, yeah. You guys play poker? Well played, man. Well oh, played. Does he? Uh, is he? Is it true that he's best friends Damn. or one of uh, like with Putin? Putin? Yeah, they're close. Damn. How could you not be? I mean, I mean he's. I, I remember after that fight in Japan, it was all over the newspapers. Look, his face. God they had, they had in the newspaper, they had play-by-play play his face. Because, you know, pride was so big. Yes. It's like in the newspapers over there yep. the next morning, like the national so, newspaper. But, but my thing is, why, I don't get why MMA can't go back to, like, sell the Tokyo Dome and stuff. Like, because, obviously, there's a market it, for it. It's all, related to, it's all related to the Yakuza. Yeah, and they, and they get, but they got rid of the Yakuza in Japan. Though. Yeah, so they got rid of the, They're kind of still lingering around, but I get what you're saying. But they, they did get rid of it. But that's what happened was, what, Saki Gabara? They, 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 a lot of those guys all got caught up in the media based off the fact that Yakuza is tainting like the, the Japanese name, like mm -hmm. being Japan. Yeah. Right. And so that's why they got rid of Pride. And then they, they try to bring it back with Dream. Dream kind of did well for a little bit. And then it's weird getting, they couldn't keep the same. Like, yeah, they lost their I think what, what happened with Pride is they lost their TV rights. Yeah, when they found out they were related yeah. to Yakuza. They, yeah. So then they got so much heat. Yeah, the UFC bottom, right? It was so good. Yeah, yeah. So fucking good. Yeah, collapsed. Just collapsed and then yeah. took it. Yeah, who was, who was their TV? Fuji TV, I think, mm -hmm. is who yeah. it was. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Fuji TV was their one. You gotta remember this. When they did their Uran show, they were the number two um, show every year for their year end show. Yeah. So when I fought on their year end show, it was they did like uh, I don't know how many people. There's 28 million, I think, in, in Japan. That's nuts. They did, yeah. and they, they did 26 million. <sighs> That's how many people and, sat at home and dude, watched that's them. That's why on I had so Eve. many groupies in Wait, Japan. What? Bro. Yes. The groupies. I used to love it. That's what's crazy. In Japan? I, in Japan. You don't get no groupies in America. There ain't no, no female groupies in MMA. Nah. It's, it's nah. all dudes. It's dudes. Dude groupies. Dudes. They want to buy you drinks and yeah, take pictures and hug you. Yeah, it's the weirdest thing, man. If you're in the guys with neck tattoos, then you're love. He would love it. I fought there on New Year's Eve. And all. What's it called? In Pride. Yeah, in Pride. So I come out and fucking come out of my hotel room. Girls throwing shit, at, rocks and shit at your at your window at night, all night while you're trying to sleep. What? Yeah. I don't know if they're there to like to fuck you up because you know in they're Japan trying awake, yeah. they're trying to keep you awake, they're trying to fuck oh, yeah, you they, up, they're yeah, yeah, they, they, they they giving you shitty food. Dude, they dirty, bro. Sushi, like they like that. He said, he said he showed up. He was supposed to fight Arona. The next thing you know, he shows up and he's fighting who? Busamonte. Bruce Bruce but See, now when you fight a Japanese fight. guy, it's different. I'm telling you, I'm fighting Japanese guy. Oh, when you fight a Japanese guy, dude, they done so much shit to me when I fight Japanese guy. The first time I fought Sakuraba. That was on a short notice. I was supposed to fight Ken Shamrock. What? Yeah. I was supposed to fight Ken Shamrock, then uh, Terry I, Trevacock from King in the Cage. Uh, I had just started for uh, training for Ken, Ken Shamrock. I had like I had like uh, three or four months, three right. months, two months to train for Ken. See, you don't look like they, that. They gave me two weeks. They gave me two weeks <laughs> to train. They changed body. in two weeks to fight Sakuraba. And then back then, probably didn't Go have ahead, weight bro. class. Go ahead. They they told me. Uh, when I got there, they was like, uh, uh, you know, a couple days after I got there, they said, uh, you got to uh, lose weight for this fight. And I'm like, I'm like, yeah, I don't have weight class. They want me to cut weight the day of the fight, yeah. the morning of the fight. Yeah. Get, they're they're just doing whatever they can to get I had to lose 26 to pounds. 26 pounds? Holy shit. And I, they gave me th so I said, I, I said, I'm not cutting weight the day before the I mean, the day of the fight. So the day before, I'm, I'm cutting weight and, and – uh, 
and I just I just couldn't lose all the weight, and then I just had my team carry me to the scales, and they was happy. Damn, yeah, that's damn. when I, that's when I started yeah, my acting all, career. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> but all they're doing is trying to yeah. get put the chips yeah. in soccer. Yeah, 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 right? yeah. I'm telling you, they're doing whatever they can. I love and, and I'm gonna tell you, I think I, I think. I ate some fucked up, up food because Sakuraba <laughs> yeah. was so Sakuraba. Where was did so you eat famous. fucked up food? Where did you I, eat I, fucked I up so food? Years ago, Sakuraba was so famous that when I got to Japan, I was instantly famous. When I got, they had like laminated like thick uh, plexiglass uh, trading cards. Because you were the guy fighting Sakuraba. Yeah, I, 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 ain't, I haven't fought no, nothing past King of the Cage. So Damn. when I got to Japan, I was instantly famous. And plus, I went to jail trying to lead the country. So it was got in the newspaper in Japan that I had to leave, that I had to get bailed out of the jail. They they built me up to be this badass, Damn, getting out of getting out of jail, getting out of prison to fight soccer Damn. robbery. Yeah. And so I was instantly famous as soon as I got to Japan. And, and would Japan they, is famous. it true they would pay you guys in cash? Yes. Yeah, 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 yep. yeah. In really? the hotel cash. lobby. Yeah, yeah. No, yeah. I was in. Yeah, I was in. No, I'll be in the in room. room. Oh yeah. So they, I go they, to the hotel so room. So you bring your briefcase of cash. No, they got so, it. They got it. You go in the room and they got big stacks of money right there. Yeah. And you get, Damn. And it's See, it's fresh off. It's brand new money. Brand new money. You're like you're like this. You're like. Licking to get it off the other one like that. That's how stupid. So, so, so many times right I gave people two hundred dollars. Two hundred bucks. Not realize that was a one hundred. <laughs> really? So many Whoa. times. Yeah, you don't realize like you both. Yeah. Can fucking relate so I wonder, to no, because yeah. bills so when I when I fought over there for New Year's, when I fought over there for New Year's, they they owned the Tokyo Hilton, so we fought in Tokyo. So the actual lobby, they had all the they had all the fighters come down at a certain time, and they had four guys, black black suits, white shirts, black ties. Yep. Sitting there, Yakuza style guys just sitting there hanging out. And there was one guy sitting on the couch. Here's your bag. It was a brown Damn. paper bag of just crisp one hundred dollar bills, American money, not not. Yeah, yeah. yeah not, Did they get offended when you counted the money? No, no, no. He actually told me he's like, you count it. Oh, uh, he's like, here because when they gave my money one time up in the room, they got you probably thing. made a little bit more money than me. So they know. probably were mad <laughs> that you they, actually they sat there. Took you probably but, took fuck you forever. But, but I'll tell to you count what, though, shit. after like maybe a year or two um, fighting her, I could tell. I can tell just by holding a, a stack of ten. You know what it was. Ten thousand, right? Yeah. Stack, I can tell, right? Just by holding it. Oh yeah, Jeez. this ten thousand. This Damn. ten. You the, can tell. the only time I got on those dark arts where they paid cash when I was fighting Nogueira in Brazil, and the night before the fight, these uh, Brazilian gangsters went up to my coach. My coach. We only had one coach that spoke Portuguese. And, like you translate to him, and so he's talking to me in Portuguese, and he goes, "Hey, they're gonna pay you fifty thousand dollars cash is if after you knock out uh, Nogueira." Uh, you wear the, you put this jersey on the soccer jersey. I'm like shit. I'll do that. I don't give a fuck. I'll give, yeah, but they go the way they're gonna do it is they're gonna come up to your room right now and then put the cash in your safe and only they know the code. And if you win, they're gonna call and give you the code. If you lose, they're gonna come back and get their money. I'm like all right, say less. Put the wow. money up there. Impressive. I get starched right. No no gear starched me in Brazil. So embarrassing. And I'm waiting. My whole family's in the in the, the hotel room. You know, my eyes out to here. <laughs> and then douche 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 douche. And just two buff Brazil Jeez. Brazilians in tuxedos come in like, sorry, dee, 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 yeah. take the cash. Yeah. Wow. That's cool. Damn, that's a good. That's, that's some shit you put in the yeah, movies. Right? Yeah, right. Yeah. Yeah. So that's the thing. Hey, my this, dad was like, "Who the fuck I'm a, is that?" I'm gonna like, steal that and write. Like, I'm writing. That's what I'm saying. I'm, I'm we gotta start writing it. movie stuff. Yeah, yeah, like, if we take the stories, those Yokuza stories and like those Pride days, you could make a great movie. Yeah, hell yeah. Those were the. Days. Days. That, was insane, that, that, that was the golden age of fighting. That was yeah. for sure was the golden age of MMA. What years were these? Shit, 90, mine was in 2005. No, 2004, 2005, 2005, I fought in Pride. And then I fought again in Dream in 2007 and eight, somewhere around there. Yeah. How long did you fight for, Josh? 20 years. Wow. Yeah. Damn. Jeez. I was in the UFC when you were in King of the Kids. You were supposed to fight Bobby Southworth. Yeah. 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 That's that how I got to Pride. Cause Bobby yep. South, I'm telling you, that's how I got to Pride. Because Bobby Southworth... Pulled out. Pulled out. He pulled out last minute. So he needed somebody. And and um Terry Trevacall, he he grabbed some big dude out of the out of the crowd. Yeah. What? Yeah. Some big dude. And I and I picked him up and I body slammed him. Yep. And Saka Kibari came to the locker room after the fight. He said, he said, I like your character. Oh, damn. He gave me his business card. Damn. He said he's pride and blah, blah, blah. To the races. Yeah, I didn't and I didn't know anything yep. about pride. See, I wasn't an MMA fan when I came over to the sport. Yeah. So I didn't know what anything was your about thing? pride. What was we, your thing before that? <clears throat> You a wrestler? Or what? Yeah, yeah, I wrestled, but I only started wrestling because I wanted to be a pro wrestler. Oh, okay. Yeah, I'm from Memphis, you know, but I wasn't in MMA. I mean, how'd you get into fighting, though? Uh, it was a, it was a mistake. When I got back from I college, heard this story. What? I heard, I heard you were a bouncer, and Tito and you guys knew each other, and he kind of like you kind of helped did, him train. Did Someone Tito, told did, me. Hold on, did Tito tell you that story? No. <laughs> they, I heard it through a, t I heard, I heard it through a, like I guess through a media it's, source through Tito. Maybe Tito did tell it. It's it's, it's, it's so that. been so long well, ago. Listen, listen to this. It's okay. true to that because I moved out here to be a fighter. Nah. So I was already training because I was out here. Then I didn't even know who Tito was. Somebody said, "Oh, um, Tito Ortiz is here." 
And I said, oh, which one's Tito? They were like, they looked at me like, you train in MMA, you don't know who Tito T is. It was a big deal back then. I said, I said, I don't watch that shit. Then they showed me, they said, the guy right there with the big head. I'm like, oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> and, then, and then years years later, uh, he started training with my, my, my coach, the guy I moved here to train with, Fabiano Iha. Mm-hmm. And, I love and then they, they they like teamed up in the gym. And I, I was start, supposed to fight him in Pride. Oh, for real? Yeah. Yeah, and I started training and I started training with Tito Ortiz. I was helping him train for his fights. Sakuraba to me was my favorite fighter for the longest time. He was yeah. just such a colorful dude. The, what well, was he like? Did he did you get to know him? He's a all? nice guy, man. Not, I'm gonna tell you something. Quiet not, but not nice. really. I didn't know him that, that well, he such is a, a nice guy, but I saw him a couple years ago and he acted like he didn't know who I was. But he's a he's a Oh he big time you? No, no, but I think he was joking though. Uh, but he I don't speak CT. English. Yeah. He, but he's he's like so famous in Japan. But he, I said, oh, what's up, so Sakuraba? How you doing? Then, then he, he he was like he was like, nah, man, why? Like, what's your name? Oh, you're damn he kept brilliant. fighting. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He kept fighting t- until like he did. Way, um, way past his. I, yeah. I, I think he was joking, but I almost slapped uh, Sakuraba that day because <laughs> because he, gra- he he grabbed my ass and not the cheeks. He grabbed oh, the right. He grabbed the right in the middle. In the middle. Oh, oh wow. And oh, I was, no. and, and, and listen, it that means took, business, dude. Yeah, it, I don't like, know what that means because I don't know nothing about that. Yeah, I, I, I tell you about means, that life. Ask Brian. It means business. I ain't about that right, Brian. And I'm saying, yeah, yeah. I'm telling you, it took it took every it took every bit because the place where we was at. It took every bit of home training does that and, to you. and decency. Just stuck his feet, grabbed you right in the crack. From 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 me yeah, not to from me way. not to slap the shit out of Sakura. <laughs> it took everything. It took everything I had. Just crack. Look at your face. Look at you grabbing him. Dude, dude, dude. And but, but no, but I looked at him and I looked at him and I told Sakura. I know he don't speak English, but I know you understand what the fuck I said. I said, I said, said Sakura, don't ever do that shit again. <laughs> <laughs> you you know you know he, he's, he's, he's still a big star over there. Oh, he's it, but it's like when when you put that amount of amount of like effort into fighting stuff like that. The, that culture oh, never yeah. forgets it. Never forget it. it. America, yeah. they're like, on to yeah. the next. That's what's yeah. about American culture and so I love It's on to the I next. I love my country, but that's the one thing that people like, as long as what you have stop you done being for me lately? Yeah, yeah. as long as you can't do anything for me now, fuck off. I didn't know how famous Sakuraba Robert was until they yeah. flew me over to do a movie with him. Right? I'm doing a movie with uh, Sakuraba. Jeez. It was like uh, the old school Yak- Yakuza style. Yeah. And uh, I guess I was a character working oh, for the Yakuza cool. boss. It was like old time, like maybe yeah. like our Western. Yeah. yeah. But, it was, but it was Yakuza and stuff yeah. like that. And um, so they had me fight Sakuraba in this movie, right? And they and they filming me doing all this stuff to me getting my licks in and so me fighting. And doing, I was like, oh yeah, I can do this cool kick that y'all never see because I don't do this shit. So I do this double kick, pow, pow, I'm doing all this shit. Then I watched the movie. I just get all that shit. All this. Oh. <laughs> yeah. And I and I saw him. I asked him. I said, "Why y'all have me do all that shit?" Yeah, man. I was there for hours. Yeah. They don't want yeah. you to be a star. You know, yeah. Yeah. no, no. Shit. They 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 they, they mind fuck you. Yeah. They have. They didn't. They didn't want you to know that you just a you just a motherfucking crumb. Yeah. Well, they once you want start you. doing more movies, you realize how much is gonna actually make it in the movie. Yeah, not much. How much is not. not. Yeah, much. but 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 it's Cause, just cause I, you did a team too, right? Was yeah, that yeah, your yeah, first the, like big break. That's the biggest movie. That's the biggest movie I ever done. Like I didn't. I haven't done shit big since then. What by choice? No, nah, it wasn't by choice. It was, some, it was, was a lot of it was a lot of hate relation going on there. I heard that. That was Joe Carnahan, right? Joe Carnahan's yeah, the man. He's the man. man. He's the man. He's Brian's, but, but, Brian's, he, we're, Brian's really close with Joe. Yeah. Joe, uh, Joe, Joe. He's the best, man. Yeah, I love great. that guy. I love Joe. Brother for life. He's brilliant. I love Joe. Yeah. Yeah. I feel yeah. bad we're not watching this fight at all. <laughs> it's boxing, oh, yeah. though, you know? Uh, <laughs> 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 yeah, no, I didn't even know yet. We don't know these guys. Hey, you know what? But people that are watching this right now, they're loving all this shit right here. I just read the chat. I'm so thankful you're here, man. This is what's crazy. This is what's crazy. Man, I shy away from doing podcasts and stuff because everybody got a damn podcast. I almost got one. Yeah, you're, you're, I mean, everybody got a podcast. Has one now. You should do one, man. I don't know. Yeah, I'm I think just telling I, you. I, I think it's saturated, oversaturated. I you think know, you are such a personality. Dude, you're fucking. That's the thing. I would tell everybody not to do one. You're one of the very few people I would actually say you could do it with. Shit, I've told Brian to stop doing some of them. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> you <laughs> could do it. Oh, you yeah. think so? Everybody's yeah. like, everybody's everybody, doing everybody, everybody yeah, everybody's doing it. That's why. Well, here's the thing, though. Like, you don't have to talk about Ooh. MMA. Like, I like I want to do another one, but I want to do one separate from anything to do with MMA. You like cars? Yeah, you have everything. But I don't know shit about cars. I'm the I'm type of person. That I like shit. But I'm not a fan. Yeah, but you're a, you have a I'm sense of weirdest, humor. I'm the weirdest. I'm the weirdest guy. No, but, but you have a sense of humor. Bro. You're not weird, man. You and I you're like the rest of us. You, you like the rest of us. You and I can do a car show together. Yeah, yeah but I don't know shit about cars. You ask me like, what's yeah, up? but I do. Oh, okay, <laughs> I'll go to your house and I'll bring my cars. Yeah, yeah. I'll be kicking with Josh Barnett. You know, back in the day, hey. I hear him talk about it. He knows everything. He I'm knows. Like, he's a gearhead. Yeah, I'm like, Josh what the fuck? He could build the shit himself. Josh is. He might be, you know, well, you're top not a five gearhead. You just like cars. Yeah. Brother, uh, I'm like brother, in the middle. My brother would be considered he knows, a gearhead. Yeah, he knows Josh Barnett's a gearhead. Rogan's a gearhead. I'm like in the middle there. Yeah. I'm not a fuck yeah, boy where I just
you had the internet. I didn't know. This is '96 or whatever. Yeah. He was going to fr to Fry's, the computer place. Yeah, yeah. Fry's and, Electronics. And I fucking that place. and buying like memory and his. Oh, he was building shit. his own fucking computer. Oh shit! Oh, oh shit! Whoa. That was after was the belt too. What was that well, about? He rocked him after the belt. Swinging. I would love to hear you on Rogan Rampage because he has a Rolodex of pride stories too. Oh yeah, he's, Rogan's he's, just, never, he's never invited he's me on the show. Oh, he will. He has. Oh, oh geez. Geez. No, he, right he, now, Joe. right now, Joe. There Joe, let's Joe. get him on. No, no. He just heard it. There you go, Joe. Never had Joe. He watches these. Oh, yeah, that's cool. No, here. Um, I was funny. I was down helping Rob, Rob McCullough train, oh, yeah. and then you would you, yeah, you just you just went to the UFC, hmm. and I remember you had a R eight. Oh yeah, you yeah. had a, you had a, a like car. yeah you had yeah, a I was one of the first people to have in Orange County. Yeah, yeah they, it was that's probably one of my favorite cars based on the fact yeah, that it's yeah. most probably one of the most comfortable sports yeah, cars yeah, to it's drive. The best, it's oh, the best shit. one. Oh um, shit, look at this. But we had I had a magazine oh, shoot oh, oh, and they actually came to the gym to shoot me at the gym like hey whose car is that and I was like hey Quinn can I use your car real quick because they want to take yeah? some photos of me in front of your car. Did I say so, yeah, yeah you were like yeah yeah just don't touch it. He's like yo yo yeah you can just don't touch it. I was like what's your favorite car right now? Uh. I, I got to say my Hellcat. I still, I still got the first generation Hellcat. That's Those my favorite dope. car. I love that they're car. They're monsters. It's American muscle. Handling's not great, but well, they're, they're it depends on what you're doing. Yeah, it's, it's a beast though. It's you have a, a tune too or no? It's fight. No, no, no I didn't do all I did was put his also. I didn't yeah. do nothing else. Yeah. 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 It didn't oh. need nothing. Yeah, oh. they're sick. This fight just got interesting. This, this guy, one, this fight's a lot more balanced for sure. Based on the fucking stats. The Russian guy, I think, has got the best of in the last round. Damn, you had a clip from the Ultimate Fighter days up there? Yeah, 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 yeah. How fun was that, man? That was fun, man. Hey, you was probably one of the only guys on the other team that we liked. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Tiki yeah. and I oh, was just oh. talking about that. Yeah, you and I were friends. Yeah, we yeah, were friends, yeah. You were friends. And I love Tiki. Is that Rashad? Well, yeah, how, 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 can you, how can they not be friends with you, man? They all thought you were black. Yeah, it's true. <laughs> it's uh, we thought you was black. Yeah. <laughs> what, what, you, what? No, I still man. think you're black. You're not black? What <laughs> <laughs> the fuck I'm doing on this show? <laughs> how come I'm, how come I'm, the, how I'm come the only I'm black guy here? <laughs> Yeah, how come so I'm always great, the only man. black motherfucker? Oh, right, right, man. I live in Orange County. I'm tired of being the only black guy. <laughs> yeah, I yeah, know. Yeah, Orange yeah, County the Orange yeah. County. You're in the whitest place in the world. In no, the fucking where he's world. at, it's very yeah. white, well, it's Asian. Asian, white. Asian, Asian, Asian. White. That's why you're there. Yeah. See this? I'm, I'm clear. <laughs> <laughs> Look, yeah. Look at that smile. Yeah. yeah. I know, oh, man. I'm gonna yeah. tell you. No, I'm gonna tell you. I'm gonna tell you. <laughs> no, I'm gonna tell you. <laughs> Let me tell you. That's okay, my okay. That's, that's my pet peeve. People think that I have an Asian fetish. Right. Oh, I don't think it's a fetish. Is there an equal opportunity no, important? No, no, I don't have any fetishes. Okay. No. I think I think my in my opinion, I think a fetish is a little bit too overboard for me. So right. I don't have any fetish. But. I, Asian women are my favorite. It's my favorite. Yeah, that's but I like. But I like all. Saying. Okay, but I like all women. women but you were saying that I had. Oh no, I'm not saying that. No, I haven't, I haven't dated. The last three women you've dated, who? who what, what, what was Persian. Preference. Persian's not okay. Ooh. Puerto Rican and Colombian. Okay. Ooh, that's dangerous. That's dangerous and beautiful. And, and Asian. It's just right. a preference. Yeah. You're good. So it's you're, you're, it's, it's my, preference. my favorite preference. I I, I date all. I go. I, I yeah. date all girls. No white girls. They're my least favorite. Okay. I like them though. I, I almost married one in college. Okay. That's why they're my college. least favorite. <laughs> 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 it's, from college. Hey, it's it's funny how the college girlfriends, they're always like just tainted you. I did I had a man, she I, bro, she man, bro, she, yeah. she she, she did a, I she, had a Mexican she, girlfriend. Man, she, bro, she fucked me up, man. She went to Argentina for to be a foreign exchange student, fucked her host brother. <laughs> <laughs> then, and then I had I had I had my oldest I had, you know shit time when I and I, I had a kid from college my oldest son she found out I had an older son got mad that I didn't abort him so what she so fuck? when I moved out here wow. wow. so you got so wait you got wow. so she was overseas you got a girl pregnant no 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 no, no. she cheated on me and then, then I you, and then you got then I got somebody pregnant <laughs> then then I moved back to Memphis and um she she showed up at my front door. She found out, found out about my son. Got mad at me because I didn't, I didn't abort him. She got pregnant on purpose. Told me she was on, on the pill. Wow. Aborted my kid. Dang. And then was going, then was going to, then was finna going to leave me. She's a savage, bro. Then she was going to break up with me, and, and all the feelings came. I said, no, 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 no. You can't leave me. And then after that, my old friend told me to uh, used to be my friend, the one who's fought in the UFC. He told me to come out here and train. California. We drove out here together. Long story short, my baby mama needed to move in. Me and my baby mama get into it. She gets. Cause they become friends, they team up on me. Cause uh, we live in, oh, it's the worst. My, hey, my life is a reality oh, show for God. Jeez. So I get, I get, I get into it. I get into it with my baby mama. I get into it with my baby mama, and and, uh, and she and you know she was right there. And I, I'm not proud of what I did, but I yelled. I really scolded at my baby mama. I really scolded at her. Two weeks, two weeks before I fought Marvin Eastman, Eastman for the first time, and and uh, I kicked. Stuck. So I so I so I kicked my baby mama out. I kicked her out. And and they went together, and she went and told her family that uh, I hit her. 
Mm. That I beat her up. Why did you? How did you hey, find how, out? How's, the, how's your son now? How old is he? Yeah, yeah. He's 22 now. And he, uh, does he fight? Do, no, that's my first son. He's out by now. I, I want to let him fight. He his eyes twitch real fast, and oh. he plays sports and football. But I got a 21 year old son that's. Trans with Antonio Your McKee. Your oldest son is albino? Yeah. Wow. Blonde hair and blue eyes. Yep. Wow. Damn. I albino. Yeah. Yeah. I met him a Certainly. couple times. Oh. You, yeah. you, you, you had him at um at uh, at the gym there. Yeah, I was a single. I was a single that. parent. Yep. I've been tough. when I was fighting yeah. in Japan. I was I was a single parent. Oh, damn. Oh, How yeah. did you find out that your your girl? Fucked her host brother. She told him. I know she didn't tell me. I, I knew. I know shit, man. This, I called her. <laughs> I called. I called Argentina. He answered the phone. Yep. And when and when and when I said, you know, man, I speak to her. I ain't gonna say her name. I just heard his voice how he called. And, and then when she he got on the phone, she, it was just guilt. And she, he was laughing in the background. And she uh, just the way she sound, it, oh. it wouldn't sound like that. Then I, yeah. then I asked her. I said, I said. Y'all fucking, huh? <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> and, and then she she tried to lie a little bit at first. Then she then she told truth, but. Now, what really hurt me? I was close to her family. She had a twin sister. Damn. They didn't. Oh. They didn't look nothing like. And her, she had four. She <laughs> had three sisters. All Wait, her sisters bro, was hot. Damn. All her sisters were hot. Her dad was super cool. He, you know what I'm saying? You were I, close. To I was close. To, I was close to her family. And then she goes back and tell them that I hit her. She got no. She got no proof. No scars. Yeah. Nothing. Nothing. No. And 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 they believed her. But yeah. I understand yeah. you believe the family. But I'm like. Yeah, I don't say your family gonna believe yeah, you, but they yeah. you can't, she, you can't I, I can't believe that. Sometimes. I can't believe that she. I can't believe that she did that to me. Damn. That's but you know, I, I did scold my baby mama. You know, what I'm saying the baby mama was was real shady. I was doing, I was a bouncer at the time. Where and, at? Uh, in at, Vin- at the Vietnamese club. <laughs> yeah. That's go. where this fetish came from. I never had a fetish. <laughs> no, I never had a fetish, yeah, motherfucker. Yeah, no, 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 no. My mama told me hey, the first time I brought the first time I brought a, a Asian girl home from, from Japan. My mom preference. first thing she said, I knew it. I knew it. you go like Asian girl. I said why? Then she told me the story. She said, as soon as you you was old enough to walk, I lost you in a grocery store. And I, I found you a couple of hours down away, uh, and you was kissing on some little Chinese girl. <laughs> oh <my God. laughs> and I was like, "What?" Yeah. She said her mama thought it was cute, but you was all in all like, "I kiss on." So, the, so the first girl I ever kissed was Asian. That's wow! Awesome, but, but I'm telling you this though: wow. once you go Asian, you won't go back Caucasian. No. <laughs> <laughs> hey, but hey, you but you're right though. Yeah. Bro, it, when you have when you have a high school, <laughs> hey, when you have a college girlfriend, your college girlfriend will taint you for the rest of your mm. life. I had a I was yeah. dating a Mexican girl. Yeah. Cause I'm half Mexican. All my mom, my mom's You're young. Mexican? Yeah, I'm half. Wow, we explains that job. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So my, my mom's my mom's half, and so my mom's full. I'm half, and so then they like I was dating Mexico all through college. Fuck, man, brutal. And then my mom's the youngest of thirteen. And so wow. she got a lot of sisters, oh, wow. and they're they're all thirteen. They're all divorced. Oh yeah, <laughs> all divorced. divorced. What's your, what's your wife now? They're all divorced. White girl? Uh, is your, is your girl white now? Yeah, no, no, Asian. Yeah, yeah, you go with the pride, dude. Oh, dude. Like a, hey, 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 you dude. go, you go there. You know, dude, when you best. say Asian, Vietnamese, Korean, Chinese, what? Chinese. 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 Yeah. Okay. yeah, I don't, I don't really date Did Vietnamese you have kids? girls. No, Why? I love, I, I got a lot of Vietnamese, um, I got a lot of Vietnamese homegirls and stuff like that, and I, I love the Vietnamese culture. But for me, in my opinion, I could be wrong, but this is my opinion for what I learned from working at the Vietnamese bars and clubs. Yeah, most of all my friends are Vietnamese. Yeah, they too much like black people. <laughs> 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 Yo. They the they the niggas of Asia. Oh, the oh, no. So I, the Vietnamese Yo. girls, uh, they too much like black girls. So I was like, I don't get it. You're killing me right them. now, bro. I don't. You I don't date them. Right I, can be friends, I can be friends with them. Yeah, but you're not gonna get involved. I've dated one Vietnamese girl. She was from San Diego. Yo, uh-huh. she was from San Diego. <laughs> hey, you ever thought about doing stand up? Like what? Like, <laughs> what you, you got some real? You, you got some funny shit. Who do you find the most yeah, attractive? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, the find the most. For me, it's Filipino. Vin- Vietnamese, Vietnamese girls are yeah, they're are they're the most beautiful. Some Koreans are bad. Man. Koreans are bad, but they be a lot of plastic surgery though. That's yeah, why bad. yeah, yeah. I don't, I, I don't like plastic surgery. I think I it's cheating. I don't like it either. I think it's cheating. Yeah, and I, don't, I don't like. I don't it. like it either. You, 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 you don't feel right. You don't. You don't feel right. You don't feel right. You don't feel right. Fake butts. What do you guys think? Fake butts. No, I, no, absolutely not. Absolutely no, no, not. No, 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 no fake lips, fake butts. No, no, no problem. Any surgery. No problem. You ever seen a Colombian with a fake ass? Yeah, yeah but when like, they get it done right. Okay, no, well done no. right is a whole or some of these thing. girls. Uh, no. You know, you see on Instagram. No, I can't. I can't do it. Uh, I, like real stuff. I, I, I prefer I like a woman with real boobs, even they small over fake, fake boobs. I have dated girl with fake boobs. But I, I don't like fake. I don't like the fake. I shit. like fake boobs. Yeah. I don't even like fake ass. Really I'm tired yeah. of all that shit. Yeah, I don't. I'm tired. I'm tired of all that fake shit. I don't like fake. I for me. Be ugly with me. Fuck it. Be ugly with me. Cause look, what you, what you, what you like? Start falling because we human. We can start falling for these girls, right? Then you have teens with us, and it's like it's like a surprise. Your kid ugly as fuck. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, yeah. 
You yeah. know what I'm yeah. saying? Hey. That's a well, problem. Like Tommy Fury's Tech girl. Technology. She was yeah. she wasn't a, she wasn't a dime. She was like an eight. Yeah. Then, then, then you taking your kid to get plastic surgery. And that shit can yeah. get but expensive. Then I have shit for guys. All you can do is a guys wear a shining shirt. You know, you don't have a fucking. <coughs> there's no like surgery that really gives you. I guess you can do a lot of steroids. Man, can you imagine school. taking your kid to get hey, plastic surgery? No. Hey, have you not, have you not seen that? Like have you not seen that mom? picture of that Indian dude who's got the the, the biceps? So yeah, plastic yeah. surgery for guys is money, <laughs> right, Chin? That yeah, that guy, yeah. the you know the Indian guy that has a fake what, what, the, gross the, oil, yeah. oil, yeah. Yes. money, Disgusting. money, Jeez, yeah. Or, or it's like like if you have hair issues, you got to he has to refill that every so often. I want to get a hair transplant, but it's gonna look dumb. Just I mean, leave guys man. that do it. You look, you, you look natural. Why you would actually, look, dumb? look, I don't want to. I don't want to make, make your head. I don't make your head. I don't want to make your head any bigger than yeah. it is. Yeah. You're actually not a bad looking guy for the age you are. It's funny. What do you know? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I'm just being honest, man. I hope. Yeah, 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 I hope I look as lean as you at this age. You for sure. You go get stem cells. You look even younger. It works. Where did you get yours at, Quentin? Where did you get yours at? I got mine done in Columbia. With through Jamie Varner. Jamie Varner is working with a company, I think, down at Panama or Columbia. No, I'm a Accelerator. Columbia, okay. Panama, but pa yeah, Panama. Yeah, Panama, Panama Columbia. Have you done stem cells? I have not, but I, I want to. I, I haven't done I want it. it. No, I'm going to. Is it life, life Someone changing. told me it was painful. It it's life changing. What, like, what did you get the shot's for? not painful. I got in both my knees and my, and my, and my hand because I had a real bad bone bruise or something. And in my right shoulder. And, and yeah. you and swear be, by it? Yeah, yeah. What, why would you get it, Bradley? My shoulder's fucked up. Oh, weird. Yeah, it's been fucked yeah. up for a long time. Huh. It's like well, you got to stop yeah. trying to walk in them goddamn crates. Yeah. <laughs> Some other <laughs> no. random well, shit. Well, Rogan said things. he had a labrum tear and then did stem cells. And then and the MRI surgery. Showed, did, yeah, did yeah. Need surgery. Cool. So. Yeah. Wow. Life changing. <clears throat> and they can put in your penis, too. Really? To make it bigger? <laughs> no, but they said they said. Cali just perked call, up real quick. He's like, really? For your penis? It's just don't say penis. Like 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 make, home improvement. Huh? You know, he went huh? Like all the time, or is it like no some no no? It's like it's like I, from what they explain it's like, you know, if you're the type of guy that need like you know dick pills, like you won't need the dick pills. That's what oh, they were wow. telling me. I almost did it, but I didn't do. I chickened out because I couldn't what? think of it. I don't. Oh, you talking about a needle in your dick? Yeah, oh, I didn't want to. I'm good, bro. I'm good. Yeah, yeah. Nah, I'm good. Your hand being, you don't need the pills, man. Take your hand being. What's that? Your hand being. Your hand being. It's an African horny goat weed. I don't. Take that. I, I don't have a problem anyway. It's a I'm just saying, it's a supplement. Yeah, I'm just saying. And if you did, I don't think you would tell us. How old are you now? 38. Okay. How old are you? 43. Yeah. See, for me, I don't, at 54, <laughs> I, I'm, I'm lucky. I got good genetics. I don't need pills yet. But I can't, the minute, the fucking <coughs> minute I feel any of my energy go down or my, GRT, I here can't we wait to get on testosterone. Yeah. I'm going to get fucking jacked. Hopefully they don't I make those that. ears bigger. I do. <laughs> Damn, he went there. Yeah. The one, yeah. I thought he, we were he right went there, there fast. Yeah, no, I thought we were in the circle of trust. No, no one's man. watching. Circle of trust. No one's watching. Yeah, this isn't live on the internet. No one knows this. Yeah. Nobody's just just this room right here. So this is what you're saying to take Rampage? Yeah, you take that. You take it in the morning and, and at night. Drug. Take two. Take two. Yeah, of, it's just an extra. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, you, you take, take two. Enough, you take two in the morning and two at night. Then you don't never need to take no dick pill. Two in the morning, say that? uh, that's that's what my you know friend what, though, told that, me. Yeah, that was so good. That's my friend. I'm just going back with my friend. Yeah, yeah, I don't know myself. Yeah, yeah. But uh, change yeah. the subject. Y'all yeah. asked me a question. I never got a chance to answer it because when you asked me how how did I get started? Yeah, yeah, because the whole about the Tito thing. Yeah, yeah. So uh, I was I was um I went back to Memphis. I got out of college, and I, I used to be friends with this guy. I used to have to wrestle in college. Uh, I mean, in high school, and he was training. MMA. And, and he, were you a good, I don't mean to interrupt you, were you a good wrestler in high school? I just started at just 17. Start right. I was undefeated until regional finals. Okay. Did you? But did you play a sport in college or no? Wrestled. Oh, you wrestled in college. In college, yeah, oh, and okay. I sucked. I, okay. I won one wrestling match. Okay. Yeah, I sucked. But, you know, I liked it. I was new to it. Yeah, you liked it. And, and, and uh, so he took me to a, to an MMA show, like a little small show, and I saw this fighter there. I didn't know who he was. And um, he, he triangle choked somebody. The guy tapped out, the referee stopped the fight, and he put his foot in the guy's face and pushed him off. And I said, I want to fight that guy. He's a fucking dick. And then my friends started training for a fight. Three days notice, they said, hey, you, you want to fight? You, I'm like, yeah, I'll fight who is it? They said, you remember that guy you said you want to oh, want to fight? They said, yeah, his opponent pulled out. And I get that, it's Mike Powell. <laughs> he was he was like undefeated oh, in Memphis. Shit. He was the biggest, the highest, but he was like a purple yeah. belt or something like yeah. that. And what happened? I, I, I ended up beating him by decision. Damn. I ended up beating my him first by, fight. Mike my Powell's first fight ever. My first fight wow. ever, I, I beat him by the seat, and they said, "Oh, you you a fighter now?" And then then my friend he moved to uh, he he went and fought in UFC nineteen or twenty, something like that, and he and he met Fabian on Eha, mm -hmm. and then they became friends, and then he f he flew out to California with his wife and stuff, and started training. And six months later, he he sent for me. I, I quit my job, 
I left my I left my family, everybody, and, and I, then was I, it pretty fast for you once you got to California? I, I can't remember. I'm bad with time, but I was out here. For, I was out here for a while, and Fabiano Eha, he didn't he didn't he didn't charge me. I was broke as fuck. I couldn't yeah. even, I couldn't even for rent. I just left everything. I it took me a while to find. Took my six months to find that damn bouncing job down. Made like forty five dollars a fucking night, Man. and Whoa. and so Fabiano Eha, he didn't charge me. So he he, he threw this show. That's why I met. Uh, uh, Joe Daddy Stevenson, mm, and he, yeah. cause he Her beat my friend. Be. He beat the shit out of my friend on that show, and I fought. For, I fought for free. And he was trying to pay on the nah, man. You don't charge me. I fight for free. And so that was my that was my uh, second fight, my second amateur fight, and, and then um, then after that, I think I fought Marvin Eastman and King the Cage, and then that's what God, when I, the yeah. yeah for I some King, reason, I remember so many. Wait, you fought fights. Marvin twice? I fought Marvin yeah. twice. That's you fought the, the UFC I didn't, was I didn't a rematch. You, yeah, I didn't, I didn't know that. I didn't know. Yeah, that. he beat the shit out of me the first fight in King. Oh, did he? Yeah, but you got a lot of memorable. But that was your first yeah. fight. That was your first fight in UFC, right? When you first got the UFC. Yeah, yes. that's, that was my deal. See, the UFC they brought W. What was it WFA? They brought WFA for my contract because remember. Remember Chuck was coming back, uh, avenging all his losses. Yeah. And I was the last guy. That's you knocked right. him out with that left hook, right? Yeah. Didn't you? Yeah. yeah. I was. The, I was the last. I was the last guy. You yeah. and you and Chuck are cool now. Man, man, Chuck is cool. I'm. I'm gonna tell y'all how Chuck. Chuck messed up. He messed up. Uh, that, that 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 was a right hook. That was all his fault oh, because oh, oh. we missing it. Oh shit! Oh, Your story's damn. Oh, he's done. He's done. Sorry. Yeah, Chuck Chuck Liddell. When we fought in Japan, Chuck Liddell gave me the hardest body shot I ever received in my life right Oof. and when he hit me in the body i made a noise and he remembered it i made a, he hit me i went Ooh, and i went for the takedown and yeah. then the bell rang right so when we fought when we fought in in in, in ufc he was trying to set me up for that body shot same body shot and that's what and that's, that's what knew that's what lost him in the fight oh damn he was trying to wow. go for that body shot oh mm. that's and then you and and, you and, and I, I i countered the body yeah, shot and hooked and and i and i came and you guys in. worked on that in camp yeah who? No, 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 but but that's my style. When people go for the body, I have I have like right. defense. That's your but I have my defense. Did you start working with a boxing coach? I think for that camp, because I remember you gave him a shout out. Because I remember, yeah, you, you know, what? I remember you caught him and you were like, and you said, you you gave him a shout out and said we worked on like for my boxing. Like he, that, I, said, that was, I think that was Vanley when I knocked that Vanley for the first time. I worked with. I brought I, I brought a, a, a boxing coach from England. Okay. But 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 I did have a boxing uh, coach for the um for the Chuck Liddell fight. I did. How good did that Cause feel? Because you, you did go to huh? oh, the Van fight. fight. How good did that feel that to get that my, win? That was my favorite. That one. was your favorite oh, one. Favorite. Stop the fight. Because you did go to was it Wesley? No, he, he with quit. Being in yeah, I went over there. Mm. Yeah, corner smart. corner waved it off. That that's yeah. smart. Save your yeah, boxing. that was that was the fight that I was waiting because after you got that one back, I was like, God, he's got to be feeling yeah. so good about yeah, that cause, right now. Because I always knew I can beat Vanellay. I always knew that I can beat him, but Such I just wasn't. But I just wasn't prepared. Like when I first time I was fighting, I was training with, I was sparring with jujitsu guys. Mm -hmm. I, I didn't, I, I didn't have like a um, a team of people to spar and yeah. bang with. So I was sparring with jujitsu guys who didn't even want to be in the ring with me. They didn't want to yeah. be in the cage with I me. I wouldn't want to be in the ring with you. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> just being honest. Yeah. <laughs> it was, it was, it was hard. It was hard to prepare for. For Vanellay and Shogun and Ninja, you know, it was hard because those guys. Are on did you train level. a lot of boxers, like like just strictly boxers, or was it? No, not a whole lot. Yeah. We missed a good fight. Uh, we gotta keep the air condition on. Another yeah. special shout out to our sponsor tonight, Manscaped, the official electric trimmer of the UFC. If you haven't tried the new Lawnmower 4.0, it's like a spaceship. It's got a 400k LED light to help you navigate and locate the dark areas. Talking about your nut sacks. Have your balls feeling the experience of zero gravity. Help your little planet stay protected from the sun's heat with a performance, I know, package 4.0, which includes the ball toner, ball deodorant, boxers, travel bag, and, of course, the lawnmower 4.0. And all the thick boys tonight get 20% off and free shipping with the code CFC at manscaped.com. That's 20% off and free shipping with the code CFC at manscaped.com. We got the link and code in the bio. Do this guy not look like Tyron Woodley? This knock, this knock him out. <laughs> they do bit. look like Tyron Woodley. A little bit. Is this is the next fight? Uh, no, I think no, the female fight. Yeah, yeah. Can fight we get it? Hot She's good, man. Is that possible? Dude, uh, yeah. Wow. Dur during the weekend, they turn the AC off. Oh, uh, I don't mind. I'll adjust it a but little didn't you bit here, so them? hopefully it works. My team forgot to tell. Him. No way. Was so the AC on the, last time? Yes. Shut the fuck up. Yeah, you, you swear to God. Yeah, you missed a good one. AC was on. The yeah, AC it was, was crispy. It was you just have to give him a, like, yeah. a, a yeah. notice. But this one, we just said fuck. Yep. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> that is Kyle. <laughs> You've been here both, you've been here both times. Kyle, Kyle thank it's you. Kyle you've been here both times. Thanks, yeah. man. This might be your last day. Wow. <laughs> Kyle. Kyle does love things well. Who, he just forgot the AC. Who's your guy that arranged my ride here? Who was that guy? Ah, that's my that's my boy Casey, so slap him around. Bro, when they told me a Prius came to pick up Rampage Jackson, I didn't want to show up. 
<laughs> Dude. I don't want to show up. Bridge with no AC. And it, we get there, it was 100 and something degrees. 105. 100, yeah. Right, I, just, I just adjusted it. Whoa. So, so you came from a no AC car to a no AC room. Yeah. Nice. Yeah. But they have these fans. These fans are kind of nice. Yeah, they're not bad. It helps yeah. somewhat. Yeah, just Bro, when they room. told me a Prius came to pick up, when T goes, bro, you sent a Prius to Rampage? Wow. I went, no, dog, we sent him to Black Escalade. He goes, nope, it's a Prius. I went, holy And the Prius shit. had a big dent in the motherfucking door. <laughs> I was so motherfucking embarrassed because I'm- I'm, I'm renting, embarrassed. Dude, I'm renting, a, I'm renting an apartment just close to Antonio McKee's gym, right? Yeah. And so I come outside, there's a bunch of other cars <laughs> out there. <laughs> you know, I think Girl, I'm all, damn, you, Rampage fell off. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah he's getting a Prius. And I go look at the fucking, I said, I hope it ain't this Prius. <laughs> That motherfucker had a big ass dinner in the fucking door. His windows down, no AC. Damn. I, I hope like, it's not this Prince. I'm like, is Brandon, is Brandon Swan fuck with me? Because I, <laughs> because I wasn't his coach on Ultimate Fighter. Like, <laughs> he, still that, he still got that it's, shit going on. Yeah, Cause we did fuck y'all over those chickens and yeah. shit. Yeah. I think you. I thought maybe you still. No like, hell no, man. Shit. I was so embarrassed that. that it, listen, if I booked the car, it would have been uh, it'd been a nice car. That was uh, that was that, that team, made man. me wonder about your budget for your show. Yeah, I was me like, too. That's <laughs> what I said. That's such a bad look. <laughs> Tiki goes, "Are you fucking with us?" He takes me. He goes, "You fucking with me?" I go, "Why? What's up?" I was at the house. Yeah. She got out of the shower, and he goes, "You fucking with us?" I go, no, "Why would I fuck with you? What are you talking about?" He goes, "You sent a Prius to Rampage." I'm like, "No, that's fucking, fucking way. funny." Yeah, man. Who did I, that? Honestly, Who's honestly, I, ne- I probably wouldn't even <clears> say anything, but Casey. it was so many people out there looking at me getting in the bridge. <laughs> it was some hot chicks, because the apartment where I live, some hot chicks some live there. Some new baddies in there. Man, some hot chicks live there. Is this busted ass Busted ass, ass Prius. Prius like, with I the- thought he was supposed to be somebody. Man. Damn. Yeah, Fuck. man. It's tough. It's tough. I'm yeah, sorry, man. It's tough. Yeah. It's okay. Yeah. Maybe next time. You can slap Casey around a little bit. Yeah, let me slap him around. I feel a little better. Where is that guy? Oh, come over here. I just want to see your face. I just want to see what he yeah, looks me, like. Let, yeah. I just want to see what he looks like. That's all. No, he was, he, he, he was, was running the show. There yeah, he, he was real apologetic. Oh, okay. he, was, he was real apologetic when he showed. He, oh, I was but so, he wanted to see me. if I was telling the truth. Hey, how busted was that Prius when I pulled up? <laughs> the worst Prius of Did all time. Did you see the dent? You see the big dent in it? Yeah, it the windows down. Damn. Damn. Would you would you book it on Lyft or some shit? I was so nervous. I booked it three days in advance and I just messed up. Well, at least he owns it. He owns it. He owns it. It's all right. Own it. I'm not too good to ride in the periods, though. I, honestly, I'm not. I nope, nobody is. No, it's yeah, not about no, that. It's just no. that it's more the AC thing. To me. It was, it was, it, that would have. It was the big. Up. No, it was the big dent for me. I, I'm one of those guys. It's I that, like but then also Prius, Prius for vegans. Are, are you are you a muscle car guy? Or are you? A I, I like finesse. I like muscle car. I like muscle cars, but I, I like cars. Yeah. I I like. For, What's what your dream car? Oh man, my dream car. That's a good question. That is a, that is a good question. Um, Oh, that's a that's a that is a good. You know, I always wanted one of those skylines from they just oh, have in Japan. Dope. Yeah, Damn. you'll see, see some out one. here right yeah. now. Yeah, yeah, I heard they passed Sky, a lot. Yeah, they What's passed a, a lot. Oh man, you got to show them. It, Bring up a skyline. Yeah. The one with the, which one? I told you I'm not a car guy like that. The one with the circle circle tail lights. Yeah, the circle tail light. There, yeah, see yeah, some yeah, yeah. One is a, yeah, yeah. Is there a company yeah. called Skyline? It's like the alt one. Uh, or Nissan. Sorry, yeah, yeah, yeah. Nissan. It's yeah. Nissan. It's that uh, one. Japanese 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 Japanese. Japanese. That white one, right? Yeah, not the American one. The white one. Super fast. Yeah, the old one. They just passed the law, so you see some. They're like American. I mean, they're Japanese muscle cars. Yeah. Like like I was in San Diego, and they have the cars and coffee up there, and there's there's one of those in black. Yeah. And the, yeah. the driving uh, is on the right side, yeah. not the left. Are these cars really rare? The dream car, right? Uh, the GT2 RS is, and then I just got allocated for a F8 Tributo Ferrari. Oh, nice. Yep. See, here's the thing. What kind I've of driven car? a Lambo, I've driven a Ferrari, I've driven the R8. The R8 to me is the nicest probably in terms of comfort. You get try to get out of in and out of a Lambo and a Ferrari. Yeah. It's a fucking pain in the ass. Especially when you're big. Fucking. But they're not comfortable, though. Teslas, Teslas? are not comfortable. Oh, the leather and shit is horrible. It's nah, fucking. Teslas are gay. It's second, yeah. second tier yeah. shit. No, don't get me wrong. They're fast. They're yeah. fast as fuck because there's no. I find they're fast as hell. Yeah, they're fast as hell. They're but fast. they're it's not like comfortable. Like, I mean, yeah. yeah. It's like if you're if you're paying $180,000 for a vehicle, you want it to be comfortable. I want to be able to drive somewhere. Like at Aston Martin. They're fucking so uncomfortable. You drive for more than thirty yeah, minutes, you're like fucking it. horrible. Uh, I don't know what you've driven, brother. I, I've, I've had Ferraris, Porsches. No, what I'm saying Aston they're hard. Martins. They're hard to I've get in and out of. I've been all of them. Ferraris and Lambos. They're they're just hard Lambos, for me to get. Though. Like I'm Lambos, small. I can't, I imagine, you I can't imagine you guys trying to get out of a Lambo. Yeah, yeah. And a Ferrari. Yeah, yeah. It's no, like, like you put your you put your hand on the ground, you get out. I saw a McLaren. I don't know what kind it was. They're nice. It's one of the newer ones. Yeah, I don't fit a McLaren Lambos. I can't drive. Yeah, yeah. I love them. I love I love my LP 640. And my Ferrari, Ferrari, I love that car. Man. Which which Ferrari do you have? I had I, I had his total. Now I had an LP six forty. What Marcy happened Mark. to it? My one of my friends. Oh, the Lambo. LP yeah, one of my friends. He like helps me with my cars because because okay. I'm I'm lazy. I like to
He, uh, you know, he wouldn't go do it for me. He didn't charge me no money. So, yeah, he's driving. He goes and shows out. He ends up getting drunk and totals my car. He almost Damn. killed himself. He almost killed himself. The car would flip. You see the car, you think he what was What color dead. was it? It was lime green. Damn. It was that car? It was the LP640, yeah. yeah that was yeah. Damn. Damn. But you have a Ferrari like you said you No, I don't have, I don't, I don't. Do you get a DUI? Wait, what, what do you No, he, 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 he left, he fled the scene. It's wow. so tough to allocate by Ferrari. Wow. Like to get in, what to get MSRP. What kind, of, what kind of Ferrari? I had a roast. Hey, what's, Tributo. what's that, what's that? Bring that up, Chin. F8, F8 Tributo. Tributo. What's the new Corvette that just came out? I don't know the name of it. Someone's telling me it's very nice. I have a buddy, I have a buddy that bought one. They're cool. What's that? It looks pretty nice. But I don't like the new Corvette. I don't like the brand new Corvette that just came out. But those new ones are mid-engine. So that's your car. That's the new, that's a new. That's the Ferrari. Yeah, that's the F8 Tributo. Beautiful. beautiful but mine's the spider it's, so it's the it's more like the yellow one yeah, that's nice go to the yellow one and it's uh british green Damn. with the uh, tobacco interior that's nice Ooh. it's impossible to get allocated so when really you, yeah impossible and and by the way you can drive that for five years and you sell it back for the same amount of money almost more really for real for that so car. you're driving it for free almost Especially that car the is fucking pretty this wow. one right here is this the car you're getting yeah that wow. Jeez, that's I, I just ordered it yesterday. Now you know, what, what, what I like about Brennan is he'll buy a car like that, and most people will keep that. They'll take it on the weekends for an hour. He drives it every day. It's his main. Yeah, but, wh- but like how far? I, I drive it like I stole. Yeah, but how far? Yeah. How far? Yeah. How far, how far do you live from here? From here, I live you know eight minutes. But yeah, see drives, that's the thing. No, but I drive. Oh, do you? But remember, I just moved here. Okay. Yeah, to the studio. I used to be in Santa Monica for. Got it. Six, yeah. seven years. So he was driving, uh, an so I was hour, driving two he hours, was driving two hours a day, no matter what. To, to you you just day. moved here. Just moved here. Yeah. Okay, so but then you're you're. Wait, I seven, live in, I live eight minutes from here. Where did you, you where, where did you live when you were had your studio in Santa Monica? Here, but my studio was in Santa Monica. Gotcha, gotcha. Yeah, yeah, you yeah. were driving. Yeah, that's yeah, too much. Now, man. Dude, he oh, drives that 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 Porsche. I was wondering why you didn't film till like ten. I was like, shit, man, get out of bed, lazy. He's like, yo, we filming at ten. I'm like, ten. That's fucking great. Damn. Yeah, I love him. I love cars, man. I can't yeah. get enough of them. I just never, I, I don't know, I don't care. Do you, you know who Doug Merrow is? He's like the nerdy car guy, and he's like the biggest YouTube yeah. car yeah. guy. Yeah. I saw him at that Cars and Coffee, man. Like, you know, you know you're going to make fun of me, but really? I will say yeah. this. Really? Yeah. Yeah. I was like, oh, what's sick. up, Doug? That's sick. You'll, you'll make fun of me, but I, I I know you like fashion. I've been watching Next in Fashion on, on Netflix, the best fashion designers. Like, <laughs> You get any tips? Because you're dressed the exact well, same. Well, I'll never dress that way, but I have to say that they're such artists that oh, I'm yeah. obsessed with it. The best. They're, they're such characters, the people themselves, but God damn, they're good at what they do. I love anybody who's really good at what they do. Even even fashion, I know nothing about it. I love that show. So we got oh, so we got yeah, one more nice. fight chin than, than the main. Yeah. What is it, Kev? The, yeah. You have sure, the Serrano, one of the should be the girls. girls. Yeah, yeah, she's she, good, she's man. Gonna beat the show, she's dude. fucking she's good. A mm. She's a monster. She's, 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 she trains out. She trains over at Ruka. Ah, uh, God! I can't. Oh fuck! Her, her first name's on the tip of my tongue. Wait, no, Dubois. I watched that. Did you see? Oh, the, we've, uh, we've got we've got this fight here yeah, instead. No, first. Oh wait, what? Damn. Yeah, two more fights. Did yeah, you yeah. see the? Uh, this is taking forever. Did you see the fucking? Uh, <laughs> I mean, you know, after a while, you're like, come on, guys. Did you see the fight <laughs> with? Uh, uh, I mean, you see the documentary on Christy Martin? No, I watched it. I loved it. It's so good. It's so good, dude. It's so tra- how tragic is Christy it? Martin. Her train, so the Christy Martin, you know, she's a Mike yeah. Tyson female. Yeah, she gets on the Mike Tyson card. They have the fight of the night, she seems and so then awesome. she bl- she gets super famous. And then they thought she would like bring other women up, but she was just a shit talker. So she was she was like kind of all about herself. So all the girls get them for her, and then she starts dating her trainer. They get married, and then uh, she's a lesbian. So she's like always been hiding that all her life, and then she meets her like it was like the love of her life from high school, and she starts hanging out with her. And then uh, this guy just controlled everything. That's him, the scumbag. Controlled everything, right? Just controlled her entire life. So she leaves, doesn't tell him, leaves. And he goes, if you leave, I'm going to kill you. She looks him in the eye, yep. eyes and goes, then do what you got to do. And then walks out the door. And she's with this girl for, you know, like four or five days in Florida. And then he finally gets a hold of her and he's like, come back. So she's like, right, I'm going to come back, get my shit. Comes back and he stabs her and shoots her. What and, she survi- and she survives. Yes. And then he's in prison for the rest of his life. Yeah, he's a it's bad a crazy. Guy. It's a, such a good documentary. What year was this? Uh, that was like in the nineties. Yeah, it's oh, be. she started stop fighting like two thousand two, maybe two thousand four. Yeah, man. but it's Jeez. such a good documentary. It's on did Netflix. he kill her? Or did he just stab no? He, no, he stabbed her and shot her and thought did she was dead it. and went to the shower and she escaped. Holy wow. shit! You, so wait, she, so he's so tough. Wait, wait, he shot her. And then he stabbed her, shot her, and then took a shower. Yeah, to to get all the blood off and thought she was dead. And then she dipped out. Damn, dude. And and now she's she's married to the or uh, she's dating the girl who she fought. She's she's this other female girl. This girl, yeah, such a good story, man. 
Is this what this documentary is like live right now? Yeah, like just thing? came out on Netflix. It's so okay. goddamn Crazy. good. There's the, there's that new documentary about Mon Monica Lewinsky that's coming out with Bill Clinton and Monica. Oh really? Really? I guess a new like, a whole new one. I guess apparently it's dropping like I'm pretty that. soon. Check that one. I'll watch that. I'll watch that. I will check that out. I'm gonna go watch this. Damn. What's it called? When's, when's that drop, Chen? Do you know? I'll Monica, check it out right now. The Monica she's, Lewinsky she's, documentary. She's gonna tell us about like her. And, I guess sucking off Bill Clinton. <laughs> Think about what she was 22, 21, 23, somewhere around she there, was right? Young, yeah. By the way, old by Bill, the way. that old scallywag. Yeah. Fucking. <laughs> that old hey, scallywag. I love Bill. I voted for him. Yeah, yeah big does. old Dick Willie. <laughs> he, put, he put in work. He put, oh, in, all, yeah. he put in work. Dude, he has yeah. some serious issues. Yeah. Back There's back a bunch. In Arkansas. By the way, 40 years old, not bad. He 39. Is fantastic. he 40 now? Uh, is he 40 yet? At least 39 right now. He'll be 40 here in the next, I think, in the next couple weeks, though. Are his eyes blue there? No, that's the camera. Okay. He's probably by a pool or some shit. Thirty-nine. He's a stud, though, man. He is, man. Like, he's explosive. He's fast. Bro, have you? Have, did you see when him and uh, Jake Paul sat down to like talk shit? Jake Paul's not great at talking shit. Yeah, man. yeah, no, it's no, like no. real cringy. And well, you know, Willie's a real well, the dude. Thing, the thing that's funny I noticed is <clears throat> Aiden Ross made like being sus, like pretending gay, really popular on the internet. Okay. And then Jake Paul, have you? Did you see the interview? No. Watch, did you did you watch that interview? He just totally ran with the whole like, let me try and act like I'm gonna squeeze. Oh, you're your talking butt. about his ass and stuff. Yeah, yeah, yes, exactly. Yeah, yeah. I posted it. It's, it was fun as hell. He had, and he, Willie's not playing. I didn't see. I didn't see Willie's reaction on the clip. And, and he He's said, not really reacting. Yeah, that's strange. Why? This, so Jake wasn't that good at talking to trash. It's just like he just pulled the whole sus thing, and that was it. Uh, I didn't know it was a thing. I, yeah. I was just like, oh, this is weird. Yeah, I mean, if you don't know the, I guess the yeah, if you don't know that, playing, I was yeah. like, yeah, this is very strange. The clip, the clip I saw was funny as fuck. What yeah. is what happened? Which one? By the way, Jake yeah. Paul is a big. He's big, dude. dude. Yeah, he's big. Like, he, he, I think he cut he's to one ninety for the fight, but he's gonna walk in probably two oh five. That's a lot that's to like deal with. Probably about two oh five. That's a lot to deal with. Willie's gonna come in probably one ninety. That's what I'm saying. Yeah. The weight difference. Yeah, the si the reach, the reach, and the height. But the speed's gonna go to Woodley for the first, at least for the first three or four rounds. Woodsy, he is extremely explosive, extremely. But he is thirty nine, and <clears throat> damn, I just think the weight difference. R is... Rampage, how do you think uh, John would do at heavyweight? John Jones? Yeah, man, I think John Jones is one of the best fighters in the world. Oh, ever? Yeah. I, I think, uh, I think he'll do do um, good against like the um, smaller heavyweights. But you don't think he'll do well against like Francis or yeah. Cyril Gunn? I think, I think he'll take Francis down and and you know. Do his thing. So I think he yeah. probably would. But I think if he get hit, if he get it's hit gonna once, be a problem. He, yeah. I think if he get, I think if he gets hit once, he'll probably get knocked out of that weight class. Yeah, he'll I probably think, leave I that think weight if Cyril Gan fights Ngano, I think Cyril Gan is going to give Ngano big That's a good fight. Yeah, well, yeah, that guy moves. Beat, good. He gonna, moves good for a bit. I think he's going to beat Ngano because by first decision, of all, they, they trained that. together. I think they were in the same camp for a year. No, not even that long. Like France talked about that. France, France was like, we we were in that. Close yeah. training part. Like, Cyril Gunn, acts, Cyril like the UFC is trying to paint it like we're all close. He's like, yeah. I trained with him like a few times. Yeah, that oh, kickboxing yeah. is no he's joke. Like no, his kickboxing and his wrestling Crazy. is better than than in Ghana's. You could you could argue. Who's his? You better? could argue Cyril Gunn. You could argue that. I think he's had two. Submissions. Oh, his wrestling. His wrestling is for sure better yeah. than in Ghana's. Yeah, for sure. For really? Ghan, Ghan, yeah. Ghan, neither Ghan one's gonna. They're, they're, they're not. They're, neither one of the top that, level like, wrestlers. Have you said that in Ghana's stuffed those Stipe st uh, takedowns like just that sprawl was just like. He yeah, was but like, Stipe, Stipe shot. Stipe sprawl. shot under pressure. He shot because he, he got. But also, he, he also stuffed Curtis Blades takedown. Yeah. Who's in Ghana's next fight? That's big. Who Who is in Ghana's next fight? It's gonna be Cyril Ghana in France. Yeah, and. It's signed. Yeah. No, no. I'm, I'm gonna put my. They're working money on Ngannou's contract right now. Yeah, the like problem is such a good Gano's fight. contract. He wants more money. He right. deserves more money. Yeah, for sure. Yeah. 100%. How, much, how much is he getting paid? He got paid five eighty five last fight. How crazy is that? And oh, they're like, oh, fight or that's when they said fight John Jones. He's like, bro, pay me like I'm fighting John Jones. Right. Quit paying me five hundred. Oh yeah, look at that. Guys. Holy shit. Yeah, that's crazy. Is is is. Is, what uh, forty grand? Yeah. John Jones gonna fight. The only reason why he made, well, the reason why he made the eighty five, he's got a seventy five thousand dollar bonus. Okay, and then he got another like ten grand for Monster or for yeah. whatever the sponsor uh, was. Yeah, whatever it was from, from, was from the little uh, short sponsor. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Wow, bro. They they but, started. But, but we were John there. We were there during the good times. Yeah. In terms of you know, oh, that's man. why I left the uh, the UFC because they took my Reebok deal. That was uh, my, Reebok was sponsoring me originally. York and then it was my deal. Oh wow. And then Dana Dana White was like. We don't got to deal with, with with Reebok, like you, you know. You don't got to deal with none of the other sponsors that I be having on me either. Yeah. And they they told and then I said fuck you Reebok. Yeah. I, fuck. 
I was making I was making probably close to eighty to eighty five thousand a fight in sponsors. Yeah, and they and they and they they took it. Yeah, they took it. How how, how much does it fuck you up? Well, I always wonder with someone like John Jones, if you're a fighter, and you're taking that much time off. Yeah, does that fuck with your head? He's doing it to build his body. That's what he says. But then he's also doing it because. He wants his pay to fight the biggest yeah. heavyweight fight of all time. I'm going to tell you something about John Jones, what I noticed about him, and I noticed it too late after I fought him. His mind. It's his mind. His mind is is really strong. When I, when I fought John Jones, I, I honestly underestimated him because I was in really good shape, and I wasn't. I didn't have any injuries. So the little knee injury that wasn't that bad back then, but I've, I've never lost a fight in that good of a shape. I was in Colorado training, and I was training there for a couple of months. My cardio was meant. I was in, I was in the, probably like one of the best shapes I've ever been, uh, and I was just like, there's no way I'm losing to this kid. But his mind is so his, strong. Yeah, his, his, well, what was what, hold on, his what mind? do you mean by that? What do you mean? Like, what do you mean by he, his mind? He has no weakness. Like, like yeah. no matter how the fight's going, he's, yeah, he didn't, he, he didn't he, there's, falter. There's he, no quit ever, yeah. ever, ever. Oh, and like, yeah. his, he's so strong mentally. Like when he fought Ryan Bader or Gustafin, he barely trained. Like Gustafin, it was a five round war, war. Dude. like war. war. He barely yeah. trained for that fight. Like, but he goes in the fight believing that he's the best in the world. But here's the thing: like you, I want you, I want people to remember this: is when he fought Chael. He got through that round with his fucking foot, ri- his toe ripped his toe off. Ripped off. His bone was sticking out of the front. They actually panned down. They actually had to to stop. And yeah, they, they tried to cut it. it. Yeah, they tried to clip like clip away from it. They didn't realize his toe was facing this way yeah, and the was. bone was sticking out straight. Yeah. Yeah. He looked down. He didn't even realize until after the round and ended. He looked down. He's like, he almost passed out. You could tell he was sick to his stomach by looking at his fucking own toe. He's so focused. But he was so focused on beating Chael. He got through the first, the rest so of the round and finished him. Some people, believe, that. some people believe in, in in the power of the mind, like being mentally strong. Some people believe in it. And if you if you tell yourself something and you really believe in it, you yeah. and you have. No doubt, you can do it. And that's like, how John Jones is. Yeah. His mind is really strong. Like, I don't think John, like, I mean, he's good at everything, but he's not, like, great at everything. It's, mm-hmm. his, it's his mentality. But he's, hey, he's, he's, he's like creative. the dirtiest fighter. He's the dirtiest he's fighter, creative. too. creative. Someone told me but, that. No, no, no. But honestly, I haven't seen it. Honestly. <clears throat> you haven't seen this? No, I'm seeing it. They, they, they had to change the law. The fingers, they had, the fingers, fingers, so they had to change the, the rules because of him. Open hand lock. When I fought him, whenever I was, whenever I was, like, have any type of advantage, he'll put his fingers in my eye. Uh, let, me, let, me, let, me, let me do this right. How, how uncomfortable is this fuck right here? That, man. That's uncomfortable. Your eyeball is your weakest yeah. thing on your body, right? So when I was fighting, Eyes him, and nuts. He, he was like this the whole time. It's hard to train for this too. Yeah. And so he poked. <laughs> yeah. he, poked, he, poked, he, poked <laughs> he said that he poked hey, me. In, he poked me in the eye. And then, then, and then, and then when you come in and advance, he kick your knee backwards. Hey, you know, you they know, should, they should make uh, that. They should make that I, illegal. I told, they really I told, should I told make Brandon that. I saw illegal. this guy. I was talking to him. Real nice guy. There's a fight breaks out. He goes to try to break it up. Tall, kind of thin black guy. I guess he's a singer. <laughs> and uh, fucking, he walks over, and these two big dudes are fighting. Oh, fuck you! And then he goes, "You got." He goes, "You guys should calm down because they're neighbors." And the guy goes, "Man, fuck you!" And comes at him. And the guy, I didn't even see. It. He just goes like this. He goes, <laughs> "Lazy with with pepper spray." Lazy, <laughs> like that. The guy goes, and I, dude, hey, hey, no matter how tough you are, you just go. What? He crawls. He gets on the hand knee, crawls from the street to the high sidewalk, but he finds milk? a doorway, and just he's over there. And then this girl goes. What the fuck, you son of a bitch! And comes at him like that, and he goes. <laughs> so, uh, round two, and now round I come two. over, and I'm like, I'm like, oh, I'm, don't, I'm no, afraid. No. I'm like, maybe he's gonna get me, but I was just oh, talking about, like, what are you doing? You are, what's, what's happening? He goes, he goes, ah, it's fine. Hey, uh, <laughs> wash your eyes out with milk. No, he, just walked yeah. off. he get, walked off. He get, walked off. He got in his car, little car, little white car, shitty car, and some other people got in the car. He goes, get in the car, and I go, the cops. He goes, I know all the cops. I go, okay, and he just pulls out casually. Putters out, just goes. Doo, 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 doo. <laughs> now I'm now I go. Does anybody have any water? I'm helping the girl. I don't know what to do with that, so I'm pouring water in her eyes, which apparently you're not supposed. Did you to get do. the milk? Yeah. Just water spreads She's it. She's drunk as fuck. I'm trying to help her, and I'm and, I, and I'm trying to calm her down. And I'm going. Uh, uh, Taryn was there from yeah. Taryn Tactical, so Taryn's one oh, gave shit. me the milk. So I go uh, the water. So I go. You're gonna be fine. I go. This has happened to me twice. I just said that. She goes. She goes it has. I go. Yeah, yeah. You're gonna be fine. <laughs> yeah. I know it feels like you're gonna die, but you're not. It's not a big deal. It'll go away soon. I'm As trying you're to calm spreading her down. it in her fucking yeah. eyes. Yeah, yeah. And, and meanwhile, I get it in my fucking eyes and my oh, nose. Oh, it's like, brutal. Because I'm. Uh, I don't realize I'm doing this shit, bro. And I. Oh fuck. The whole thing was about. Then I go take a piss. <clears throat> Oh, it's on your dick yeah, now. That's the worst. Oh, no. right? It's on your dick that's now. You forget, it's funny. You forget. You know when your parents tell you like, don't touch your sister, don't touch your brother, and like I used to do this shit. I'm not touching you. Oh, oh my yeah. god. Yeah. He's talking but about the John Joe shit, you, right? Yeah. yeah. To your point, eyes are the most. I don't even fuck how tall. Eyes you are. and nuts. You're right? fucked. Yeah. And neck. 
Eyes yeah. and nuts, but mainly eyes, right? Eyes are terrible. Oh. Yeah. You just saw like a little piece of dust in your eye? God, it's dude. Game over, man. Yeah, man. Game over. Getting John's in there. poking the fucking one, eye. One of these, just go, shut up. Pokes yeah, they change the rule, though. The you close, How you say what? Fist. Pokes you in the eye and kicks you in the knee. It's fucked yeah, up. Yeah, yeah. Every, every time I every time I got any type of advantage, the eye, the hand was in. He poked me in the eye, he poked me in the eye once or twice in the fight. Ugh. But I had, in training camp, I won my last sparring. I already had the, like, you know, the little red blood vessel because somebody poked me in the eye in training camp because we were trying to train for that shit. And it's, you can't train for it. No. You can't train no. for it, so I already, my, I was already, I was already fucked up. No. Yeah, it, it, so it was really, it was really hard fighting him. So he, if anybody get any advantage on him, he's going to kick your knee backwards, he's and gonna keep you away, and he's going to figure it out. He's going to figure it out. That knee, that knee, that front kick. They should make that illegal. Yeah, yeah, that's yeah. stupid. Really? It's so stupid. Yeah, yeah I think it's it started it's him doing it with you, really, it is, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's more time. And everyone copy. Everybody copying it. Spread like Wi-Fi. That can that can end people's career, and you know, there's just no need for it. No need for it. Isn't it how Sarah Gon won? He just won like that. Yeah, he does that. That's a Muay Thai thing, yeah. I think. They do that a lot. Like they just he, like, wrecked They get away with it by saying it's like a, what, uh, 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 what do they call it? They're trying front to say kick, a like front a kick, push like kick. push, push, push oh, your leg. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They get away with saying they're trying to push your leg, but it's actually your knee. Yeah. I, trying see, to I, 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 knee I've right. always thought you should, that, 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 that I don't like that move. It should be illegal. It should be it should illegal, be but. Well, because the I same understand. thing, like, you got to protect the product. So, like, in the NFL, they made it illegal to hit quarterbacks below the knees, the Tom Brady rule. Yeah. So, it should be illegal to. Tom Brady has a whole bunch of rules, though. The tuck rule, the knee rule. Yeah, but it's still. What about what about kicks? That's it. So that that you but you, but it's, it's not going to end your career from a calf kick. That yeah, knee kick is destroy kick your, your knee, fine. like you, destroying you, you, your uh, knee. But, but what about kicking to the knee at the side? I mean, it's, no, you can that's, make these that's fine. But still different. The no, front different. on yeah, that push with yeah, the heel, yeah, like yeah, hyperextend your I knee. Know, yeah, yeah. You can't see your foot. That's a whole different. So you'd make that illegal? One hundred percent. Yeah. That would change. They're also not fun to watch. What did Big John McCarthy say about kneeing, kneeing to the head when somebody's down? It's just. It, 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 it just never happens. Yeah, I, 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 I like I like that rule. That's prior. I love that. I wish they had prior. Yeah, prior especially with uh, yeah. Dagestanis coming over. Like they let that happen. Him to both finish fights. Yeah. Yeah. Finish fights because yeah. they're controlling the, so the, the game. So then the fights become. But can they like in decisions? But then finishing. But you you said that with the Dagestanis. I agree with you 100. percent They'll finish more fights. But the other thing though as well is that when they start to get tired, because some of them do get tired. Not all of them are Khabib's. Is that when they do shots and they can't get the takedown, they can be finished too. Sure. So that's the other thing because yeah. they're the ones shooting so much. Yeah. So when you yeah. start stuffing their takedowns, yeah. you start kneeing them on the head, they all of a sudden become guard pullers. That's right. yeah. So now that changes the game in terms of like they don't get the takedown, you're fucking them up. And yeah. also, if you were allowed to knee to the head, um, you would start, people would adjust. It would change yeah. fighting. You'd adjust. You'd figure out how it'd be to. Great. I think it'd be yeah. great. But then uh, Big John, I forget what he, she shot it down. He's just saying how hard it is to get rules changed. Yeah, I mean, like, think about this. Like, like, when I make the still, rules, he, they're yeah, still in this whole. This whole six. twelve to six. Our big John, he made the UFC rules. Yeah, I never knew that. So yeah. What about the yeah. twelve to six? Why? Why? That. Why that? Just dangerous. because there was they the saw commission. Old taekwondo guy fucking do it, and they're like that. With that much power, you can break somebody's face. Those but, are illegal. Yeah, but the bottom line is though, is that it's the same fucking thing when you're laying on the ground. Sure. Just hitting someone's yeah. head when it's down here. It's only like twelve John to six. Fight doing that to Matt like Hamill. This. Yeah, he got, he so, got, he got uh, disqualified because yeah. you can't throw to a down opponent like. Although, this. although who did that? Uh, I think uh, Travis Brown. John Jones well, did Tra- it. Travis uh, behind the ear, but he oh, but, but he, he, oh, yeah, he Travis yeah, Brown yeah. did it like this. Oh. So that you was can my do first that. time seeing somebody get knocked out yeah, like that. Man. Oh, with Josh Barnett, right? Yeah. He did to Josh Barnett. Yeah. He did Gonzaga. He did another dude. And I like wanted Josh Barnett to knock Travis. I, I I don't like Travis Brown at all. Oh, Why? I, I wanted to go up to heavyweight just to fight his big ass. I probably would have lost because he's so so bigger than me. But I wanted to kick his ass. Why didn't you like him? Because I had a dog. I had a cane corso that I got from from one of my good friends. I love it. And um, Travis Brown, Hans Molenkamp told me I got somebody to train your dog. And he gave it to Travis Brown. Travis Brown kept my dog for like six to eight months. God damn. And she came back dumber than when she left. Oh, that's disrespectful. <laughs> he just didn't do anything. He didn't, now yeah. you don't like Travis Brown. That's yeah. disrespectful. And I paid him. And he that's never, he never re- oh, wow. reimbursed me. I'm like, man, give me, give me my money back or something. My dog is dumb as fuck. <laughs> Damn, for six and that, months, and that dog cost me so much money. Yeah, oh. King Corso is expensive. Because she, yeah, she no, 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 because she, no, she passed away. Uh, Two East, Easter's ago, she she just destroyed my backyard. You know what I'm saying? She kept she kept like destroying stuff. And you think I had maybe a, maybe he tried, and the dog's just a dumbass. Maybe. I don't know. Maybe, I, 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 maybe maybe he could have talked to me or whatever. Yeah, maybe 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 maybe, maybe he maybe oh. he did. Damn. Whoa, the big boys fight here. This how this fight's what's good. He's done. He's but done. already he's done. one. He's done. That's what they want. Was it how how long are these rounds? Come on, get up. Three minutes. Three minutes. Wow, already one minute. He stood up at nine. That boy's fucked. He was doing all right. No, he, he's in trouble, though. It's only been a though. minute, Brian. <laughs> <laughs> 40 seconds ago, he was good. Is that what she tells you?
He should be trying to hug. But th- this black guy from England, he, yeah, he's a huge favorite. Come on, just. No, just oh, oh, he's, 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 like that, he's, he's a fighter, man. Italian? Or Italian yeah, he must Trump? be Italian. It looks like he's Italian. Uh, oh, he's, he's, giving up. Up. he's giving up. Yeah, he he's wants done. Yeah, he won out. He's, he's like, give me my check. I'm literally just trying to see this Jake Paul. Like, 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 check, yeah. please. Uh, <laughs> yeah. I can't even lie. That doesn't look like fun. Come on, man. Uh, what's the oh, record? Yeah, if you got, get knocked down yeah. three times, you're done. Did right? they got the three three knock down? No, yeah, I, don't know. I think so. Can't oh, hear right that's now. He doesn't want to be in there. Oh, he, oh, he, uh, oh, wow. Oh, he's going to get fucked right now. Oh. Here it goes. Oh, dude, he's throwing Oh, uh, God, come on, dude. Oh, yeah, oh it's done. over. Done. Stop done. the fucking fight. Done. There we go. All right. There well. we go. One more fight into another huge mismatch. That's like Bradley and Dylan Downs right there. <laughs> right, get him, Bradley. Get him. Get him, baby. Zero chance. Especially because think about it, the Jake uh, Paul crowd, they're like, broken or some shit they just want knocked. They like they're just, they're just foaming at the dick for Jake Paul. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Without a well, doubt. Well, they don't even have All these fights then. Like I don't. Understand. I'd be fine with no undercard. Right. They but then it's Showtime, right? They're a real production. Like real so, boxing. there's yeah, the women are fighting now. Yes. Okay. Yeah, they're good though. Serrano's a yeah. monster. Yeah. yeah so oh, I want to see this fight. absolute model, yeah. monster, dude. She's fucking amazing. You said model, but that's model, but kind of. She's actually not bad looking though. Hey, uh, she's not. She's cute. She's not. She's cute. Yeah. What, what is it? Errol Can you pull up her Instagram? Uh, yeah. Right yeah. She's, yeah. she's cute. Just for research purposes, I just want to see what's going on. And she's like what, 17-time world champ, some shit like that. She trains over Ruka, so like that, with Bisbing, Perillo, that whole group. She's over there every once in a while. She's cute. She's yeah, cute. She's a stud. Oh, she's yeah. Cute. She's from Puerto Dang. Rico? I ain't mad at it. No. <laughs> okay. Uh, yeah, Jake was the one fighting for the fighter pay on that, right? Mm-hmm. Which is dope. For what? For her? Yeah. For, for everyone. Really? Everyone, for everyone on the card. Nice. You want to make sure she got paid in every way on the card, but especially her. Shit, I trained with a girl who was, she was smaller, smaller her name, uh, Karina Moreno. She was the 104 champ, 108, in 112 in boxing. Yeah. And like the most she ever made was like 25 grand. She's a five, she's a WC, WBO world champ. Five, four or five time world champ. What's her name? Karina Moreno. That's the problem. Karina yeah, Moreno. It's like no money. It felt so bad. Yeah, it's like, it's like, <coughs> nobody's going to watch. It's like, yeah. how many seats how are you seats selling? Can you, yeah. How many seats can you sell? Sucks. Damn. But that's mm. like that Christy Max. She was saying, I didn't make yeah, money until I fought on the Tyson card. Everybody knew my name. Then after that, I was making real That's money. Right. She was before that, though. I was fighting for free. Yeah. Well, yes. it's like stand up. Is stand up any different? Not Same really. thing. Same if thing. you can't put butts in the seats, you're not making you're not any paid. money. And there's some great comics who can't put butts mm-hmm. in the seat. Mm-hmm. But if you're a club owner, what are you going to do? You're going to bring the guys you to sell pay tickets. Your bills. It's expensive. Yeah, they're like, club. dude, we love you. You're a great comic. If you're not yeah. You can't tickets. make money off of you. And it never you can't you sell drinks. Stay relevant too. You got to keep doing your shit. Chat. Boom. I'm just I'm just letting the chat know that I'm here. Fight. They so I want the chat to know. That guy was clearly not in the same league. I hate when they do that. Heavyweights, man. Annoys me. Fucking the big boy can. Boom! Yeah. Right behind the, right right the back of the head. Sure Ouch. I'm gonna piss. Hold the fort down, B. Go ahead, buddy. I got you. Oh yeah. Want me to secure your hips? Are you okay? Also, chat. Oh, talk to me. Right. What's good? You're gonna be all right. Talk to we'll me. I'm, I'm bit, reading right? the chat. I know they want this. What is it? I'm reading the chat. What, What's they the want chat the, they want the man dragon? No, no, oh. no, no. They want the man dragon at the end. Yeah, but, but right now I'm reading the chat and I'm going to make sure we're, we're talking to the chat. So chat, oh, talk to me. What's going on? Hey. Test Rampage. No, no, I'm not testing Rampage. It's <laughs> <laughs> not a good idea. <laughs> not a good idea. Wait, wait, Just man, do what's uh, good for your health. Test, no, I don't know. What's good for your health, bro? Math. Don't test Rampage. <laughs> I don't think they're talking about math. Uh, um, they loved your stories, though, by the way. Oh, thank you. Yeah, they loved your stories. Dude, Rampage is... Are you doing any acting right now? Uh, yeah, I I got um, I'm supposed to be doing a movie in uh, when, when is it? Maybe October. Uh, MMA. Have you taken any <laughs> acting classes, or you just? I had I had an acting coach and stuff before. Yeah, I worked you're good, dude. Oh, thank you, man. For real. Chat I'm going crazy. You're you're one of those guys. It's interesting. Some people can just stay relevant, and I feel like you're one of those people that would have been successful at whatever you did. You figure your shit out. But that's that's my that's my that's my problem. That I don't even, I don't really care about being relevant and stuff like that. It's like it's like my thing. It's like, right. You know, it's just... Uh, yeah, it's I, not on purpose yet. Yeah, yeah. It's like, I, <laughs> I love I love fighting. Yeah. But I'm going to be honest. Some people get mad at me when I say it, but I have to keep it real. If I... If, you know, when I, when I first started fighting, it wasn't popular, right? Right. And and uh, 
if I had known that I had to take pictures every time I go somewhere, <laughs> fucking where, I that never is would have done, yeah. yeah. done it. That is fucking yeah. Yeah. What do you think you would have been if you weren't a fighter? I'll be a uh, construction worker. My family owned construction companies back in my hometown. Uh-huh. I'll be there with in them. In Memphis. In Memphis, doing construction. All right. Most likely. Oh, but I wanted to be a pro wrestler. But, you know, uh, I guess I didn't think about the picture taking part, but I probably would have been a pro wrestler with a mask on, though. You just, didn't <laughs> like, you just don't like taking I never like taking pictures. Just because it's like a hassle. I, I, never, I just never like pictures. Yeah. I'm one of the people that don't like pictures. Yeah. And, you know, I grew up an ugly duckling. You know, my fam- I was so ugly, my family called me ugly. My mama, <laughs> everybody. I remember <laughs> one, of my, one of my most memorable moments about my auntie is she used to always call me ugly, right? And I said, no, I'm pretty. She was like, yeah, pretty ugly. <laughs> <laughs> oh my that's, my aunt, that's, my, that's my grandmother's sister. Oh, you know, my, my, shit. I don't think of you wow. as ugly. I don't, that's Dude, yeah. no, 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 no. I was you, ugly you, as fuck you, as a kid. You've been scarred, though. Yeah, yeah, been so scarred. Right, so no, no matter what people say, you... Nah, you I'm, you less ugly. That, I'm less ugly than I... Well, yeah, that's look, like Shab, I Shab has body dysmorphia. He still yeah. thinks he's a fatty fatty pants because he... Yeah. As a kid, he was... It, a it, it's, he's kind of a big guy, It stays with you. When you... Shit happens to you when a kid, it stays with you, right? I had scars all over my body. I've been hit by cars a lot and I, my, I got the older sisters used to scratch, scratch me up and shit and, I, and my nose was, was it didn't grow into my face it was real big I got a big gap and can you imagine I got scars all over my face big ass yeah. nose big ass yeah. gap I got scars all over my body and shit and were you they, always athletic though and strong? Uh, yeah always tough always tough my, my family thought I was gonna be big like Shaquille O'Neal cause I was just like a big kid how much yeah. you weigh right now current Ain't nobody big. Yeah. Oh, no. I, I, I'm, too, I'm 260. 265. <laughs> when, when, you, when you were fighting, what was your weight? I used to fight at um, 205. 205 and then heavyweight. 205, man. That's yeah. That's yeah. your frame, though. That's when you're shredded. Yeah, yeah 205, yeah. I'm too wait, wait, is that, is that you right there on the left? Right yeah, there. that's me. Hey, that's yeah. you right there? That's me at 17. Damn. Is that when you were a shitty high school wrestler? Yeah. Nice. <laughs> no, no, wow. no, 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 he said college. He said college. He wasn't. No, I no. was shitty in high school, but hey, I was undefeated. That. I was undefeated. I was yeah, see, that, that's not shitty. My brother brought me the chain <laughs> when I, my brother, my little brother, gave me the chain. And after I saw I wanted the chain, I went undefeated Damn. until until regional finals. I had a wrestling guy that I beat twice, and he was a senior. No one, no one knew who I was because before I was the cameraman. Nobody knew who the fuck I was, and they 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 cheated me and let him win. Damn. They How'd they cheat reason. you? They they let his time stall out. They didn't give me t- points. They didn't give me takedowns. Oh. They gave him points for stuff. Do you, do you still go back to Memphis a bunch? Yeah, or? I go whenever I, whenever it's I great get out there. I, I love, love it. I, I love just bought seventy seventy eight acres oh, in my home. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, I'm gonna go out there. I'm gonna build me a fucking crazy ass house, and I'm gonna. Yeah, like yeah. yeah. It's amazing. Yeah, yeah. 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 Were you yeah. I got a lot of friends from the Bay Area that just moved out to Memphis. I mean, I play football. It's probably about. Four or uh, five couples. Or? Yeah. I mean, you, ten, you ten. See how strong he is in the gym. Really? Yeah. Oh, you're crazy strong. I I, I dabble strong. a little bit. Stronger than you. He's strong. I don't know. I saw you curl like 100. percent I'm stronger you. than him. You are. Yes, in the gym. Now, in on. what stuff? Uh-oh. In anything. <laughs> Squatting, deadlifting. You it. name Here it. Doesn't matter. Now, hold on. Benching, it doesn't now, matter. You're, you're very like. Look, you want to fight Dylan Danis? No, no, no. I'm not talking no, about he's fighting. No, I'm talking about I'm talking about in the gym lifts. I'm not talking about. What was your max bench? Uh, 475, 500. Uh, that's more than me. Oh, 425. Than me. What was your dead? Bro, I mean, I could probably do 750 right now. Oh, yep. Jesus Christ. Damn. He's strong as shit. Oh, he's strong as that's shit. shit. Then. He's super oh, that's strong. That's crazy strong. He, he yeah. Yeah. That's that's the only goddamn gym I, I work out. 750. Yeah. That's fucking nuts. You've been living away since elementary, haven't you? Well, yeah, since I was Still, 15. That's a lot of weight, dude. No, oh, he's man. stupid strong. Yeah. Fuck, because yeah. some guys are bodybuilders and aren't necessarily. That's what that. I'm saying. You're talking about me fighting this fucking Dylan Dennis kid, and I talk shit to him on the internet. He never pulled up to my gym. I know, but I, I bet you're going to hear from him now. Cool. Yeah. I mean, he's like, he jumps in my live all the time and talks shit. I say, "Come, here's my address." I'm Dylan, Dylan holler at us. See, this is what I want to do. Dylan, Dylan yeah. you cannot fight Dylan Dennis. If he about, grabs I'm, you, if he grabs you, it's going to be bad. How much is Dylan Facetime right now? How much is Dylan Dennis? Nah. He's 190, <laughs> dude, and he's really, really good. Jiu-jitsu is weird. He's world class. Yeah, you'll get caught in some shit. I promise. I promise you, you're going to get choked out. I, I promise you. you know in a street fight? I'm not talking about doing jujitsu against this guy. Yeah. Do you know jujitsu? I mean, I've done a little bit. But I don't know it like he knows it. Uh, Obviously, he says it's 170 right here. Yeah, but he, he, he walks around 185. It's not fair. Really, it's not fair because he don't do jujitsu. So that's just what I'm saying. He's strong, yeah. That's why I don't want him to try yeah. to fight. Hey, but we, we all know though when you when you are a black belt, I don't care what black belt you are. When you start getting fucking punched in the face, you become a white belt real fast. This is all I'm saying. I'm not. He's made his career off of fucking proving black belts and white belts real quick. I mean, sure I'm a blue belt. I, I'm definitely <laughs> not saying I can. <laughs> He's on my blue belt. Hey, hey, is, is that you? Is you wrestling at the UFC it. Institute on your uh, IG? Yeah, it's on my. Bring IG. that up, Jin. Critique is uh, honestly. Yeah, IG. Right. Yeah, it's on. You, his re- IG. you wrestled okay. in high school? No, 
No, I didn't wrestle in high but, school. But Bradley's I'm, fucking athletic. Man. No, I'm sure you're athletic, but you know what I'm saying. Fighting I want to wrestle you and see thing. if I'm stronger than you because yeah, I'd love you, to. Because you, you're, you're stronger than me lifting weights. I can't lift weights. Strong? for shit. Yeah. Hey, I mean, hey, this, what is this? Man? No, look, Bradley's got a, you got a great body. <sighs> I mean, you're athletic as shit, but I mean, you look very good. In, uh, but I don't think I don't no, scroll down, that, scroll down. Keep that same I, energy, I just B. think I just think that this is a different thing. Oh, that when I'm wrestling Steve, you mean? Yeah. Steve is two tooth. Go up. Go up. Go up. It's right there on the right. Bradley, if you go, just just roll with Steve Wade two. 15 to 20 here. This, this guy. Who Let's is not this cut guy? your hair like that ever again. Steve? Yeah, okay. Who is Steve? What does he do? It's my buddy Steve. Steve will do it. You Steve, know Steve will do it. They all yeah. know Steve will Steve's do it. Steve's a regular guy, right? He's not Steve's a regular guy. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. well, he's going for the second leg. Yeah, you're going to, oh, yeah. I don't know. This is fucking but I'm not wrestling the guy. I wouldn't be wrestling the guy. You act like I would just try to wrestle him. Right. But now you're going to try to stand. Yo, Steve, get out of there, Steve. Steve, get out of there, man. Nice side choke. Now watch this. Watch this. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. <laughs> yo. He, he shit himself? Oh, no, shit. No, he's fine. We're just having fun. Yeah. Uh, you think you can tap Joe Rogan? Tap Joe Rogan? Mm -hmm. I don't know. I, I don't think so. No, I don't <laughs> think so. <laughs> talking about me tap him out? No, yeah. I don't know. I'm not talking about rolling. You, huh. you never like you were like the anti jiu Chris guy. Martin. Damn. Yeah, I, I, I never, I never, um, I never loved jujitsu. I didn't love it. I didn't like it. I, I, I didn't. You just like didn't it. like gravitate towards it. I, I didn't, I didn't like. I'm because I'm, I'm low key a germ freak, and he rolling around with sweaty ass dudes. I've had dudes sweat my mouth and shit. Yeah, fuck that. Oh. I, I stopped liking. Um, I, I had rampage. I mean, I had uh, Rashad rub, rub his big ass dick on my face before. <laughs> <laughs> he didn't wear a cup. I was like, bro, what are you doing? Yeah, yeah. Dude, it happens. I used to train with Tito, and he's always wear those. Those shorts with the flames on it. Yeah, he don't wear underwear, bro. And he got a long scrotum. And one time it, it, tea, <laughs> it tea bagged me, bro. And I was like, done. I'm, I'm like, Tito. I'm, I'm, I'm telling you, the most yeah. homoerotic yeah. thing ever yeah. happened to me was Rashad. He, he wears those spandex. Yeah, man. He didn't have a cup on. I didn't want to say anything. And he yeah. was like, let's roll it. Yeah, no doubt. <laughs> and then he went to, you know, like that north south, which uh, he already kind of oh, weird. Boy. And it just. Did you, did you did you did you tap out from there or, did, or did you yarn? She ain't bad. She ain't bad. She's she can box. Yeah, yeah. she's a baddie. Damn. So Dylan wants to fight you. You're saying he, uh, he just talks. He, he wants to fight. He wants to fight everybody. But here's the thing. But here's the thing. Bradley wants a fight. He want, like he's asked me like he wants me to find him a fight. Oh, you want to fight? I want an MMA fight though. I don't want to box. Hey, why don't we do why don't we do this thing with you? What? We can do it for the we can do it for like a podcast. We do it for a show. So my buddy Rich Chow, he does this whole Wimps to Warrior. They train you. They come in. They put you in a gym. They train you for six to eight weeks, and they schedule you a fight, and they make it like a charity event. It's a big it, deal, it, bro. Let me, can I can go I, ahead? Go all right, ahead. I'm sorry. Here's the problem. So from Wimps to Warriors, I don't know who they've had on there. Okay. The issue is, is Bradley is very successful in his space. Yeah. So he wants someone of equal clout, or which is very hard help. to find. He's very, very in his space. You, you yeah, you for like yeah, no, I, I get what you're saying. So maybe, maybe, yeah. maybe we, maybe I mean, we find another it, YouTuber fighter. Right you. you know what I'm, I'm saying? Right yeah. Maybe we find another. Maybe we find smart. another like top level YouTube guy to fucking hey, Dylan you guys, Dennis we both do it. There's not many though. Yeah, but let's do Dylan Dennis. Is he a top level YouTuber guy? No, but he's he's got a little bit of clout. Who Dylan? Dylan? They're trying, they're trying to get you MMA fucked up, bro. They're yeah, trying to get you fucked space. up. Yeah. They, they'd watch no, a lot. No, 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 no. I just think that... Who don't be throwing me under over here. <laughs> yeah. I don't know if Dylan's trying to do this to me right now. Are you this done guy. wrestling for real? Uh -huh. Not right now, obviously, but at some point. Uh, I would. I want, I want to see... Drive me ass to Long yeah. Beach. That'd be dope. I'll do it. All right. Come down. Yeah, come down to Tony McKee's here. Who else? Who else? Brendan find you and actually... I think Brendan is being tight-lipped right now, but I think Brendan would steer you away from Dylan Dennis. But is he here? But but I think I think you could find him another YouTube and, and, guy. And to find. He's being a little bit. One hundred percent, you can find somebody. He's being a little it's mischievous. Fun. You're making me mad right now. <laughs> it's fun. You're being. I can see it. Uh, it's fun. It's but funny. Bradley is athletic and strong than me. Hey, hey, you heard his numbers. Hey, listen, bigger than mine. Hey, look at me over here. I know that, and I see your. I see what you're doing. <laughs> yeah. and, and I can because I always uh. know. Brendan, you always know what Brendan's fucking around because he'll start doing this with his face. <laughs> yeah. and he'll go, It'll be fun. <laughs> yeah. Let's deal with this. Face But Brendan knows. He's like, just fuck around, and you oh, do shit. too. Hey. And you're a fucking bad guy, and you're a bad guy. I am guy. a bad guy. I am a bad guy. Because you're both bad guys, because you're like this. <laughs> yeah. My, my, yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. But just do it. Be. You know what my only thing is? is He like he won't like just fuck around. Like He'll train for I'm it. I'm sure he will. I'm sure he will. And I like this guy, and he's not a he's a he's he's got a gym. He's a good guy. He has DJ. And I, I'm, I'm a little protective over you, frankly. Because I appreciate I that. Happen wow. to, I, I, I don't want to see you. 
do something silly because it's a it's a language you're not you don't he's very fluent in that language and you will make a mistake like give him your ankle and then you and won't walk well time. for about nine months on your knee that's what Dylan Dance can do to you I promise yeah. Dylan I don't care and then your legs you go from being able to squat 700 yes. or something to like all of a sudden it ain't yeah. worth it nah, it's not yeah. worth it something bad will happen you with a guy like you have to flex on that on Bradley, like Bradley. numbers though man yeah, yeah, my bad sorry. Yeah. Bradley just smash him bro smash him <laughs> and listen and look at me I'm your friend they're not Bradley right Bradley <laughs> I'm just saying, just yeah, smash yeah, him, bro. Yeah, just yeah. Yeah. fucking shop over here. No, 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 no just smash him, bro. It'd be good. It'd be, be good. It'll be all right, bro. Because yeah. fighters, you know what fighters, you know what secretly what fighters, when, when a civilian says, I want to fight that guy, fighters go like this. They go, God. <laughs> yeah. That's what they do. Yeah. Oh, and it. you're getting the, That's you're right now, you're getting the, God. Yeah. Yeah. And they're going, see what happens. Because they know, but like, I understand oh, that you're shit. a big, strong guy, so you're confident. It's like a D1 lacrosse player who says, I want to fight that guy who can, who can, and then he, it's just different. It's a different language. Right. It's a different sport. Different sport. You're very, very strong because that's your sport. Bradley. Go ahead. <laughs> <laughs> I went to, I, went, I had lunch with this, uh, one of my son's uh, friend's dad. We like all went to lunch. And he's this dude from Houston. And he's like, Houston, Houston, dude. He's this black dude. And we're talking about fighting some. And he's like, you, like, you tell me right now, you, you could have beat up Kimbo Slice. I was like, what? He's like, 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 I've been in street fights, man. He's like, if you and me, and he's a bigger dude. He's like, if you and me get in a fight, man, and I, like, do a right hand, you're telling me. I'm like, you don't think I've seen a right hand before, Doug? <laughs> he's like, I know, but it's like, I'm pretty fast. So if I, like, uh -huh. lay this, I'm like, uh -huh. yeah, but you don't think I've seen a loopy right hand before, bro? <laughs> yeah. He's like, damn, that's crazy. I'm like, it's not, though, man. The, the best, <laughs> it's the best, just like. The best is I, I'm, I'm, I took boxing seriously for what two maybe three years yeah, with Wayne McCulloch two maybe three Wayne weeks McCulloch, world champion <laughs> yeah, complete waste in the Olympics yeah. 40 <laughs> 48 years old and Wayne is he they call him the pocket rocket five seven ah, legend. maybe five six Irish legend, legend yeah. but Wayne because he, he I'm paying Wayne and he loves me I love Wayne Wayne would he did an, an interview I would box he put me in there and I'd do my thing and then we would move around a little bit and then one day he said on the radio show in Ireland Brian can fight he can fight I put him in there with anyone and I went. I think you did his voice. Dude, and I went, oh, really? And he goes, I put you in there with anyone. And I was like, oh. So then one day, Wayne and I decide to do a little boxing, and Wayne just puts his mouthpiece in, and I start going, I start using my jab, because I'm, you I, feel now yourself. I know how to jab. So I, bop, mm -hmm. bop. And all of a sudden, Wayne goes, he, he's a fighter. So I started hitting him, and he goes, he turned it up a little bit? Turn it up a little bit. Yeah. And he's, he's like, here on me. And he turned my fucking <coughs> head tiny, around. Tiny. He turned... My head went, this is three years of me really working. My head went like that. And then he hit me in the body and I went, and we stopped and I went, he goes, you all right? And I go, oh, hey, wait a minute, hold on. <laughs> wait a minute, could you knock me on the first round? And he goes, and all he did was poke me here. He goes, I'd get you there. <laughs> and yeah. But you no didn't learn your lesson because remember you're paying your tennis trainer and then you're like, I'm actually doing pretty good, dude. <laughs> like you're paying the guy though? He goes, yeah, but you're not doing that. Tennis or boxing? <laughs> tennis too. Well, both. Yeah. 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 No, here, a little, for me, a little victory goes a long too. way and all of a sudden I'm ready for the championship. Yeah, you're ready that, to go. That, and I'm, I'm the biggest violator of that. That's why, Bradley, when I hear you, like I work at it and I, and I, but, but let's take Dylan, Dylan Danis out of it. Like say it's another YouTuber who doesn't have fight experience. Bradley's going to fuck him up. That's why this is hard to figure sure, out. Sure, because he's a big, yeah. strong guy. Yeah. See, but and this so is what I'm, that guy. This is what I'm talking about though with. up to fight Bradley. Right. But this is what I was talking about with boxing. Like Gordy, like, this is this is the issue that I have a little bit tonight yeah. with T Wood and, and Jake Paul. Yeah. Is that you're saying you're training with who is this guy? Wayne McCall. Wayne McCall. Wayne McCall. Wayne McCall. Wayne McCall. Wayne McCall. Yeah. So you're training with him. I like I said, I was sparring with uh, Robert the Ghost Guerrero. Yeah. Like he, he like yeah, in it. any he, he's 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 one forty seven. I was matter. walking I was probably about one seventy five. He's doesn't just matter. like it doesn't matter when they want to turn it up, they turn it up. Right. And I'm fresh for first four rounds. I'm training for 25 minute fight coming up. Yeah. I'm in the best shape of my life, probably one of the best shape for sure. He's just getting warmed up. Yeah, and he's he got did, patterns. He did. He's got he, patterns. did he did another fucking eight rounds with two other guys that were world champions in, in different weight classes. Yeah, and I'm like, yeah, he's just fucking piecing me up. Put me on a stanky leg in the fourth round, kind of ramping it up, like hit me to the body. Boom! I'm this like, is you boxing. This is me boxing only. Boxing and that's yeah. my point. My point is that like, look, Jake, Jake yeah, Paul yeah. is no no yeah. no no Robert Guerrero, but I'm saying like 
but guys that just focus strictly on boxing right. for a certain duration, you can't do it in ten weeks, which is what we're There's doing. Not enough hours There's not enough time. Different See, I don't, I don't like, want to hear that because my still, next fight is going to be a boxing match. Yeah, but that's the thing. Is it really? Yeah, it against Shannon be, Briggs. Uh, different though. Right? Wait, you're going to take that? I'm going to take it's, that. It's fight. Like I always wanted to box, but that's a heavyweight fight though. That, yeah. that, that's not yeah. angles. That, I mean, yeah. there is. But yeah. remember, it's, it's not the movement. It's not the output. But the only thing is, is Rampage. Your career was based off stand up. Yeah, you know. Yeah. It's a little different for you. That makes more sense. Yeah, and you've been fighting for a long time. Twenty years. Time. Oh, yeah, twenty. But does it doesn't like yeah. that's no, the thing. I, I know you're I, right. It, it doesn't matter. I fought for a long time too. Yeah. But it, when you get in there with guys that have been doing it, like Robert's been fighting since he was fucking like five. Yeah, that's that different. kid. Yeah, different. like well, the, the one thing they they what I notice is that they're just like just like with jujitsu, they're ahead of you. So what they've you're seen it all. Is, they've seen it all. So you're ahead of you. They're fucking. They're like a mile ahead of you. It's not even close. No, no. This is what it is. What you guys don't understand. You heard what he said. He's been doing since he was five. So they're a master at it. Correct. When yes. you when you start doing something young, you're you're a master. Like my oldest my oldest brother, he started driving when he was three years old. And and my mom told me, Yeah, wait, well, what? No, wait, 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 wait. No, no, no. <laughs> What's going they on? taught him how to drive What's when he was going three. On? My oldest brother. A lawnmower? No, three years old. <laughs> three years old. No. Yeah. Well, yeah, Memphis, Memphis, Memphis is a, you know, it's a, it's, it's is, is your brother Lewis Hamilton now? <laughs> 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 I think it was five, maybe. No, five. No, 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 my dad, my dad, my dad taught him how to drive, you know, sitting in his lap. Yeah. So, so, so my dad did the pedals. Yeah. But my oh, brother was driving. Okay. But he was, uh, my brother's okay. in full control. But, but when my brother was five, my mom had like one of those little, one of those little bit of uh, Pontiac, those little hatchbacks. The my Fieros? Fiero, yeah. I don't know, remember what it was, but, but. My mom told me she just let him go to the store and buy her cigarettes. Cause we, we, it's the it's the south. It's yeah, like, it's we knew the, we knew the owners of the store. Okay, and you just write a note. Yeah, yeah. yeah. My, yeah, my, my mom, mom said she wants some cigarettes. Him and be like, hey, give me some. Cigarettes. Five years yeah. old, he drive up to the store, get get the fucking cigarettes. Come back, and my brother is a really good driver. He's not a racer or anything. Yeah, never he, been in a car accident. He's good. He's a, he's a master. He could drive anything. Because I told you, my family does construction. Oh yeah, he drive all different type of trucks, all different type yeah. of machinery. Yeah, he's good at it. All he's been doing it. He's a master. He's, yeah. he's a master at it. And like AJ McKee, I seen a kid. I seen a kid in the gym. Oh, he came at this, I'm going to tell, yeah. tell you something. That kid, since he was three years old, was training with his dad. So I seen a kid do stuff in the gym. I'm like, I hope he's doing it in the fight. He yeah. does more to come back shit in the gym. Oh, he's yeah. such a badass. He's, I just see him doing like crazy foot sweeps and, oh, yeah. and shit like that. And like, but, I mean, haven't I you know. rolled with guys like Cron Grace here, guys like that who are so far ahead of you? They just have Yeah, so the, I'll tell you guys a story about BJ Penn. So, yeah. so I was training with friends. So I came down. I had, I had like probably about 10 fights before. Before I came and trained down in San Jose with Frank Shamrock, <clears throat> so I trained with Frank Shamrock, and BJ had just came into the into the scene when he started training at AK. So it was like ninety nine, two thousand. So BJ comes in, he's training at AK, he's getting ready for his UFC fight. He's the first American to ever win uh, worlds, which yeah. is down in Brazil. He's the first guy to ever win worlds as an American. So he wins it, and he comes in. Everyone they keep telling me how good he is, how good he is. I'm like, I, I didn't, get, I couldn't train in the afternoon with all the fighters training because I had a job. I was poor. And so I was fucking training at night, just like from basically 4.30 to 5.30 until like fucking 9, 9, 10 o'clock at night, training as much as I could. And so then they, they kept telling me, he's this good, he's this good. He came in, I was like, there's no way. This guy ain't that fucking good. I'm, you know, I'm tapping all of Frank's guys. I'm running the show kind of thing. It's me, Bob, Cook, and Frank. He fucking comes in. BJ fucking worked me over. I would say six, it, six, seven minutes. Tap me prog ah, six, seven times. Oh, <laughs> it, was like, fuck, it was like that. Fuck, no, it got to the point where they brought him in specifically just to grapple with me. Josh, don't do anything until you guys are ready to grapple. Jeez. Don't do any rounds. Don't train with anybody else. Just you and BJ. Wow. Well, it, dude, was, I mean, it was embarrassing. It was I embarrassing. You, when I saw you with Henner. Like, like he's a fucking beast at jiu-jitsu. I've dropped roll with him. Like, I actually real. told him this. Like, I've seen him. I've seen him personally tap big-time, world-class jiu-jitsu guys and fighters. <laughs> Nobody talks about it, but I've seen him do it with heavyweights, big-time guys, right? So Look. He's a beast. He's a beast. I'm not trying to stroke his ego. The first time we grappled was in Hawaii. That's when right. We did with the, BJ. We, yeah, BJ Penn's. Yeah. Uh, we Anthony did the gym. Pettis. Yeah, Anthony Pettis and uh, Mark Munoz. Yeah, that's right. So we were there. And I was like, I started falling. I was like, man, I'm gonna, I'm gonna pass this guy's guard. He's gonna throw me around, muscle me. Da-da. This dude has some technique, and I actually, of, I gave you a lot of props yeah, when we did right. Big Brown Breakdown. Yeah, a lot of I was technique. like, yo, he's, he's very. Technical. He's good. His ground is good, especially off the back too, because yeah, he was yeah. like, he could have gone on top of me and just smashed me. He's like, no, he played the guard game, but he was fucking working real good technique. You're a very no gi, no He's a very nice. He rolls. Yeah, he. He, he, he flowed real nice. well, and I was I was yeah, thankful because. But I watched Henner. I watched Henner just wrap <clears> you up. And me I was and like, Lyoto Machida back yeah, to back. Remember, and How I was much? like, and I was like this. I see Henner just wrap these guys up like it was. Yeah. Just, and I remember I was like this. I and was he was like, even remember when my mouth was open. I was like, yeah. How did he do? Because he started on his back. Yeah. Then he started on top of him, and I, and he turned, and I was like. 
So and, and Brennan goes, oh, you've never seen, oh, yeah. you. So there Hannah, are Hannah's been doing it since he was literally two. Oh, yeah. How many diapers? years do you have? 14 in jiu-jitsu. Oh, shit. Yeah. So you was doing jiu-jitsu when you was on Ultimate Fighter. So you yeah. Had, you was like, weren't, weren't you a football player first? Yeah. In the NFL? Yeah. Uh, I had like a cappuccino with the Buffalo Bills. <laughs> well, you had a cappuccino? <laughs> yeah. Like, we're he, he was there for a minute. Yes. Uh, he was there for a minute. Big time, yeah. one, big time <clears> two like, one. We're all good. Yeah. I talked to pro guys who played in the pros and said the only reason you weren't in the pros is you weren't seen by the right guys, though. Yeah, it was tough. Tough gig. Yeah. Thank so God, it's though. a shit situation, right? Yeah. Dude, like, it, so it, it really comes down to, like, if someone picks you up and they see something in you, the, the, your your whole career football could be made. Is but the, but yeah. then it was weird because when you're not drafted, you don't have, like, anyone that, like, there's no stock in you. Yeah. So the guys who were drafted, because I was an on, uh, undrafted free agent, so, like, the guys who were drafted would get, like, <clears throat> 40 opportunities in practice and I got one uh, yeah so it's like you have the one shot to do something then if they don't throw you the ball it's like oh, it's, that's it's, cause, it? it's yeah. because you never met the casting couch that's there you what, go that's what yeah. it was What's <laughs> up, yeah, I, yeah, I don't want to play that game yeah. <laughs> you gotta get on that what Harvey Weinstein yeah, thing man, right? yeah, <laughs> Fuck, yeah, you got yeah, on that couch yeah. whatever that Good couch luck. was that was a tough gig man now is this fight I mean does anybody know about this she's guy? good she, she's the biggest she's favorite on the card okay she's a monster yeah Hopefully it doesn't go long. Let's be honest. <laughs> well, how many yeah. rounds is it? Is the Jake Paul with it's the all fight? It's yeah, all the it's rounds. Yeah, so but, this, this, rounds, but this is so. this is a this is a real fight though. Yeah, oh, it's a real this fight. is a real yeah. fight. Yeah. Her opponent, her opponent is good. Hey, let, let me ask you this: huh? You know they're only doing two minutes though, two minute rounds. Oh no! Oh, for this one? Yeah, it's only two minute rounds. Hey, you, you so if there's two girls fighting, should they have ring men? I agree. Is that I a ring so. girls? Brian, I think so. You audition for the job, dude. I would love to be. I would. You'd be so good for it. Would you do it? I shave down, tan up. You can see that. <coughs> Get my hair done. Yeah, I can see it. I agree. I'm agreeing with you. All right. I couldn't see it. All right. Would you do it with me? No, I wouldn't. No way. No, I'm he's too like, shy. No. Why? Serrano is thought as a minus two thousand win. Yeah, I got that. Yeah. I wouldn't be the one. Other girls are minus two thousand. I'd be subconscious. Uh, <laughs> she, so like, she would, would be a plus one thousand. Shorts, so what, what I wear hot pants. I look pretty good in Fubu shorts. Those what are, what are those shorts? Don't those say little, Fubu though. Yeah, those tight little yeah. shorts. Why, why you can't say that? Well, I'm just saying they're, they're not Fubu shows. No, what are those little those little Asunga? sandals? Yeah, I look I look all right. I got a, I got an apple bottom on me. I got a piece on me. I, I do all right. Kind of thick. <laughs> what kind of shorts are you talking he talking about? Yeah, Brian got some balls on him, man. I'm looking a lot of guys. Big balls. So you have you have you have the Tito Ortiz ball sack. I got the big scrotum. For 20 years. You never seen the No, never. Oh, yeah, weird, I don't know man. If that's like first, weird. Y'all weird, man. First day I'm taking a pee. First day I'm taking a pee like this. Just, I don't even know. I grew up in locker room. He was like, let me see that. I grew up in locker room. He just looks like he just goes like that. And I go, I look at him like that. And he goes, just checking out what you're working with. Friends ever since. Friends ever since. That's how the bun started. Yeah, that's the initiation. New age. Yeah, that ain't me, bro. That ain't me. I grew up in locker room. Like my best friend in college, one of my best friends, Lawrence Vickers. He was a all pro in the NFL, the captain of our team. Stop. Bad motherfucker. From Fifth Ward, Houston, just a real like hood dude. Yeah. He's Who's this? Bad. Who's this? Lawrence Vickers. Okay. He's my best friend, one of my best friends in college. And I just I just couldn't get over it. Like I it, you had to bring attention to it. Like we're in the locker room, he took his pants off, you know, we we're about to take a shower. And his di- his dick was this microphone. <laughs> <laughs> and I was just like Bro, like, put that fucking. How did it make you feel? Was you, is, it, you I jealous? found it hilarious because after the, ap- I know it's funny because after the fight he would act like it was a mic. He'd be like, "The thing is, bro, <laughs> <laughs> oh, <shit. laughs> he's talking in his own." Yeah. I, I wouldn't just, want my shit that goes my own face. It was so big. He'd be like, "Listen, I, about the game." He's like, "Talk serious," and we would laugh. Everyone would laugh. He's so <laughs> hey, he's if it, anyway, I have a question. If it's that big, did you ever ask him? Did you try to suck it? No, <laughs> yeah, no. like yo, Why if it's that big. Gosh damn, super stuck. Damn, such a good leader, man. He was the captain of the. Dude, the, Browns. the way he talks that, then that one fucking clip about. Oh, he's like in shot. I'm, I'm that gonna whole... make you my bitch. Remember yeah. that? He he's such a bad motherfucker. Jeez. Damn. Super stuck. Oh, here we go. Here oh, we go. That oh, girl's sharp. Oh, oh my god. Shit. Ow. She's so. The problem with boxing, man, is it? You just know, you just can't do shit. Why do they put That's her right, in there? Mexican? You can already no, say. No, that girl's a stud, Brian. The other girl's right. champion. Yeah, this is a real fight. This is a real fight. Real fight. Yeah, that's right. a real fight. Okay. She, okay. She's ten years younger though. Yeah, she's a stud. I don't know, man. All right. Wow. No, this is this is super high level female boxing. B. Yeah. No. Okay. All you right. think they've been boxing since they were kids too? Yes. Like five years? Yeah. Yeah. Yep. Both of them? Uh, I would. I would yeah, imagine. That girl's from Mexico. Serrano's like, like the best. She's a monster. She, she looks that's amazing. That's the difference between boxing and and, and MMA. A lot of boxers have been fighting since yes. they were kids. Yes, they MMA, we haven't. They started seven, yeah. eight years old, man. You can see it. 
I think now, like kids who are born like five years ago, they're, they're yeah. gonna be MMA and have like fights yeah. and have the experience. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Gonna be like, yeah that's Whoa. what it's gonna be like. Yeah. That's what it's gonna be like. Yeah, because yeah. no, like no kid grows up like, especially now, like wanting to box. Like UFC yeah. so mainstream. So right. You want to be MMA? Damn. Right. right yeah. It's gonna be crazy, actually. Like yeah. a whole breed in ten years, yeah. 10, 20 years is gonna be like wild. the kids are gonna be good at everything. Yeah, I want to have Damn. another kid now just just for that. Put them in some fighting. They're training yeah. all this from. Yeah. from yeah. Dude, my thing is I I follow like certain boxing trainers. Like Tony Yanko boxing, Mustafa boxing, Coach Anthony. You I love watching. Them. I do because I watch them like teach kids the way they teach, the yeah. way like the details. Those high level trainers on footwork and ah, oh, I fucking I geek out on that kind of shit. I love boxing that way. I'm they, gonna have a bunch of kids and just drop them off at Antonio McKee's gym. <laughs> just drop them off. <laughs> just drop them the off. Naked? Yeah, but here's my question to you: yeah. Would you want your kids to be a fighter? Be fighters? <clears throat> it's tough. tough only if they want to be. Yeah. I think my daughter. Yeah. I think my daughter could be a fighter, but she's super tough. But she's a basketball player. She she's really good at basketball. Yeah. She loves it. I just feel like it, 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 <laughs> it just be a lot of pressure on your kid Oof. rampage. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Because you're their dad. It's like it's like Michael Jordan's kid when they're yeah. playing basketball. Like dude, rap or something. Dude, my 21 year old son. I don't think he feels the pressure. I see he 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 hasn't had any fights. He had two gym fights. He had like a, a, a one gym MMA like fight. A smoker. So, oh, he's well, a fighter. Yeah, he had one smoker. Yeah. But one kid, uh, one kid challenged him. The kid dad said, "Oh." Um, my kid can, my kid can beat Rampage's kid, and, and my son was sick. He had the uh-huh. flu or something, and they, they went. They told him he 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 was staying at Tony McKee's house. He they say he came to the gym, beat the kid up, went back home, went right back to sleep. <laughs> wow. And then he had a smoke a boxing match at uh, Sick Dog. I don't know if y'all remember him, uh, Sick Dog. And he won Hector that one Ramirez, too? and he he won. And he looked like he was moving his head like a boxer, just natural. Damn. He just yeah. he just got it, and, and he, he said he don't feel the pressure. Is he pressure. big like you or? Uh, he, he 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 walks around. He walks around like two oh five. You, you oh, know wow. what my thing was with that rampage is like I, I don't know how you grew up. Did you grow up with money or no 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 no? So you know no. what I'm saying. So those kids you're like you're, you're, yeah, yeah, you've yeah. done pretty well for yourself. So it's like yeah. my kids growing up where they're growing up, and bro, fighting it doesn't come from those. Yeah, you don't like you know the famous saying you don't sleep in. You know, yeah, but my kids silk sheets and then become yeah world yeah. Champion. But but you know I never I never really treated my kids and stuff like that. But they did grow up in Orange County. But I never you know I I kind of. Didn't want to make shit too easy on them, but my but youngest it's tough kids not to because yeah, you know, yeah, like, you want to be easier life, for them. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. But my younger kids are totally different. Cause their mom's Japanese, so they're they're totally she runs different. A tight ship. She's like the worst tight <laughs> mom I ever oh, yeah. fucking met. Oh, yeah. The Discipline. worst. Discipline. Oh, yeah. Like how so? My if my son is he's really smart. He normally makes straight A's and he's in honors and stuff. If he make a B on a on a on a not even a test like on an assignment or something, oh, he's it's like the end of the fucking world. He's in trouble. Or, so he can't play video games. Bro. Yeah, yeah, it, so, it, so it gotta be a. If it's a, is a. If it's an a minus, then he's in trouble again. A by the way, Koreans, wow. Japanese, that's and exhausting. Chinese are that way. Don't fuck around. Yeah. I don't know. Yeah, I don't know. If that's good, right? <laughs> that's not. That's not. That's not good. That's not healthy. It's, but but, it's, I, but he has both because he has her, and then I, I bet yeah. you're the cool dad. Yeah, I'm. No, I'm super yeah, cool. That's how I am. The question is: Does it, like, discipline like that is really good and it'll get you into Harvard? But does it make you creative? Being creative is a different story. It's yeah. it all depends. Because a lot of times, some very successful people struggled in school. They, oh yeah, they, I was terrible. They were in dyslexic. School. They had yeah, other issues. In school. And then yet, you know. I noticed it turned him into a liar, because she's so strict <laughs> and so he wow. lied. He lies. It's true. He lies to about. Get out of yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. You don't yeah. Yeah, he don't, he don't want to. You, get feel, in you feel, always feel like you're in trouble. You fucking just start lying. Yeah. My mother forged my report card so my dad didn't have a bad day. Did you guys all go to school? Graduate college. I didn't graduate I did. college. No, I, did. Yeah. I, did. I went to school, yeah. Yeah. Major, yeah. yeah. You went? I went to college, yeah, I went to college, but I didn't finish. Where'd you go? Uh so I was at North Idaho College, wrestled there and then I got done there. I just came down here for college and didn't finish up. Mm-hmm. Left up. I got injured in college and they, and they just threw me away. Yeah. I mean, colleges. Yeah, they're, they're ruthless, man. They're ruthless. It's such a business, yeah. man. Where'd you, start, yeah. where'd you go? I went to a junior college up in Northern California, Lassen. Yeah, Lassen's good. Yeah, yeah. Good wrestling school. Yeah, it was good wrestling school. Good wrestling. We wrestled you guys every year. Yeah, that was, yeah. it was a good school. I was you getting good California? wrestling there. No, I saw I was born and raised in San Jose. Uh, Damn, look at Jake. My yeah, parents do the, the interview, but I got to jump up. Look at the fucking electric. Thing on his shorts. Then my parents got divorced. Oh, so I moved up to Wow. Have you ever seen that? That shit is lit. What? That's he crazy. changed the game Legit with that. Lit. He changed the game with I've that. I've never wow. seen that in my he life. Changed the game. He, he changed the, the game. That next to your phone. So yeah, you I have bet. These things now they got hats what like the that. future yeah, is so here. You can put anything you want on your phone and it'll do that. Unless under. Woodley hits Yo. him with a body shot, that bitch blows up. Yo, explosive. Woodley came to my show in Houston. Hey, who's the tattoo guy behind him? Brian Count. He had a hat that said Brian Count, but it was on his phone. And he can do anything. That guy right there, the blonde guy on the right side. He's a breathing coach. The guy with all the tattoos? The yeah. one right there on the right? Oh, I'm talking about the guy on the left. Oh, le- he's a breathing, guy breathing coach? Right. Oh, so that guy on the far
No, he's he's he. As, I think he might no, be. A champion I know in he fights. Division. I'm oh, saying he protects Jake oh, Paul. Gotcha. Yes, oh. like when I worked the the Logan Paul Floyd Mayweather fight, yeah. J, uh, J, uh, Logan's entire team was all pro MMA fighters. Yeah, and so I was making the joke. I'm wow. like, would you beat up Floyd Mayweather's fat ass bouncers? I was like, they're bigger, but you guys have skill. So it was like this whole debate. Boom Boom Mancini right there. Look at that. Yeah, MMA fighters. Look at Boom Boom Mancini. Oh, I told him, I said, I, said, I have you guys minus 7,000. Yeah, They're yeah, like, really? Far. I'm like, yeah, this is big, dude. That don't mm. mean anything. What if somebody put on fights like that? Bodyguards versus bodyguards. This is like the old UFC shit. Oh, that'd yeah. be dope. That'd be dope, dude. It's like, like Justin fights. Bieber's bodyguards. <laughs> it's like bum fights. Yeah, that'd be sick. That's a good fucking idea. Earn your money, bro. And then you have whoever you rep. That's a good idea, yeah. You said, let's do it. All right. I'll do all the business and you just I'm start. I'm starting my own MMA league in Mexico. Are you really? I'm getting getting it all set up right now it's going to be it's going to be told it's rampage style totally different That'd some, be shit, sick. some shit y'all ain't never seen before really and i, I want to do it in mexico because i want to i like i like the pride energy you know what i'm saying back in the day it's my favorite yeah man. yeah like the, it was like a performance it was like it was like yeah the, everyone was like the super bowl like yeah. it felt special yeah. everyone felt like it was yeah. like a real special like spectacle yeah it's a fight man this you know i should do that car show together, shit. yeah it's she's tough Mexican girls no joke man she's giving it she just stands there and comes right back yeah, they're fucking sweet. She absorbs, sweet. she just takes it, and then boom. She's a bull. What would you I'm smash good. her, though? Would you, would you smash her? Not my type. <laughs> which one? A little which, too which, thick for me. Which one? You want the one in black? Uh, I like the black. I like the one in white. The yeah. one in white, you would. Yes. You smash. You would smash. And she's such a good fighter too. Brown would be very attracted yeah, I'm to her. Very attracted to her. She can protect I, I'm you. I'm attracted to fighter girls. He likes any woman I mean, that can MMA beat him girls up. Girls are hot, and I think uh, fitness girls are. I, I like. And them. Tommy Fury. Oh, fitness girls. I like. You like? So you like? Let's start. I like. I like fitness girls too. Yeah. I like. I love fitness. But I like fighting. I love fitness girls. If you like fitness girl, come on down to zoo. See some MMA girls, man. Come on. It is. I just, I just, I just admire it, and I, I just think it's. Yeah. I want to fit chicks, chicks, so I can. Stay in shape because I don't know they know how to cook and make you eat yeah. right yeah. and all this yeah. shit. Yeah, like they're I never going to have like Cinnabon around yeah. there. Yeah, because yeah, sometimes you idea. date girls and oh. they be eating all bad and shit yep. and you get they so tempted. They fuck shit up. Yeah, I want, I want, I want to date me yep. a fit chick. Yeah, but yeah. you know what? But that not would, too fit. Would it, it would be a little exhausting. It'd get annoying though. too. No, not really. If they're always like doing CrossFit uh, and shit and eating healthy and I you're like, God damn it. My buddy's girl's like, she's got him on a diet all the time. You know, <laughs> simmer your ass. Down. Yeah, like damn. So push us around the house. Yeah, now, you, like, you, you ready to go for our six mile run? Like, uh, no, it man. would annoy you. My buddy's allowed to eat pickles. He's got a weight problem. Oh. He's got a friend of ours. He, he struggles with his weight and food. Oh, I know who you're talking yeah. about. Yeah, and the his guy girl. And his girl's a trainer. Yeah, his girl's. Yeah, <laughs> Wait, his, yeah he's got bull hearts for calves. Yeah. One of my favorite people in the she world. She only lets me eat pickles. His girl, yeah, his girl, his girl's Wait, a bad what? motherfucker. <laughs> like his girl is a trainer, and she wants kids with him. So she's like, "You're not gonna die on me. I'm gonna get you in shape." This motherfucker's allowed to eat one thing. Pickles, so he's hiding food and shit. Yo, what? <laughs> she caught him eating crackers. She's like, "Hey, put it down now." He's bro, like, "Fuck!" If you like, knew the guy, it's oh, bro. Man. I need to know who this guy is. He's allowed to eat a. He, and by the oh, way, can't eat a whole he's jar. A famous actor. Yeah, he's great. But he's he one is. of our best friends. You'll, he's you'll his eat a best pickle. Friend. He's like, he's fucking salt and cucumber. He's one of the most talented guys on the planet. Oh, he's too. incredible. Yeah, Jeez. He's so damn, funny. I'm really interested. He has uh, the biggest I'll calves. He has the biggest calves you've ever seen. Who the fuck is this guy? He's an actor. I know he's not gonna say. Size of my head. I think he, I know you. He's the best about. guy in the world. He yeah. probably doesn't care if I told. If I hey, said you know, you know who's been uh, girls on the road? <laughs> yeah, I heard what? young Val Kilmer. Whoa, he's baby Val. Yeah, he's dude. crushing. Mini Val, Val. Mini Val. Son. Wait, Whoa. what? Yeah, he goes on the road and because you know there'll be a line waiting to get into the yeah. uh, venue, mm -hmm. and they see him and he's getting blown up. Look they can't get the fucking AC on. Look, him. man, Jesus. he's a camera guy. Sorry, Wait, buddy. what's going on? What happened? Ah, you your mom should be proud, dude. Yeah, that's awesome. I like <laughs> this. I like the <laughs> no now, 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 like you give him like your bed. Yeah, whenever he gets girl, you're in my bed. That's a big. But the other thing is, is our boy David Lucas did give him a nickname. Calls him. Bud from uh <laughs> oh my god he calls, God. Him, he calls him Bud from Bud what? married with children Bud Bundy no you married Bud the, the Bud boy from David Fasino David Fasino he's a buddy of mine Bud Bundy yeah yeah Bud Bundy yeah yeah there you go David yeah. Faustino I'm Good sorry guy. I'm sorry God I love David love it but the nicknames kind of stuck it's yeah you're, you're doing well though buddy that's the you're fucked proud of you all the videos you see all the thick boy videos that's all him all the pictures that's all Kyle he's crushing it but he can't turn the AC on. <laughs> Dude, right. we could have our videographers <laughs> fight. I, I yeah, yeah. 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 You, uh, there's a weight advantage. Bro, this is a fight, man. Yeah. Yeah. Is, right, I think everybody should have at least time. one fight in their life. In their life. Yeah, you learn you know a lot. Yeah, you learn a lot. And it's, it's like you know, when you fight on the street, you just 
you know, it's dangerous. But you know, it's dangerous. Concrete it happens. It shit. happens at a, at, a, at a, you know. You don't have to think about. You don't have to think about it. But when you train for a fight for eight weeks, eight weeks, and you, you know about? you better get in the fight. It's different. It's different. I think everybody should do that at least. You one know time what? Hey, then yeah. what we gotta do is we gotta start our own show. It's called Fight Club. We just do a real fight club. We set up people oh to have God. a fight. Bodyguards versus bodyguards. Yeah. Bodyguards versus bodyguards. Yeah, camera you know, guys versus you know, camera you know guys. That's dope. You know what happens? Hey, we could have you fight my my producer podcast day. I'm so down. I'm so down to fight. She didn't podcast day, but it's great. So hey, what about Jamie? Can we get Jamie to fight? Jamie, yeah, Jamie, Jamie and Chin. Young Jamie's too rich. Young Jamie. Oh. <laughs> nah. young but Jamie, it's not. It's he, not the in fighting and that kind of fight. It's not the pain. It's the exhaustion. I yeah. fucking. I go to. I'm in Arizona. Sugar Sean and Tim Welch's coach go. Come to. Come work out with us. We'll do a little flow grappling. I'm like, I've been doing a little wrestling, so I was like, all right. I'm. F- I, when I say flow, we're just going through shit. Yeah. By minute. Like by minute, I think we were doing two minute rounds. I think by round three or four, I was so tired. Two I got rounds. embarrassed. I had to crawl off the mat because jujitsu rounds were like eight minutes. But bro, it was just two we minutes. were just doing we were doing two takedowns minutes. and shit, and then the, go on the ground. Wrestling's hard, man. Still, still wrestling's exhausting. Exhausting. I, but I hadn't done it. That's in so why. Long. That's why yeah. you see those stud wrestlers at the highest level oh my. where they're like, I don't get why they don't shoot. It's because they don't get tired. Oh, bro, yeah. they're scared to get tired. Bro, yeah. just moving around, not even wrestling. Like just, I was, I was, I thought I'm an old man, but I thought I was gonna fucking die. I got embarrassed. I was that tired. I got embarrassed. Didn't you wrestle with Kat Zingano too? Yeah, I wrestled yeah, with her. Yeah, I trained with her a little bit. She's, I wrestled she's pretty with her good, in, uh, she's tough. high altitude. Yeah, uh, that's right. She's pretty tough. You wrestle yeah. girls? I do. <laughs> do you get a hard on while you're wrestling? Uh, no, sir, because... Uh, <laughs> no, sir. When she was fucking you up. with somebody who's really All good, you're just trying to fucking... She's, trying to fucking she's tough, man. She's yeah, tough. Yeah, she's scrappy. I got the rotation with, in AKA, Luke Rockhold just throws me headgear, and I had my Where were you there? I had my mouthpiece a while back. I had my mouthpiece, yeah. 74. I had my mouthpiece in my fucking thing. I put it in, and 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 Daniel Cormier goes, "I got him first. So <laughs> Daniel just, I'm trying to hit him and doing my stuff, and he's like, Nee-hee. and then he just double legs me and puts his fucking shoulder in my chest, oh, yeah. and he goes, "Luke, watch, watch," and he just <laughs> oh gets up on God. his toes. Well, I I couldn't breathe. I just of course started not. Tapping. It's Olympian, dog. Yeah, it's a whole different thing. I lost. Whole, I know. Surprise, surprise, surprise. Who him? Amazing. Oh, DC can wrestle. I he's fucking good. I tried with him for the last. I think he's he's the most he started his career at AK way. with us. Fucking, he, he can wrestle. From the, from he the can fucking wrestle. Oh, you were out of AK. Yeah, he was that the, dude he's can the fucking captain wrestle. Team. Dude, those guys hey, were killers. Show respect. Yeah, yeah. yeah. you gotta get you hey, show respect. Hey, show respect. He puts the captain. Respect him, my goddamn. I've always had a captain of the team. I didn't know that. No, it's over. Because John Fitch, John Fitch was telling me what it's like to wrestle with Khabib. No. Oh. And Fitch walks around at 205. And he's yeah, he's about 205. Yeah. And he goes, if I can stand up on the day, yeah. if I can stand up against him, win. it's a good day. I was like. Yeah. And now Makachev's that bad motherfucker. Oh, he's good, Did man. you ever roll with Khabib? Did yeah, you know? all the time. Nightmare. He, so I, I actually, because when he first came in the gym, not a lot of people wanted to go corner him because the English his English was good but it yeah, wasn't great yeah, yeah. so like so when so when Hobb was like look I don't know Chicago and coach him or corner him other guys were like yeah I don't really know him I was like yeah whatever I'll go he, he I roll with him I train with him you know I spar with him you know he was one of my training partners would he wear that fairy so, hat even from the jump would he always bring the furry hat? no he never wore it okay. he never wore it except for at the weigh-ins and gotcha. at the uh at the after the okay. fight yeah but I mean fuck he's Look, he was one of the guys that came in super humble. I celebrated his 25th birthday with him. His, his birthday is the day before mine. He's the 20th and the 21st of September. He fucking is someone that like we showed up. He took me out to dinner. It was his. Fi- it was his fight. Here I am. I was the number two guy in the world. He's not even in the top 15 rankings, but he's taking me out to dinner for his birthday. Wow. He's great, such dude. a fucking great guy. He seems like, like a beautiful. He's human he's man. he really what, is. What's the X factor with him? Is it just is besides his wrestling? Because a lot of guys wrestle. Well, what what why do you think? We we're talking about earlier. Mine mentality. It's a mind. Mentality. It's a mind. You can't beat him. Mentally, look like I've said this. Gonna I, break him. I've said this yeah. before. I said this. I think on the first fight, man, you were here. I said Islam Makachev is way more talented than Khabib. Better striking, better striking, better, better jitsu. Yeah. Not maybe not as good at wrestling, but it, but it's good like different style of wrestling. Yeah, Khabib but is more double ten, like They're both tens. They're both tens. Like ten, they're in that ten eleven category. Yeah. Anyways, yeah. but with Islam, it's the men, it's the mind. Khabib believes he can never be beat, which I, he obviously hasn't been. But what I'm saying is that with Islam, he has that. He has that feeling. <laughs> There's a fucking hair. Sorry, it's my hair. Nah, I appreciate you for doing that, yeah. though. Thank yeah. you. <laughs> Nothing worse than like, slapping. Like, yeah. <laughs> and so the mindset, though, with Islam, he knows he's good, but he still has a little bit of a trickle of a doubt. You can him. tell in the main event. Yeah. Right? And so, like, when the two of them spar, like, you know, the, I've seen Khabib go through guys that were, were Khabib's had problems with. I've seen Islam go through them 
like fucking a hot knife through butter. Just foot sweeps them, yeah. hook sweeps them, fucking hit toss them, make them look like they're fucking their sisters. Like, oh, it's my little sister. I'm just tossing around. Whereas Khabib had a hard time with that person in training, sparring, all those yeah. things. Islam fucks them over. But you put the two of them together. When yeah. the lights are on. And when you put the two of those guys together to spar and training, oh, yeah. it's like big brother, I, little I brother. A, I have a theory it's, on Khabib I have does, a, yes. Khabib does work. Just, yeah, just, uh, it's like, don't get me wrong. Like, Islam's always making sure that Khabib doesn't get hurt because it's, you know, he's for getting sure. ready for a fight. But Khabib, oh. Yeah, wins yeah, 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 he wins I that match. That's, I, that's what's I, I crazy, feel like man. It's because I feel like some people like Khabib who are true believers, like, I feel like he, he lives such a pure life. Like, like there's no, fucking truck. there's no dishonesty. Doesn't give life. a shit about money, man. He's li- because he believes in something. Doesn't really? give a shit about you know him personally. Yeah, yeah. He, He's yeah, really yeah. 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 I cornered him for his first three or four fights. In I the don't league. know Khabib. Yeah. I've never met the motherfucker, but somehow I'm blocked on Instagram. <laughs> oh, man. What? Yeah, because I tried. Because you're what, a sinner, dude. <clears throat> that's what you know who has been blocked on Instagram? Conor McGregor. Huh? Conor McGregor has been blocked on Instagram. I have no idea. Wow, this motherfucker! Cause, uh, no when idea. He, when he no. Won his last fight, yeah, when he won his last fight, I, I was, I was. Um, you gonna say something nice about him? Yeah, yeah. I, I got nothing bad to say about Khabib. Nothing. You went at Khabib I, and there's didn't show up. Yeah, I was trying. No, I was trying to look for something. Look for yes. his. Pa- I was trying to look for his page or something. And nothing. Well, yeah, I wonder, that, that's yeah. always weird. Sometimes it's a mistake. Yeah, sometimes because there, there was a while. There was purpose. Yeah, no, yeah. no, no. There, 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 there was, there was, there was, yeah, there was a while. Yeah. There was a while where even though we're friends, he follows me. I follow him. I couldn't find him. No, no, no. So I, I, I think, think maybe it's like a translation thing. He thinks no. block means follow. Good cover up. I like that. Good cover up. Like, now Rampage say some fucked up shit. Let me block this motherfucker. Have you ever said anything bad about him? Never. Yeah, yeah. I don't know him. He's yeah. a nice guy, man. No, he's, I didn't. He, I didn't he that like whole crew person. of guys, they're 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 all yeah. nice, man. They're yeah, from from what I see from his interviews and stuff. But I'm telling you, I didn't know who. I don't watch UFC. I don't watch MMA that much. Yeah. So I didn't know Khabib was until he fought Connor. Oh really? Yeah, I didn't know he was. Wow. I didn't. I didn't, I yeah, didn't. I trained with him when he first came in. I think he was like 18 and 0 know. when he first came to AK. He was 18, 19, oh, 18 or 0, I think, when he Some came to AK. Some of these guys are like, they stay, like Anthony Joshua, I think, still lives like just above his parents, I think. No, he lives in a huge mansion. Does he now? Lives, but yeah. he, for a long time, he lives in a See, like Khabib, Khabib up until he <laughs> fought, Khabib up until he fought <laughs> um, Ali Quinta, so he that. was still living at home. He, really? he, he had he was married <laughs> and he had he had his I think he had his daughter first then he had his son next but he had his daughter first but he was still living at home with his married and with his are with Khabib, Khabib's kids monsters too? No, they're young. It? They're young. They're like they're only a year maybe two years oh, old. Oh, yeah. yeah. He's, he's, he's got a three year old now. He's got a three year old. I think like a three or four year old and then like a one year old. Uh, he's never coming. Maybe back. he's never coming. Yeah. 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 What, what he he ever do one was like boxing. He just signed. He just signed with the soccer team. A European soccer team. Play soccer now. Was he always a nightmare wrestler? Was he always being absolutely? Yeah, he won't do. He won't Absolutely. And you, as a guy who's an American folk wrestler or whatever, yeah, not even close. You, you couldn't. He was doing shit you'd never seen, right? It's a different. It's yeah, it's just different type of setups. Yeah, they live their life here. Like I was trying to explain. When I talk to him about fighting, he's like, he's like, yeah, me being 39, he's like, you don't remember, I have 250 Sambo fights. Yes. Those are MMA fights, yes, just yeah, with the fucking exactly top on. Yeah. Like, don't, let's not be mistaken. They punch a Sambo? They punch, yeah, they punch a Sambo. Yeah, oh, yeah, yeah. Submissions, yeah. Yeah. Submissions yeah. Yeah. E-bars. Yeah. He's yeah. got 200, yeah. 200, 200 and, yeah, That's 250 Peter Sambo thing. fights. Yeah, him and Holy, which, yeah, him and Makachev. Makachev is a two-time world champion. Sambo world champion. So good. He's so fucking Khabib's good. Uncle People around. and his father, I think, were both world champions. Uh, his brother. Have you ever seen where they've yeah. grown up? It's in the mountains. Yeah, it's it's seven, saw, almost 7,000 seven stones and bear. shit. I have seen yeah. Yeah, So 7,000 altitude, that. though, like live in Dagestan, yeah. and I can't I, I can't pronounce that. I show my kid that video. It's the same for you, man. Those people. Those people. <laughs> that, that's that's part of the world. Right Azerbaijan, <laughs> Armenia, uh, you know, meme, Dagestan, meme about yeah. the bear. Turkmenistan, whatever it is. Yeah, he was wrestling. But they all live up in the mountains. The altitude is 7,000, so they've grown up living in altitude. Just look at He goes home. He don't want to live anywhere else. He goes home. He just built this 50 thousand square foot gym there just so people can start training so he can start helping wow. the, all the kids that are in his community he's, he's amazing like yeah was he the best guy ever he is, he is. Yeah, it sounds like close. It, man. he's pretty close yeah. He's a good dude, man. People give him a lot of hard time. He's getting a lot of flack right now on the, on, on the internet. Oh, like, for saying they, there should I be guess. female uh, ring card yeah, girls? Yeah, something they're like useless. that. Yeah, something about the... He's like, like the, he Khabib, said... He's like, they're useless. They, he makes, there's no sense. UFC, he's, ring he said ring card girls. girls. Are useless? Yeah, yeah, for MMA, he's like, they're useless. But, 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 <laughs> Queen doesn't seem to agree. But I don't get why... That's why he blocked me, because you know, he probably oh, look at my page and see yeah. the shit I post. Like, hey, let me... Let me block this center. He's yeah. probably right. You're, 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 nah, you're a distraction. Just, it's but but if that's post. his opinion, you know what I'm saying? Like he's What's like, if he doesn't now? like it and he has his own organization, yeah. he, that's his opinion. Yeah. There's there's different ways to look at it though too. Like he looks at I it. Think I think we have ring I, men though. I think he looks at it from like a standpoint of 
that women are not supposed to be hit, touched, like abused like that. And that's kind of where I think like, when I've yeah, had but that's his culture. Everybody. You're right, but I've had that's that, what he grew up in. But I, I've, had that, I've had that communication and talk with him. He's like, I don't, I just don't feel like women should be hit. Women should not be touched. It shouldn't be. Well, I, shouldn't I, be I should agree like with that because I love watching. Yeah, yeah, but you didn't grow up in no, fucking I understand. Yeah. Yeah. In but that culture get, well, where they in, don't, they don't play those games. Where is Dagestan? I don't even know. Where is it? Where is it? Brian, it's basically where is it? Brian, he's like Brian. So you know, like Russia's here. It's part. It used to be a part of the Soviet Union. Okay, and it's one of the countries in like where Chechnya is it's in the caucus it's the roughest yeah it's the roughest. It's like a mountainous but, 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 ma Yeah, blow that map up for me, please. Yeah, I don't get my contacts in. I, I was pretty good with it. So you see Georgia, Azerbaijan, Armenia, that's all, this whole area. You're talking about Atlanta, Georgia? Like that. Nope. nope. <laughs> <laughs> I'm talking about... I'm talking about... <laughs> I fucking love there. you, Quentin, <laughs> man. <laughs> bro, I love you, bro. Dagestan, <laughs> Dagestan, <laughs> wasn't, Dagestan <laughs> was, there it was part yeah. of Chechnya. See how it's yep. Chechnya and all these countries? Well, it's the toughest people in the world. Yeah. That entire area. Very tough. Chechnya? Oh, go to Chechnya. Let me know how it goes for you. Yeah, if you you watch this last 2020 Olympics, you have people in the finals from Georgia, from Chechnya, from, yeah. from Dagestan. They're they were, all from, they they say from the Russia, Ottoman but Empire, so they're all from Dagestan. It's, it's Mongol. So that's, so that's where Khabib's from. Mak Makaha Chakalaka. Maka Chakalaka. Yeah, that's, that's where he's from. How you, how you pronounce that? I don't know. Maka Maka Chakalaka. Yeah. <laughs> Go ahead, say it again, Brendan. Where are you from, Maka Chakalaka? No, that's, 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 yeah, that's where he's from. I couldn't say his last name forever, no matter what I do. Oh, really? Nine years Nerma Gametov. Nerma Gametov. See, I say Khabib, but I know it's Habib. I just yeah, don't feel Habib. right saying yeah, it's Habib. Habib. It's Habib. It's Habib. Habib. It's Habib. It's Habib. It's Habib. Habib. But I don't like going Habib. I don't like yeah, to don't, do that. Don't feel Arabic, I feel bad. Arabic, like, Turkish kind of. Yeah, yeah. I know, but as a white person. Phonetically, you know. Habib. Yeah, just, it's Habib. How long you been white, man? I see it. I know. <laughs> for, about, for about four years, man. Yeah. Yeah. I like crazy? So much four years. years. Wow. You're about, you're about racial annoying. No, man. Man, one of your grandparents is black. Quit lying, homie. I know. Bro, you're killing me. Look at his facial hair. He's mostly English. It's weird. Are you Sicilian? Uh, what I'm are you? Italian. Yeah, yeah, that's, that's, what, that's yeah, what it yeah. is. His dad looks I feel like he's 18%. Looks, his dad couldn't look more Are you Italian? I'm um, half Italian. My dad yeah. looks like Tom Selleck. Your dad looks Native American, sir. <laughs> I mean, he looks like 100% yeah. Cherokee. And I'm, I mean, if I were casting a movie <laughs> in the Old South, yeah. your dad is Yeah, it's So my mom, my, so my grandmother was full, like Spanish, Mexican. Yeah. And then like, she's like, Mexican, they, they call her Mexican, but she has like the light green eyes, you know, but my grandfather was 100% Yucky Indian. Really? So my mother Damn. is 80% Native American, so 80% Yucky Indian and the rest is Mexican. Irish? My dad was Scottish Dutch. Oh, oh that's close. Yeah, that's yeah, close so, yeah. yeah. Okay. Well. Y'all wouldn't be second guessing me if I had my mom's last name, Vasquez, huh? You wouldn't be second guessing <laughs> me. You'd be like, oh, <laughs> shit, Josh, yeah. of course you're Mexican. Yeah. Shit. Man, I wish this girl would knock the other girl out. I'm looking at all you guys. Um, look at those guys. Those, the lighting on that picture Damn. is not the best, huh? Yeah, that one there? Lighting. Yeah. Is this What's, your gym? Yeah. That's yeah. Where, how far is it from here? Oh, man. God, it's close to my house. It's, it's very it's right close. Oh, so you're not far then. You're not yeah, far. It's very you got close. an MMA cage in your gym? No. Not? It's just all. It's not enough space in there for that. No. Uh, you're moving locations? Yeah, time? we're moving to a bigger spot. And aren't you moving a, a new gym in Austin? Yeah, Still Austin. Doing that? It's, yeah, it's oh, either Austin or Dallas. Oh, Rogan got a spot. I'm in Dallas. I just bought a house in Dallas. Wow. We're at 6th Street. Wow. Um, the one in Dallas would probably be in Frisco. Yeah, that's where I'm at. Yeah, I'm right there. And in then Prosper, the one in Frisco Austin area. is in Austin, obviously. Yeah, yeah, obviously south, Austin, southeast yeah. Austin. Like uh, Lakewood, like uh, around no, that area, like no. Cedar Park, or you're in downtown. Da southeast, southeast of downtown. Southeast, okay. So more towards Tesla. Yeah. They're going at it. Dude. Yeah, yeah. Tesla's gonna be down by game. the airport. There. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Chappelle yeah. looks 300 pounds in that picture. He, uh, he looks. Get it off, Chappelle. He does look huge right there. And Mark's hair looks looks like it should have his own TV show. Damn, he's fucking, he's, he's jacked. Jesus, yeah. Mark. Mark's a big kid. You know, I, I honestly, because he we we follow each other on Instagram. He's always saying so. He he seems the like such a like fucking like a nice guy. And we met him here because yeah. you didn't. He's he's like such, you you went to this fight last time, so he came. He, Mark, yeah, Mark's a great guy. He's fucking he's a absolutely guy, yeah. super nice guy. Yeah, he's great. Man. Hell yeah, super nice guy. Um, I can't believe you deadlift that much. That's crazy weight, dude. That's not that much. Really? Yeah, it's not that much. Yeah, it's nah. not too bad. Could you I go to the Olympics for lifting weights? Um, they, they, I think they just started including powerlifting. Yeah, but I wouldn't know. There's other people who are who are much better than me at powerlifting. Oh, yeah. Have you, you, you ever seen the powerlifters? They're like, you know, not to be. They're like real thick boys. They're like fat and muscle. Because the more you weigh, the more you can pull. Yeah. Why? Why is it? Because the weight. weight. It's the body weight. Dude, this uh, is a like fucking war, man. So they they try to be that that size on purpose. Yeah. 
Like you, like you have seen the strongest man contest. They're not yeah, I seen the. Uh, yeah, they're, they're huge. huge. Well, yeah, they're massive. You but think, it's so big. You think Arnold Schwarzenegger could win a strongest man contest? Yeah, absolutely, not. Back no, in the day? Not absolutely not. Absolutely no. not. Look at these guys. Look at these guys. That's what you're dealing with. See that guy on the right? That guy's. Yeah. That that guy's. Is he the strongest man? Larry no, Eddie but he's, Eddie Hall was the strongest man in the world. Yeah, Eddie Hall had set the record for a deadlift. Eddie Hall was. He brought some of those abs. Some of those abs, like he brought them. That guy on the right weighed like 440 pounds and set the world record. Like he deadlifted over a thousand pounds. He's fucking insane. Who's that guy right there? A lot of chicken. Go to the left. Chin. Chin. That's a fake guy. The guy on the left. The guy from Dagestan on the far left. That's a fake guy. He's fake. He's fake. Yeah, that's not real. Wait, wait. Are you serious? Well, yeah, the, guy is. Yeah. the guy on the right is a professional bodybuilder. That's Phil Heath. Phil Heath right. looks okay. like that. I mean, even Phil no, I thought that guy was real, Bubba. I what think that guy's real. The guy on the far left is fake. How I, you no, know? I don't think so. I think he's the he's the Iranian Hulk, they call him. He's not, yeah, it's all fake. Well, how do you know? He was supposed to fight. He was supposed to fight, yeah. It never happened. Pull him up. Let's fly him out here. This girl's taking damage. Let's get down to the bottom. So I'm friends with Flex. Flex Wheeler. Flex Wheeler. What's his Instagram? Look, he's not fake. He got an Instagram. He does, yeah. Oh, yeah. Shit, crazy. Crazy. This girl got cut. This girl got cut. Yeah. Which one got cut? What is that from, you know? I know. He said he was natty, though, you know? So What's going on over here? Oh, oh, hold on. I heard that. You said Flex Wheeler was natty? No, Flex Wheeler really used to claim that he was close. natty, oh, but no, he no, lost no, his no, legs. That that's, dude's real. That guy's real. From circulation problem. Bob, that guy's look, real. The dude's real. That guy's real. That's not real, No, Photoshop is good these days. That is fucking fake. Ryan, are you shitting me? Look, I'm telling you, that's the You think it's real just because you see it on the <laughs> internet, dude? He got UFC clothes look, 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 look at his abs. Look at his body. So, so go to a video of him and you'll see what I mean. Okay, go to a video oh, yeah, of him. Yeah, get a video. Yeah, and he's in a fucking hoodie. And you can't even see his no, body. He's, he's a big fat He's guy. clearly big. He's a real human being, but, but his body. Bradley's like getting that. mad because there's somebody that big. No, on the internet. no, no. I don't care how big the guy is. I'm just telling you. Like, wait, show wait. us a video Bradley, of Bradley, look then. what he's doing, dude. Wow, he's bending a pan. That's you can't do that sick. if you dude, That dude's real. I told you. Yo, that. shut the That guy's fucking real, man. You could be small. Go to so another video. Go to another video. Hard. You'll see. Watch right there. Wait, look at his. That, that's, that's all fake. fake. Nope. Go to another video, you fuck. Yeah, he don't look the same. Leave, like, leave yeah, his titties yeah. there. Yeah, yeah, he don't look the same in the video. Yep. Bro, uh, you you notice how you can't see his body. Man, body. you guys are down on T Rex and that guy. That. I'm fucking do sick you? of this. Yeah, I do because. Because oh, you, know how, you know how it started. Oh, you know how the whole titties uh, thing started. We're going to stop this fight. Hold up, B. We got too many conversations going on. Sorry. How'd the titties thing start? The whole th the whole titties thing started. We just joke, we just all joking around. Who's titties? Wait, so, wait, 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 wait. So, so, Explain so this. I was on the Ultimate Fighter season ten. He was a coach on there, okay. and there's a kid on our team named Daryl Schoonover. Yeah, Schoenauer. Who, uh, Schoenauer, I think. Schoenauer. And he was kind of like, you know, kind of out of shape, dude. Okay. He's from I think New Mexico. I don't know where. And he, he kind of he was soft. He was soft. Okay. And he kept calling him titties. You called him titties I on the did, show. I did, I did so call his nickname titties. was titties, which he hated. No, at first he didn't mind it, but then once we kept, yeah, go, you then, right. yeah, then at, at first, first it, it was, was funny. Fun. It was fun and and because he, I think you kept doing it because he went with it. He went with it at like, first. Yeah, titties. Yeah, titties, yeah, right, yeah it was right. it was all sort of fun, and then so how did it end? Oh shit! It ended pretty you bad because pissed. we because we started like because everything got heated on the show, and we me and Rashad was going at it and everything, and then then me and um, I'm not gonna call him titties anymore, Daryl. Yeah, me and him, we 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 got heated. We almost got in a fight. I wonder what he's doing. Yeah, he I got in the face when he comes. Yeah, yeah, I, yeah, I was ready to fight him. Yeah, he's about to get fucked up. Yeah, I was ready yeah. to fight him. Yeah, but so so listen now now I feel bad because now I got titties. <laughs> <laughs> Full circle right there. Full circle. Full circle. Full circle. Jokes on you. Hey, man. So every time you know, every you gotta time. love people that can be real with themselves. I, I, I keep love it real. that shit. Shit, I, shit, I don't. You, 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 you ever talk to a shot or you're still bad blood there? No, you know, no, he's no, vegan. Now. We, we did he's a vegan movie with cornrows. Yeah, we did a movie together. They made us German twins, brother. Rashad Evans, sick. Yeah. We played German twins. So he's a good dude. Yeah, he's a good dude. This was a beautiful fight. This was hell of a. Why Dan White? He's at her. He's yelling at the other coach. Why? What? Probably because maybe because he didn't stop the fight. She got cut really bad. Yeah, the yeah. Mexican. Oh, there's Daryl Schoonover. Man, that was. A what hell is, oh, he's still. Uh, he no, fight. that's not him. No. No, that's not Daryl. That maybe. Damn, that was a good fight. Were you cool with? I mean, Daryl. Were you cool with him? Uh, but he, he was he's like a tough guy to get to know. Yeah, know? he was guy. He was kind of out. Yeah, like the so corner like, oh, stopped it. Fifteen people. I'm like, yeah, that makes sense. Did the corner yeah. stop yeah. it. Yeah. yeah. Like he was oh, never cool with us. Oh. Ten rounds. He was like never one of the boys in the house. Oh yeah. yeah. We got Jake Paul, Tyron Woodley right now. now. I Thank am God. excited for got this that. fight. Bam, 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 bam. There you go, right there. Oh there. my God. That, there they are, right there. There you are. Wait, is that, is he, that he, a... He, he actually didn't have titties. I was just... This, I was no, just, he did, and it's fine. <laughs> but the thing is, is he just kept harping on it, I think he got to him. Dude, this is the guy. Dude, I'm doing a, yeah. reality, I'm doing a reality show, and I, I like to be entertaining because I'm a shit coach. Yeah. So I had to, I had to, I had to make up for it oh, somewhere. Oh, you were so fun on
or you did this before you fought Marvin? I, I, oh, you fought Marvin. I for, fought Marvin first. Yeah, Marvin yeah. was my first fight. Yeah. Then I, then I had That's fought Chuck. That. You already beat Chuck. And then you did this. Chuck. Yeah, I didn't do this. And this yeah. is my Chuck wasn't champ at the this time. This is my second time doing uh, the Ultimate Fighter. I was, was the first coach to come back and do it twice. Was Chuck the champ at the time when you beat him? Yeah. Uh, I got my belt. Damn. Damn. That girl's so tough. And then, and then I fought Dan Henderson after that and unified the pride belt. Yeah. Right. I'm the first one to ever do that. And then the UFC gave the credit to um, Anderson Silva, man. I was kind of butthurt about that. But he was never champ over Credit that. for what? No. Okay. Dan Henderson had two belts. He had the 205 and the 85 belt. Yeah. And I took the 205 belt off him. I fought Chuck. Yeah. And and I was the first ever unified champion. Oh, wow. And then Anderson Silva did it after me. He fought Dan Henderson. Oh, that's right. But after. And then they gave it. They and they, and they told and they told Anderson. They said Anderson Silva was the first ever oh, weird. U- unified champion. I'm like, wow. I just I just did that. Yeah, that's weird. Yeah. Like, I just did that. That's a shame. And they didn't give me the belt. And they didn't give me the belt in the cage. They gave me the belt later. And Lorenzo told me, don't ever wear the belt to the fights. And Why? Stuff like that. Well, they, they, told, the me some, they, they, they told me they, a bunch of stuff. Yeah, they didn't like Lorenzo's that shit. Lorenzo's a good dude. Yeah, I, I honestly like the, Lorenzo. He was the brains behind that. Operation. I honestly, I honestly like Lorenzo, but when I, I did the eighteen, when he told me don't do no more movies, I kind of looked at him. I kind of looked at him wrong. I was like, because why? Why wouldn't he want you to do movies? But the, the, the eighteen, fuck, they fucked up that fight with Rashad. Because they wanted I, you to focus on fighting. They, were, they fucked up my fight with, with Rashad, but it would have sold more pay per views if I would have done been doing movies. Yeah, mm-hmm. but you're but big, but I chose the brand. But I had to, I chose the the movie over the fight with Rashad. It was supposed to fight in my hometown. Mm-hmm. I did. I, I fucked up. Oh. But, but but what they don't know, they don't understand, is that uh, the eighteen movie was a couple of years in in the works. Just my luck, it came right at the same time. Yeah, that, you had no, you had no yeah, control of uh, the production. Yeah, yeah uh, like, I don't. What do you want me to do? That's what it, the movie is. I've been I've been working towards this movie yeah. for a couple of years, and then it came right when Rashad fight was supposed to happen. Yeah, what can you do? This chick has three belts. Yeah, it's yeah. a hard decision. She's legit, bro. Jesus, she's good. She's legit, Forty-one right? and one. It's a yeah. great boxer. Man. Holy fuck! I didn't. I didn't think Daryl. Oh. Honestly, I didn't really think Daryl had. Hey, what's kids. her record, Chin? I really yeah. didn't. But I just forty-one and one. Is her record forty-one and one? Yeah, I just wanted to be entertaining yeah. on the show to, to entertain everybody. You yeah. know, we're reading the subtitles here. I'm a shit coach. Yeah, good coaches around you, though. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Who else you have? Tiki. Uh, that, uh, Ayama? Had, uh, Tom, what's he Tom, saying there? Tom what's he saying? Right. Oh, I love Tom. He's great. Yeah, who else we have? 30. Uh, Wait, so what was it again? Who who, who wins? Oh, 40 and 0. 40, 40. Brian. She's 40. Oh, you bring the man, so she's 40 and 1. 41 and 1. Do the man dragon. Okay. Okay. Has to win. Oh, yeah. You promise. Yeah, she's 40. Yeah, I promise. Okay. Chin. I promise. If we're going to cover fighting, man, you got to at least learn how to read this. I know, dude. I've been sipping on some whiskey. So I love it. Chin's getting loose. I'm not a big fan of that whiskey bubble. Me neither. You know what they sent to me? I've never tried it. But the whistle pig's nice. I got to get some whistle pig. No, that's 18. That's 18. The whistle pig's 18. Yeah. That's good. Sorry to kill that whiskey is good. Let me knock out that read for this uh, main event. Yeah. Y'all got his whiskey. Y'all got some snacks. We've been here for a couple hours. Yeah. Yeah. Y'all got some carrots. Yeah. Yeah. Next time, I can second can that. Can you eat pizza and shit or no? Should we order food? I don't I don't want want to yeah, I'm, I'm starving, starving, man. Yeah, I'm I don't starving eat pizza either. either. Listen, man, if you haven't bailed on Harry Balls, it's time to buzz them nuts with Manscaped, the official electric <laughs> yeah. trimmer. We gotta keep. You want pizza? He said, I gotta redo this read. Uh, <coughs> the official electric trimmer of the UFC. Get your rocket ready for takeoff with the new lawnmower 4.0. Kick your bush to Pluto. Manscaped <laughs> is taking off right now. It's available in not only the US of A, but Canada, the UK, across Europe, Australia, South Africa, Singapore. So if you got a bush in Singapore, we got you covered. Wow. Manscaped are the leaders in men's grooming. I threw that in. Uh, the new lawnmower 4.0 is waterproof, has advanced skin, scare, uh, skin safe technology, so your balls are going to be so- safe for, and sound. All thick boys get 20% off and free shipping with the code CFC at manscaped.com. That's 20% off and free shipping with the code CFC at manscaped.com. We got the link and code in the bio. Enjoy the fights. So can you, like, shave your balls and knock Don't yeah. get yeah. rampage. Hey, got it. It's got great. Animal crackers. God what damn it, what Jim. Yo, don't ever fuck fucking bring us hey, back. Jackson. Yo, get Chin. 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 We don't oh, want them chewing Chin. on those Get that shit out of here. Chin's hey, drunk Jackson. and you're a better producer. That's yeah. disrespectful. I'll First take the better Prius, producer. And then you give him fucking animal crackers. Jesus Christ. Hey, McDonald's is right there. I'll take I'll take McDonald's before I take Edward. I'll eat that with tuna fish. Get out of here. Delicious with tuna fish, by the way. That, that hurt my feelings. Damn, Dude, Chin. Yeah. That was Are you fun. drinking what? the flat water? These look, too much whiskey, beer, huh? Yeah, Chin gives good. him like, a, too like much some whistle old pig. animal crackers. Hey, you know what? TK ain't the one that's going to get mad if I eat pizza. I bet you, you know, I, I got girl, my, my friend. Mad? No, no, no. My friend, Dude, he's a chef. And he and he um, he um he moved in with me to cook for me. He cooked oh, all damn. my meals. And between him and training with Antonio McKee, I lost 30 pounds. Shit. Yeah, chef, want, I don't want you eating pizza. No, the chef, man, this guy this guy is great, man. He make like healthy food taste good as fuck. I'm a picky eater. You, you have a chef too, Bradley, or no? No, not yet. Yeah. No. 
Right. He's, the chef is the one that's going to get mad. Tiki, Tiki. Tiki's he, cool. Tiki, no, Tiki, I, I thought, I thought maybe we were going to bring Tiki. No, Tiki, he's, he was watching the fight somewhere else. Yeah. Buffalo Wild Wings. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> but I, you know what? I eat a horse ass right now if y'all cook it right. Fuck it. <laughs> <Bring> <laughs> you cook it right. Bring the pizza. Fuck it. No, no, no. Don't eat the pizza. I'm, I'm starving. I'm out. starving. Yeah, yeah you got season, chicken season salad. I'm about to send something to McDonald's. I'm but don't eat Well, no, there's the Irwan up the street with healthy salads and shit. Yeah. Uh, pizza would be good. But yeah, pizza would be good. Yeah. No, no, no. Don't. Uh, there's a pizza place. Oh, you hate pizza? There. I love pizza. I just yeah. don't want you to eat it. I just think it's a good choice. Let's go yeah. combo. Are you, are you really are you strictly real? combination? For the most part, yeah. yeah. I'd say like, like, I like 90% uh, meat lovers. What are you All right, meat lovers. A meat lovers pizza? Yeah, meat lovers pizza. Meat lovers pizza? Yeah. Where are you getting it for what, from what pizza? Well, my, my wallet's up there. Just take my wallet, go up to Irwan and get that giant Shit, pizza. I'll pay for the pizza. No, I got, no it's the least I can get. You took a Prius. You took a Prius there. I got you. eat two slices. No. Has My calories would be low. I only ate breakfast this morning. I ate. Oh, I ate no, Chin can't do it. Kyle or somebody else calories. needs to do it. Around 400 calories. Oh. My wallet's right on the table yeah. there. Get a cheese and tomato and then get an all meat. I, what? Cheese and tomato and all meat. Just get him a Caesar salad. That's perfect. Where, where With you, chicken. You could just get us all salads. What's the name of the pizza? Caesar place? salad. No, it's Irwan. It's really good it's pizza. Good. Oh, it's Irwan? Yeah. Oh, shit. Great Yo, pizza. Yo, wait a minute. Hold on. No, man. I'm asking. You'll like this. You'll like this. All right. No, they might. They might. Or if anyone does, it's there. Hold on, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go pee. I got you. All right, yeah, brother. I got you. Hey, uh, give me a salad. Yeah. Whatever you get. Okay. I'm trying to look like you. <laughs> Sausage. Marina, vet time. Hopefully they don't do the boxing thing where they drag it out to so the fighters have to walk out a certain time. Yeah. What made you saw a thick boy clothing? I'm just thick. And then there's like at my shows, there's so many like thick like dudes who look like me. So I started to start the thick one and just caught on. This is for bigger people. Yeah, that's smart because it's not that, you know go shop. It's not that many clothes for big people. Well, it's like like we don't do like big and tall shit, but it's just like you know like most dudes aren't built like Bradley or you know so like the common dudes like normal you know so we're thick yeah. boys. That was a good idea. Yeah, it's gone well, man. Yeah, I, I did a podcast with um, DJ Paul from um, Three Six yeah. Month the other day, and he does clothing line and stuff. And he asked me, "Hey, let's do something together." I said, "Okay, cool," but I want to do something for big and tall because. Before I lost these 30 pounds, I had to buy some more clothes and stuff. Yeah, I man. went to Big and Tall. This shit sucked. Oh, it's terrible. It's yeah, terrible. I, yeah I, used to, I used to work with them. It's awful. awful. It's awful. awful. And, it, like, and then we get big and it's all boxy. Yeah. Like shit. And, and that's it just why, don't look good. It just that, don't look good That's either. why like uh, this company built, they have shirts where it's like, if you're a bigger dude, and like even if you have a tummy, but it hides it. Yeah. So that's why I rock them all the time, these oh, built yeah. shirts. They're great. I've, I, never, I never heard yeah, of Yeah, I'll send you some. Yeah. Oh, they're great, man. Yeah, I'll send yeah. you some. I want, I, want, I, want, I want Big and Tall to have like some designer stuff. So yeah, I'm like some with fly him. shit. So I'm, I'm trying to design some some fly shit for, for the big people. You're you not know, that big and tall, dude. I know, Big and Tall, but I don't fit on other stuff. So Big and Tall, I go there and the stuff you're like too a, big. You're a tweener. You're, you're a thick boy. You're a thick boy. You're a thick boy. This is going to be good. Here we go. Coming is it? Up is it though? Is it, Brian? Is it gonna be good? No matter what, it's gonna be good. As long, if it goes to decision, it can be all dicey. You know what it is? It's the anticipation of it all. That's right. That's I don't think is. so. I think it's gonna be entertaining shit. Well, look, Tyron Woodley is a great champion, and uh, it's gonna right be there. interesting. Now, here's my question to both of you guys, and all due respect. When I, the only time I've seen Tyron is we're about to say something negative right now. With all due respect, when I see him hitting mitts, I don't see. I don't. I just see mitts, and I'm not seeing. I'm not seeing any specific. Uh, see, you know what's scary? This is what, this what scares me right now. I don't see a sweat on him. Right. Like that's the thing. Like you got to come out a little bit damp. You, you that means like because I, I actually trained. I used to train this girl named Jermaine Jermaine Deronomy. Yeah. So she yeah. she never warmed up. She's from Holland. She's a kickboxer. She never warmed up. She got a highlight reel of her on YouTube knocking out a guy. Frank Grillo. Yeah. Our boy. But, oh yeah. There he is. This is called Cop Shop. This is this is uh, I think uh, Carnahan. Produced this or wrote this? Yeah, Carnahan wrote this. Oh, he's a dope writer. Bro. Is that the three hundred guy? Is that is that the three hundred guy? Yeah, yeah, no, no, no. Uh, what's no, his name? No. Yes, yes, that's true. Yeah, yeah, there he is. Yeah, Frank Butler, 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 right? Yeah, Frank's the fucking man. Yeah, Frank's the man. Yeah, Frank's the man. Butler's cool too. Legit I met him before. Guy. He's cool. Yeah, he's really cool. I can't Butler. wait to see that. Butler's really. Cool. I can't wait to see that. Yeah, Frank, he's dope. Yeah, I love his movies. He's so good. Great guy too. He's legit like Hollywood tough guy too. Oh yeah, he can box. He can fucking box. He can fight. And and you do jiu-jitsu actually. Come on, man, give us main event. He was a Hickson gave him his purple belt. Yeah, that's cool. Yeah, he's no joke, man. Frank, as far as actors go. But hey, but Carnahan is a dope ass writer. People don't know this, but he's a great writer. Don't, I don't think I don't know if he get credit for it, but he actually wrote eighteen because yes, he he, yes, he didn't he like did. the script. Yep. 
He didn't like the script, so he changed. We was working on the movie without a finished script, but he was writing the script as we were going. As you were going, dude, he's such a good writer. It's weird. Like somebody, he's such a good writer. Like he, and his brother's a fucking great writer too. Here we go. Oh, here we go. Eight rounds. Cruiserweight, one eighty-eight, right? Damn, one eighty-nine. Dude, you know how insane it's gonna be if Jake Paul knocks him out. I mean, it's gonna be nuts. I do think I do wonder why Tyron isn't. He does look very dry, and you want to be a little. Yeah. I don't know. Well, they could have shot that way earlier, though. Yeah. That's true. That's true as well. That's yeah, 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 yeah. That probably was yeah, earlier yeah. footage when he first. Yeah. That's not live, B. They're not live. Yeah. But I have a problem. I, I I always warm up pretty well. Then by the time I get to the cage, I'm I'm dry. I don't yeah. Like I don't know how to. And it's cold. Yeah. Like you see, warm up, you're all sweaty, and then when you at walk outside, it's so cold. Yeah. yeah. But see, I always bring a change. When you walk outside, yeah. So what I do is I'll bring two sets. I'll bring one sweatsuit to, to warm up in. Up. I change out of it. I put on a dry one because I can keep my sweat going until yeah. I get to the cage. Because when you walk out, when you walk when, out, we get the, the dock, auditorium. It's it's cold, freezing. Man. The yeah. reason why it's freezing because the majority of the time we fight in ice skating rinks. That's true. But you go to, when you go to places, right? Because that's an eighteen to twenty thousand seat arena. Wow. So most of the UFCs are in eighteen to twenty thousand uh. seat arenas. So they're usually ice skating rinks. So there's ice underneath the. Why we don't be slipping and sliding around? <laughs> Bro, who is this guy? Yeah. I see Walking him Mar Ronello? Mar Ronello? Yeah. Yeah. Is he? I, he was the voice bro, of Pride, you yeah. Pride, oh. Strike Force. Yeah. Now Bellator. Fuck, dude, fuck. I saw him last time. I was like, I've never He's seen been that doing guy. it for like he came 15 to Pride years. After Steven, Steven Quattro's. I miss Steven Quattro's. He was great too, yeah. Yeah, yeah. I, yeah, I, him and Boston like were great. Skeletor? Skeletor. <laughs> we call him Skeletor. I, I liked him. He was I'm, a nice guy, but Morrow's commentary legend. wise, this guy's the Morrow's fucking the man. Best, man. Morrow's the best, man. Yeah, he's good. I, if I if I was to say anybody that's done commentary, I put really I put Morrow first, and then I probably have like I, I right now I probably have Anik next. Who was that? Anik. You know, you can put Rogan in there. No, no, I'm talking about the, you're saying like that. This? Yeah, this. Yeah, what what is this? Play by play. They're the play by play. Play by play. So yeah. Rogan's like, not the play by Rogan's play. Guy. Guy. No, he's color. He's, he's color. color. He does what he does. What I do and what yeah what. And like what Bisbing does. No, Bisbing does. And VC. I, and I, Felder, never, yeah. I never understood that. Yeah. 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 I don't know. One time they, I, I did, I did, These, I did, and they called it color. I thought it was because I was black. <laughs> <laughs> honestly. I did, color I did. commentator? Like, yeah, damn, yeah. man. That's what yeah. I thought. I, I, Super racist. Like, yeah. not honestly. a color con commentator. Not I color, but what's, color. I didn't understand. What's the play by play? They, what's the play by play? Bring play by out, play does like all the commercial reads. They do all the ad reads. They do all the. They lead they, up. They, they lead up. everybody. Yeah, they, they toss like everyone. The, you know, like, Anik be like, Joe, what are we seeing here? And then Joe will break it down. Oh, okay. So what they do is they carry on the conversation when there's really nothing going on. So like if the fighters are just hanging out against the cage, he's like, the color will say, yeah, so so and so's sister had a baby back in like 1422, and like they'll talk about they'll they'll have, they'll fill in uh, with like knowledge of the shit. fighter, I thought random shit. Gold, Goldberg was so good, and uh, they call Goldie? that the color. Goldie's great. Goldie's, yeah. Goldie's great. I think Goldie's great. So good, man. The the uh, um, yeah. go go, Goldie's with all great. Due respect. Yeah, you gotta say that. Yeah, you have to, with all, like, yeah. The, look, the thing is, when Goldie left the UFC and then he came to Bellator, and he's Goldie's amazing. I, I want, I want to see him change his style a little bit from place to place. That's it. Agree, because there's That's that it. UFC like yeah. his, his brand and oh, it go to Bellator, and then when it's not UFC, it was it's like just, a weird mix. Huh. It just didn't flow. It was, right. it was the same. Really? It, was, it was using it was the exact a lot same, of the like, same stuff. Here just, we go. Oh, yeah. Yeah. he, yeah, he yeah, needs yeah. to be like because he's here's the thing. He's fucking super creative. Like he's got a lot of oh, stuff. He's so talented. He's so fucking good. But the problem is, I was like, when he came, when he left UFC, and went to Bellator. It still had that UFC feel. I was like, ah. I think yeah, I understand what you're saying because you're so used to it. Yeah, you're been great. UFC yeah. sound. Yeah, right? he, and he so yeah, switch uh, it up. Yeah, because he's and he, he he is so good at everything he does. Yeah, he, he just had to mix it up himself. That's it. Are there any fights that you're dying to coming see? Up next. That was dying, coming dying up next. Dying to see? Coming oh. up next. The fight I want to see, the one now that uh, Giga just won, I want to yeah. see him and, and Calvin Cater. Well, that's a great fight. Him and Calvin Cater. Don't get me wrong. I know he called out Max yeah, Holloway, but Calvin. that's a big jump. Max has a fight already. That's a big jump, though, for him to fight Max. Like, go to Calvin Cater. I'm Calvin Cater. Oh, you Calvin, know Max though. was supposed to fight Zaire, and then uh, Max had to pull out. Yeah, yeah. like I just said. Yeah. Zaire, though, is... Yeah, who knows? Coming He's up, up and down. I yeah. would have loved to see Giga fight Zabit, but Zabit's not fucking fighting. Yeah, Zabit's, Zabit's, Zabit's also ranked way ahead. And uh, uh, yeah, um, Zabit's too high. Yeah. What yeah. about who's next to fight? Who's who's left for Izzy? Izzy's supposed to fight Whitaker, but he got postponed because in New yeah. Zealand, one person got COVID and yeah, like shut right. shit down. That's right. One person. And it shut down the whole country. Yeah. yeah, that's crazy. Yeah. Dave Chappelle that's, in the crowd. Oh damn. Oh shit. Right, that's, oh, yeah, that's he easy, but he lives in Ohio. He lives in Ohio. Yeah, yeah. yeah he's there. The Poirier. Poirier. 
Is he from Ohio as well? No, no he's, he's from New Orleans, Louisiana. Louisiana. Oh, he's from Lafayette. He's, awesome. he's great. He's a good guy. Huh? He's a good kid. He's a very good kid. Yeah, yeah. Great guy. Funny. Oh, oh Chappelle here. Lacey. Oh, yeah. Andre Berto right there what, fought. What that they look oh, he's a great boxer. He fought. He fought. Uh, he's retired. Uh, he uh -huh. fought um, uh, Mayweather. Um, yeah. Did a great job. Been on Big Brown Breakdown too. Corey Springs. Is that, that's Neon Spinks' son. Yep. Yeah, man. Andre Berto is a bad motherfucker. He man. looks like Neon Spinks. That's what looks like Michael Irving. Um, she's an Olympian. It's a yeah, who's that? Sprint. Oh, is that she? No. She's that. She's my bad. She don't want to get caught smoking weed. No, no, no. 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 She didn't go to the Olympics. She's. Oh. I think she won a gold, right? No, bronze. That'd okay. be a bronze. Oh, and yeah. homeboy has a Sorry. silver, but they don't All care. Right. That guy I got, got a gold, gold. For I don't care swimming about swimming. Around. Even I don't care about swimming. swimming. Good for him. Damn, he has to wear the. They're like, dude, you can come, but you got to bring your medal. He's got like, fuck. I bet he won that, that swimming with his ears. There's Boom Boom Mancini <laughs> right there. The great Boom Boom. Glad you're fucked. That's funny as shit. Ray Mancini won this. Yeah, he's awesome. Watch boom boom, boom boom killed a guy. Yeah, he did. Wait, like Duck Kyung in, in, in the ring. Duck uh, Kyung Su or something. In, in uh, Japan, yeah. I think. Oh, he's a boxer. No, Korea. Uh, Korean guy. Korean guy. Yeah. Korean guy. His yeah. father was his coach, man. They find that a lot of fa when fathers are coaches of sons, those are the ones that, if you look at like the statistics, they're the ones that usually die in the ring. Uh, not a lot of guys have died before. But there have been enough, and the ones they've done, they they're do always, the thing. They're always dads, a coaches? Lot of times dad, yeah, because the dads dad. want to let them go. It's because so the kid yeah. doesn't want to, you know, he doesn't want to. You think it's it'd be opposite. Up. Yeah, it would, but it's fucked up. But that makes me sad. What you is Logan know. saying right now? I know. like how his tag is fucked. Can you hear it, Chin? Is it anything good? I mean, we can, but. No, we can't hear it. We'll get kicked off here. You had like a hair Anything good? I don't know why Chin doesn't get to listen to it. No, I can't hear it you, are you have a hard time reading the? It's going fast, fast enough. <laughs> it is fast. It's fast, fast as hell. Yeah. Yeah. That's the fastest kid, man. captions I've ever seen. Actually, <laughs> agree. You wow, they're behind. Yeah. You wow, just, I'm really trying. <laughs> I wish they could get a shot of this so like the internet. It, can it, see is, how it is. It is kind of fast. Man. Hey, it real is. quick, what, who was I arguing with? Oh, Andrew Schultz. He was saying you think this fight's gonna be bigger. Look at that arena compared to when Jake fought Ben Askren. That arena is. No, this is way bigger. Yeah, but no, no, no. But but you have to remember though that that show. Well, Ben Askren was on Triller, right? Yeah. Oh, that was a fuck. The whole production. The whole production was a shit show. This is also momentum. It was horrible, man. We've had a lot of time. Horrible. Like now we're like, wait a minute, maybe Jake Paul. This is something used to be bigger because it's a tougher fight. It's in his hometown. Like, but this is a real production. They put money behind it. Yeah, nobody does real production. Oh, it's fucking good. Oh, Triller was a night like a fucking yeah. Did he get the Prince symbol there? What is that? Oh, this shit was horrible. Logo like McKee. All right. Oh, that's cool. He said he was gonna if he wins that championship fight, which he did. He goes, "I'm gonna buy your car, man." I said, "Don't no, do that. Don't man. do that. We'll invest <laughs> it in real estate or something." Yeah, yeah. yeah, he loves cars, man. Yeah, he, he loves, loves cars. cars. He has that yeah. little uh, it was a little, that little rocket. Yeah, yeah, it's a Honda. It's, it's, it's a uh, yeah. Civic. Yeah, souped up. He's souped up. Yeah. yeah, he's learning how to fix it on. Yeah. yeah. He's a, he's a real good kid, man. He he's is. a great dude. You know, man. You know, I he, love him. You know, he adopted his little brother. Oh, damn. Yeah. His little brother, his little brother trained there at the gym. He's a really, really good dude. He's a good dude. He's taking his little brother on his wing. Now his little brother's like, getting his shit together. Well, look at the other guy. The other guy that, that trains with Joey Davis. Yeah. That kid is, you just got to get his mental right. That kid's fucking that phenomenal, kid is phenomenal, man. Phenomenal, yeah. He is so damn good. He's got a great dad. His family yeah. loves him. Like, it's yeah. it's crazy. Yeah. Look at these guys. They started off with their jackets and their fucking ties all. <laughs> They're hot. Dave Portner, yeah. I can give a fuck. Either. He, I Fuck. like Dave Portner. I don't know him, but he yeah. seems like a I like great Big Cat. Dude. Who is that guy over there on the right? Big yeah. Cat. He's he, he's a talented dude, man. Is he? Why did they decide Who to match? He? This is a little awkward. He's a guy for Barstool. He oh, hosts okay. the the show. Uh, part of my take. Yep. Hmm. I like that. I like Barstool. It's good, man. I like it. Cut the sound off. Yeah, the production's great. You go show it. So get, far, it it'll yeah. It'll get. Yeah, the the flag is and pull us off YouTube. That's how like me and Rogan for years with Fight Campaign. Like he he'd never play the sound because if it does, it, they pick it up and shut it down. Wow, technology! Even with Rogan being the face of the UFC, they, he still can't play the sound. Yeah. Wow, technology! You think Showtime? Be like, yeah, you can play the sound. You're worth Showtime. I would imagine. Maybe they won't pull us. Nah. You know, they give us a little leeway, but I can't like air the fight. I mean, no, no. Because pay per view, the sound you think. They would, yeah, you let them know beforehand to play the sound. Yeah, you think. Damn. Maybe just give us like earplugs, you know. A little air, AirPod. I know it's uh, the, pro it's the problem. The problem with that, a, if we all could listen to the fight, thing, we wouldn't sucks. talk. That's oh, true. I, I never just, thought about know, that. Just put it in. And One of us could. Yeah. Yeah. You, you I'm, should a, have I'm, the, it. I'm the. You know. Yeah. You yeah, should. Fucking have it. internet guy here. Yeah. You right. I'm reading the fucking chat. Shout out the chat, by the way. Let's You're go. in the chat. You're Bro, they love this shit. Yeah. You can do it all. 
You can do it all. I think we're at over 25,000 live watching. 28,000. That's wow. pretty good. Oh, that's yeah. a lot, yeah. Bradley, yeah, where'd, really you, uh, where'd you grow up? San Francisco. Yeah. I've North lived in town. LA, though, for the last, like, Fuck. 13 years. Huh. Yeah. But yeah, I'm definitely a social media guy, for sure. Yeah, he's a social media whiz. That's why I'm watching. I'm like, yo. I get a lot of tips from him. Really? Here we go. What, what, what would you call it the name Zoo Culture? Oh, there's a long story for that one, man. Can um, you make it a short one? Or? <laughs> I love people that like, well, well that's the, a long the thing one. Is, no, I'll start with my mom. When <laughs> I was in, uh, like, ah, oh, fuck. Where? The, um, that's like Todd Film. He's like, long the, story short, and then 50 <laughs> minutes later. It's yeah, like, it's, oh, it's, so it's a really long story, but essentially I, I wanted to blend my other logo, the Raw Gear Diamond, the logo, into what the name of the gym is going to be. So you'd have to see the logo of Zoo. Yeah. It's, it's a kind of like a very complicated thing, but in the logo Zoo. You have the logo right there? This is the raw gear. This okay. is the raw gear. I'm already getting bored. So exactly. Hurry up. See, so I was like, I don't want. I don't want. This is going to yeah. be a thing that we can't do I'm this right now. Deep wow. Raw dog. It's no. It's called raw gear. Oh, raw gear. But then his I gym's like called Zoo Culture. Way, I named it's like the yeah. gym. It's oh, it's really? yeah. I'm there every day. It's great. But I wanted to blend them, and like yeah. if you saw the logo, you would see how it blends. But the but, so, but the logo, but the name Zoo came from where? Well, just being it's, like it's wild for it's for what I wanted to blend this into that. It needed like visually, it needed the two O's. Like oh. I needed to think of something that made sense. Oh word, yeah. Oh. So it's kind of a longer story. Just I don't want to fucking. Bore no, yeah. I mean we got one. it. So. I always love those guys saying, "Hey, long story short, but it's a fucking already been too long." Yeah, <laughs> yeah. yeah. Well, I'm just until <laughs> I get yeah. there. Yeah, he cleaned it up. He, <laughs> I, yeah, he you did your best. Yeah. I mean, listen. Are these guys talking smack here? So you live nearby then? Yeah. So you're here, you're here, your yeah, gym's yeah, here. Yeah. yeah, that's how we met. Gene, where you live? <laughs> Gene lives in Marina What's Del Rey. Up? You live where? Marina Del Rey. How far is that? Oh, it's, it's, far. <clears throat> it's far. It's <clears throat> far? Yeah. He, 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 so Brian and uh, Chin live on the west side. It's a shit show down there. But This uh, this was another reason why I think that they were so happy to promote this fight, is they actually have footage of Tyrell fighting because of Strike Force. Because Showtime had no the worries. footage of him. That's uh, true. Cause they, so then it makes it easier to market the fact that he's a stud. Like, yeah, he's knocked yeah, yeah. out all these guys. But remember, this also came, this this whole fight came to fruition when um, when Askren was fighting Jake. Yep. Woodley was calling Askren. He went into the locker room, and Jake's cornerman started talking shit to Woodley. And Woodley was like, we can do it right here, man, and just built the fight up. Do you think some of this stuff is staged? No, because the guy who that's, it wasn't really Jake starting. It was this cornerman who was a, a boxer that nobody knows. Mm -hmm. And he just started talking shit to him. Wait, you just said this shit isn't staged? Uh-uh. You think none of it is staged? That that was organic. I know for a fact room. they go into these things. Oh, no, like, this is for sure. No, for sure. Like we stealing their hat or got your hat. Oh, all that's that all planned. You think yeah. that was planned? Yeah, 100%. well, Jake, oh, Jake they were on the plane. Jake and uh, Logan were on the plane Absolutely. flying in. And Jake goes, I'm going to take his hat. And Logan goes, I wouldn't do that, dude. Don't do that. And then Jake just did it, and that's when he got jumped. I mean, that's why like him guys. getting jumps, that, well, him that's getting not jumps, stage. not playing. But it, okay, but that's not staged if the other person don't know about. No, it. No, they don't know. Yeah, it's yeah, not yeah, staged. Yeah, yeah. But, but it's definitely they, planned. They, it's it's pre-planned. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They planned yeah. it. Yeah. Hundred percent. Like Jake was like, "Oh, I'm gonna do this," and Logan yeah. told him that's. I mean, a bad that's the idea. thing, man. These kids are not stupid. They're very that fucking super smart. Violent. They totally yeah. know how to use the internet. Like you can't deny any of that. And, but it but it helps everybody. Like it helps the fighters. Like of now course. Woodley's getting more eyeballs than he's ever got before. Yeah. So I thought it was the other brother that stole the head. It was this asshole. Yeah. yeah. This and one. He got. Yeah. I get them mixed up. And he got beat the fuck up by Floyd's uh, bodyguards. Yeah. Really? He got beat up. Is it footage black of that? Eye, oh yeah. yeah. Black eye. Yeah. He got an uppercut. They like jumped him. And well, then Logan rushed over there. Oh, so I got. I was I, and the Floyd, whole time. I Floyd thought was it was like, the other I don't. Floyd was like, I don't know. Like, Logan did it. Yeah. No. Because I was thinking, why? Why would? He, why would he do it? Why would why would yeah. Jake do it? Yeah, just he's a, not just all a, about all about drama, starting to drama, get more. Then the narrative was Jake. Like everyone yeah. was talking about Jake because yeah. he did it. Oh, here we go. go. Here we go. Come on, Woodley. Here we go. Come on. Damn, man. this is exciting though. I can't lie. As much as I think it's a fake ass fight, I, I'm it's so excited. Fake, I don't right. think it's a fake fight. I love how you guys real, man. Yeah. It's obviously I, not a fake fight. It's real. They're yeah. actually fighting, but he's not taking a fall. I don't know, man. He's not telling you. don't know. No, T would not T would Ben Aspen. No, he won't. He didn't take a fall, but he didn't. Prepare for it. Yeah. No. So that's kind of like taking a fall. You don't think he trained hey. at all? He, no. Bro, he ran. He just ran out there and got punched in the face and fell down. Yeah. That's yeah. Well, what happened. Out, but yeah. This. <laughs> Did he, he get knocked out though? No. He wasn't knocked out. But T. He but he T. He got T. Wood, got, T. Wood got too much out. pride, man. Yeah. Yeah. I'm ben sorry. Askren did not get. You knocked cannot out. be a four, you can't be a former world champion in any organization. I don't give a shit and go out there and be like, oh, I'm just gonna take a fall. Fuck no. Ben Askren still up there. My ego is too fucking much. Yeah. I mean, I don't know. Who's that rapper? Who's that rapper walking out with him? I don't know. He's not famous. Oh, uh, that's uh. Fuck. I'm not up on my pop culture. I didn't. I you haven't listened to Kanye, the Donda. I think that's nah, oh, Genesis. Nah, OT Genesis. Yeah, OT Genesis. OT is, Genesis. is he
Coco? He's not like mainstream. I thought mainstream. you said something. I how do you guys keep else. up with this shit? I want to know how you guys all Coke keep up with this about stuff. Five years ago. <laughs> it drives me crazy. <laughs> Maybe. I, I I promise you that's, that's what I thought you said. I'm surprised you oh, don't understand. Oh, he's in love with Coke. Co- bro, your fucking arms gotta be tired. That's impressive. <laughs> Yeah, More it's like your arms got me tired. Uh, yeah, yeah. probably about three. Yeah, man, that's boxing though, yeah. man. What song is he? I just wonder what song is he playing. <clears throat> it's you know what? It's never good when yeah. they when they walk out and sing it. It's yeah, never good. no, no, it never works right. out. Literally, literally. Thank I you wonder who I was going to have somebody with. walk me out when I fight Shannon. So, so who would you, you have? Yeah, don't have don't. a I'm, Memphis dude. Like yeah, I'm from, Memphis, I'm from Memphis, and I think Memphis kind of mad at me because I never, I never, I never like, I never really came out to a lot of Memphis songs, and like when I started fighting on TV. So three I, six, I, three six yeah. would be fucking. Yeah. Sick. You know what you do? This is what you do when you have them walk you out. You should do don't that. have oh, them. Don't, don't, me, don't have them sing. Have them lip sync to what the music. Yeah, that's what they yeah. usually that's do. That's what like, I think you do. should have yeah. an opera singer come out. It's nah, three six would be grain. sick. What, and what about some ballerinas? Yes. What, wait, wait, what about little Nas X? Wait, wait, wait. I'm just spitballing ideas. What are we still I'm gonna tell you. I'm gonna tell you why not him because I didn't like his music video. Which yeah. one? Oh yeah. The last one. I'm God Street Soldier. I just you know. What oh, I'm saying? oh yeah, the yeah. fucking yeah, yeah, the devil yeah. thing. And I just I don't I don't I don't like yeah, the de- I don't like the yeah. devil. The devil like, thing was a little much. And the yeah. six six shoes with the blood. Yeah, in yeah. Them. I just don't I just don't like I just but don't just like they, 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 they got pulled music. right because little Those kids, shoes got you know? pulled. Yeah, they I got, come out with my shirt off and I'm just like I don't know what I'd be doing. Just clanging a fucking like tambourine. No, you sing. Tangerine. Just sing. Mm, sing he's like the baddest motherfucker. Yeah, yeah. Just make it up. Mafia and you against Shannon Briggs. Oh my god. Sick. Shannon Briggs. Yeah. Do that. Man. And so if you beat him, you're going to fight him in MMA or he has to fight him in MMA either way? Either way. Damn, that's but, sick. But, but, but honestly, I think that's, a, I think that's, that's that? the only reason why I never came out the 3-6 Mafia because of their name because I am God Street Soldier. Oh, word. But, but, but I, I, met, I met DJ Paul and he not like that. No, it's I know just, him. He's it's, not like that. Yeah. So now I, I, you know, I'm cool since I've known him all these years. But before you meet somebody, you don't know. Yeah. Come out to judge people. You yeah. got to come out to slob on my knob. <laughs> like coin on the cop. Yeah, you gotta Slob come out to that. You gotta come Slob out to that. Slob on my knob. You yeah, haven't heard that's that song? Aggressive. That's God, aggressive. That's, that's too aggressive. That's, that's, that's too aggressive hits. for a fight. You're yeah, right. It might so be. It so might be inappropriate. He got a lot of fights on. He has a lot of fights on. Here we go. Here we go. Inappropriate for a fight. Hey guys, here we go. Here's Jake. Oh wow! Look at the Indian Yahoo Indian on his shoulder. That's sick. What does that mean? That so that the Cleveland Indians can't use that logo anymore. So they changed the Cleveland Sentinel some bullshit. Yeah, it's weird. It's something Guardians, weird. Cleveland Guardians, Guardians, Cleveland Guardians. So he just represents. So he put. In, uh, yeah, Indian so he put the Indian, so he put the whole Cleveland shit. Oh on shit, that shit that's fucking fire. dope though. Damn, that is tough. Well, he, is he from Cleveland? He's yeah, a, he's, he's from Ohio. Ohio boy. Yeah. Yeah, you better be. Ohio. I was gonna say. That's tough though. Here we go. Yeah, that looks sick. yeah. here we go. That's a tight move. Damn. How nervous Does is it he? look nervous? Look how sweaty thing, like, he is. Hey, look how like sweaty he is. When I was in is. Logan Paul's, he's warmed up. He's in shape. Never nervous. Yeah. Like they don't. The attention doesn't been, get to him because he ain't been fighting. He nobody. doesn't. But yeah, he doesn't realize like the repercussions that could happen because he's been it's fighting. It's been a cakewalk. He, yeah. Before he, this is his toughest. Yeah. Test I think he looks before. nervous. He's he sweaty. I think. I mean, you're gonna be a little nervous, right? Of course, you have to be. But he's also a showman. He's also so used to big. There's a difference between being nervous and there's a difference between like anxiety, like almost like that excitement to get this shit over with. Like, hey, in what eight rounds, he's getting paid. Yeah. When he walks out at the end, like that's that's all my fights at at the end. I was always like, in 25 minutes or in 15 minutes. I'm getting a check. That's yeah, all I cared yeah, about. Yeah. I didn't think about anything else. I, I was like, yeah. I never thought of it. I never thought about it. I, all I did was I, 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 I was like, no. Yeah, yeah, all the hard shit's over, man. This is the fun part. The fight part. The fight was the best part. The taking this seriously. The fighting was the best part. I thought about the money when I got hurt in training camp. I'm like, man, I don't want to pull out, man. I'm going to miss this money. What was your mentality, Rampage? Going in, like, walking to the ring. Yeah, like this moment. I'm a different person. You were there to. I'm, I'm t- no, I'm, t- I'm a totally different person. I'm, I'm most of the time I'm rampage, but sometimes he don't show up. Yep. Sometimes rampage does not. He show doesn't want to show up. Yeah. Yeah, sometimes he don't show he up. Just don't want to fight. What do you mean by that? Like you show up and you're not motivated to fight? No, it's just, it's just that, um, it's, it's, a, it's a weird thing. It's, a, it's a switch. It's a switch, and I can't control it. It's, it's a switch, and and I, and I'm rampage. But I remember, uh, one fight. I knew I wasn't rampage because somebody was walking me out and he dropped like a pin or something and I was gonna bend down and help him pick it up. I'm like, oh, oh, what the oh fuck. fuck! Did you lose that fight? I think I lost that fight. Damn. Like, but but, but, but I've, you... I've, I've, I, me, Quinn has won some fights before, but most of the time it's rampage in there. Do you get nervous? Yeah, yeah, you know, but not not the same. That's why I want to do boxing too because even when I was fighting Fedor, even though I was I was unhealthy, I was out of shape. I trained really hard for that fight. People don't understand that, but I, I had like a um, I got misdiagnosed. And some medicine like fucked me up, and I was 
and I just wasn't, you know, I should I should have pulled out. And and, and Fedor is a dangerous motherfucker. Yeah, yeah, but yeah. It, it was not challenging for me. I've been fighting for so long. I said I want to do something different. Boxing. Now I'm gonna get nervous all over again. Yeah. There's gonna be something get those different. I'm gonna get the where you don't know, you know, you don't know what's gonna yeah, happen. The unknown. Yeah. Yeah. I want I want that feeling again. Feel like, yeah. when, like like ten years ago when mm -hmm. I was, you know, mm -hmm. like when you T first started. is not fun though. What's that? T no Wood is not five nine. No, maybe five seven. Yeah. Maybe, say, maybe five I, seven, I five eight. Five, 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 eight. Here it goes. Here, I mean, this is it, right? I'll here. give him five eight, maybe. No three knockdown, bro. No three knockdown. Oh, I yeah. have no idea how this can go down. Yeah, I, I feel you. you so there's, there's times you show up to the venue. And you just don't feel like fighting. Yeah. Yeah. You get there, you're like, damn. Money, you have a great camp. You wake up in the morning, like. Damn, yeah. today's not the day. Yeah, There's shit. nothing worse when you're There's back there and you're like, oh, I'm off. Today. I'm just not feeling it, man. Before the just, fight, yeah. yeah like, oh like, oh my god, like, I couldn't even you know, imagine that. Shop. Time to roll, and you're like, fuck, I don't feel like doing fuck. that. Fuck, I couldn't imagine no, that. No, there's, there, like, you'll, you'll have a great camp. You're like, fuck, yeah. I feel the best I've ever had. No injuries show up, and, like, the morning of the fight, you wake up, and you're just like, I'm tired. I've asked, yeah. myself, I've asked yeah. myself a few times, like, why am, uh, why am I doing this? Yeah. I've asked myself that. Before the fight. Yeah. I've by, asked by myself. Yeah. The day of, I mean, you're just like, yeah. no, no, so fuck. I've asked myself that a few times, maybe, like, three three times like, in my career. Yeah. Why am I doing this? Then when I get that paycheck, like, oh, that's what I'm doing. That's right. Yeah. Then, I mean, then I'm, I'm on a high. If I win, I knock somebody out. So I'm on a high. I don't. I can't even really sleep that night. I no, go out drinking. Yeah. And stuff. Yeah. I'm, I'm like still. I'm still. The adrenaline. The adrenaline flowing, is man. flowing. After the show, yeah. after the fight, after the fight. Yeah, especially if you get a knockout. Especially if I like, fight in Vegas or something. I don't. I thought it was just, even in Japan. I stay up. I stay up all night partying in the clubs and drinking and stuff. I don't do no drugs. Yeah. Something you guys need to know about me. Weed is the only drug I ever tried in my whole life. I've never even tried any Nothing. other drug. No. Never. And I started smoking weed as a alcohol kid. Alcohol choice as well. Yeah, alcohol. I drink alcohol. Never any mushrooms? Drug. Never. Never. Mm -hmm. I'm I'm totally against drugs. Never Makes tried sense. it. Cocaine, though. Never tried it. <laughs> <laughs> never tried it. I mean, the bathroom was like 10 minutes. Man, I never tried <laughs> it. I don't know. I never tried it. And so I can stay up. I, I, I can stay up. like people. The natural adrenaline. Just like yeah. my friends be doing stuff. I stay up yeah. just right with them. Stay After with a fight, yeah. I can do it. The adrenaline going. Yeah. Josh. You look like a seasoned drug addict. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he actually does Josh not. Josh is all quiet. <laughs> I know, but, Josh, yeah, but I like Josh because Josh is like, mm -hmm, that's cool. No, you actually like you don't do any drugs. No, no but yeah. look no, at that guy. You're man. clean. No, I How drink. old are you? I drink. I'm drink. Um, 43. Young as fuck. You look young, young as fuck. 43. Yeah, you yeah. look so young. Yeah, doesn't he look good? So young. Yeah. I try, man. I try. No, I mean, I drink, I drink quite a bit now, especially now that I'm done fighting. Yeah, I mean, you got to remember, I spent 20 years just... Sure, I drank after the fight, like a month. and then by Monday, I was back in the yep. gym, just training, back on track. I'm like, all right, whatever. So, all right, all right, let's go. It's about to go down. So, I, I don't know. I'm at, yeah. Tyron has, still has his music on. This so shit, it's just a little nervous. I'm gonna take Brendan's money. Tyron is smaller. <laughs> Second time man. in a row. He looks smaller. He didn't, pay me, he didn't pay me, by the way, last time. Well, I knew we were I haven't got the money. What if Tyron is knocking him out? I love betting. I love him. I love him. Boom, the spark. You know what I don't like is he has to have he has those headphones. Personally, I'm rooting for Tyron. I just. I want Tyron to win. Me too. I want T Wood to win. I have I no idea what's I, gonna happen. Uh, Let's yeah. go, Wood. Hope, hopefully, Wood leaves. <coughs> Bless you. He's you know what I want to see? This is what I want to see. I want to see a knockdown, fucking drag out fight, and then Wood knocks him out like in the sixth or seventh. So then they That'd do the better. rematch, and then it makes the rematch more. Yeah, but I think if that were to happen, Jake Paul's gonna win more fans. Even if he were to lose, yeah. if yes, he gets correct. knocked down and fights, like yeah. a fighter, correct. he's gonna win more. That's fans. That's what I'm saying. Correct. The rematch would be fucking yeah. even way bigger. You, you gotta respect this. No, to these, do to fight. Period. Space. Like that takes fucking balls, man. Like, Who's the is, better boxer? How much you bet? Ten grand. Eleven. Uh, I have eleven on it. Included. Jesus. Between him and his brother. Yeah. Him and uh, him and Logan. Who's older? Who's older? Logan's. That's Logan's older. Yeah. Pam, good old Pam. Oh, his mom not bad. I like Mills. Who's that? Yeah. Oh, oh, yeah. <laughs> what the fuck happened? That's my guy right there. Whoa. Yo, could you imagine right now? No, We're I can't. Gonna... Oh, and the lights. Everybody calm down. Okay. Hold on. Everyone be cool. Be All cool. right, the fight hasn't started yet. Everybody calm down. Guys, we calm lost down. signal. I'm telling I'm telling everyone listening right now. <laughs> yes. Okay. Oh, volume, oh, volume, 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 all right, all right, here we go. Here I we have go. no. I'll tell you right now, if Jake knocks him out with with ease, it's off to the fucking races. Yeah, with that yeah. Yeah. Oh,
Uh, oh, shit. Whoa, why is, he, why is Woodley oh, so low like that? Hey, it's, and when you're short, it's better to be shorter. Are you? It's better to be shorter. It's harder to fight a shorter guy if you, you got to get lower when you're shorter. Wow. I feel him out a little bit here. Here we go. Wow. Mm. It's going to be different here. Relax, Damn, T Wood. Jake, Relax, T Wood. More controlled. More Relax. Respect. Yeah, he's way more controlled than all these oh, other fights. Oh yeah, nice slow jab there. And T Wood hits. Come it's on, Wood. T Wood has the white stance. Yeah, and he looks big, and fucking strong. Man, wow. he got a big old ass. <laughs> Wood, big ass. Wood got a got big, big fucking. Legs. He got a big real, ass, real bro. Pace. That's what the power legs, bro. That's where the punching power comes yeah. from. Yeah, that's respect out of Jake, though. That just shows a sign of intelligence. A real different pace for sure in this fire than all the other ones. Well, they don't could fucking move, man. Yeah, he oh, can. Yeah. yeah, he fucking Have you seen can. Him fight yeah. Yeah. Oh, looks so Athlete. Athlete. He looks good. fucking good. Oh. <laughs> like yeah. Wow. Time we need to double that jab. I'm still there. shocked at this fucking belt that he's got on his, his know, waistband. So wow. Oh, his waistline? Like LEDs that's dope. Still going on there. Yeah, look. There's LEDs on his sh pants. Yeah, yeah. Short oh, legs. shit. Even at his hips. Up. Oh. It's on a, nice yeah, jab. Man, he's doubling up that knees. jab, man. Yeah, he's reaching there, though. That's yeah. trouble. <clears throat> the reach? Yeah. Oh, shit. I think you're right. You think how, did boxing, how did boxing get, did get to this? I know. Huh? I YouTube you know what? with They're fucking not bad. LEDs on their belts. and yeah. Listen, man. It's, it's always because the show. boxing pro promoters went let the it's fight show. that we wanted to see put on. Yeah. So then somebody's going to step up. I blame it on COVID. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> We was All bored right, for a long time. We like, were watching yeah. any goddamn thing. Yeah, yeah right? Yeah. Up. Up, up. Oh! oh. Right, so those Come are crisp, on, nice shots. Good get active. I don't know why Willie does this sometimes. Come on, yeah. Willie, get active. He's never. Uh, he's yeah, like yeah, a he's pretty tentative. Oh, man. Yeah, he he's does. Him out. Like he's always he's been that feeling way. Feeling him out. Look at Logan yeah. over there smiling. He wasn't like that when he was champion, though, was he? Come on, He's never really been a pressure fighter. No. Okay, okay. I don't study fights like you guys. He usually fires off the back foot. He fires that right hand off. He's, he's going not back. going, like he's not going in at all. Uh -uh. He's, he's, he's all right. Jake looks huge. And Jake yeah, looks Tyron much, looks pretty much big too. Than this guy. Huge. Tyron's got some own legs. <laughs> hey, who, who's? Oh. He's got. He borrowed Mark Hunt's legs for this <laughs> fucking fight, man. Short shorts. Yeah, well, it's like no media. It's just Logan down there dude with the camera <laughs> down ring got dude got on his oh, You got to take a Polaroid. Look at that. Oh, oh, oh. oh that was a damn. Uh -huh. Come on, Logan down that there talking a... shit to T Wood right now as they're fighting. Yeah, of course. Is he? Is he? Yeah. If T Wood just threw the right hand and Logan starts laughing. T T T Wood looks just as fast and crisp though. Yeah, he looks good. Watch out. He looks good. Who won that round? Mm. The that was not, dude. I don't know. I'd probably oh, say Jake. Really? He doubled up on that jab, maybe? Is that three minutes? Mm. Yeah. Three minute round? Is it two or three? I think they're three. I minutes? think they're threes. I know threes. I know Jake wanted three minutes because he thought he could drag. With the uh, Aspen, it was two minutes, so I'm not sure if it's the same. This eight, is, eight rounds, right? This is three yeah. minutes? No, we're not sure. Okay. I, I yeah, we'll see. I think, it's three, I think it's three minutes. Yeah. Eight rounds, and for some reason, there was talk about there's no drug testing. I don't know what the fuck that meant, but there was a whole well, night. Wait, there's no drug testing? No, no, no. Before, nope. but the night of, they probably drug tested before, but no, no they drug, didn't but at all. Up. So Zero. they took, so. I got no yeah. problem with that. So, yeah, so they can take night. whatever, which is oh, how it should uh, be. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> you think, you think <laughs> it should I, be? I agree. Yeah, I agree. Fight for these guys. I think, I don't think fighters should be able to take. Yeah, I don't think so. No, it's super dangerous. No. Yeah, nobody touched him, Pride. But anyways, so with Woodley. No, 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 for real, Pride. Yeah, no, yeah, Vanderlei was on. Anyways, so. Everybody was on the Pride, except for me. Yeah. Damn. Yep. Almost Jeez. everybody was. Every, everybody. You think Fedor was on? You think yeah. Fedor was on it? I don't think Fedor was on. Yeah, Russian. Oh, yes, I don't think so either. Yeah, because yeah, Russians don't. Do. They, don't they, they never do anything. anything. Never. They never, never do anything. But I don't think Fedor was Who? on. It. Well, just don't look you know, like. you know, the, the Russians were kicked out of the Olympics for fucking that yeah, stuff. The entire team, my man. The entire team. I was like, whoa, whoa, whoa. Anybody's because it was state sponsored. Yeah. Dude, and and the rules means that's the first line they tell you. We do not test for anabolic steroids. In pride, in pride, says we don't test. We don't, but they Contracts do test for weed, though. Yeah, they test for weed oh, and for cocaine weed. and all that stuff. Yeah. Is this going to go to a fucking decision? I'm going to be pissed. It feels it like it's going to a decision. Well, I don't know. Yeah, well, at least not. Well, I mean, they're, they're both they're not But they're feeling much. each other out. That's yeah. what they're doing. Yeah. Like a real boxing match, they're feeling each other out. Now, if they keep feeling each other out for fucking, we get in the fourth, then we're in trouble. What the uh, fuck is he doing? Haunting them. Damn. Because in order for Woodley to get knocked out, he's going to have to take a chance. Because if he keeps fighting like this, going he's to decision, he's, yeah. he's definitely going to lose yeah. in decision. 
Like unless it's like some you're, clear. You're, you're in Ohio. He's catching right? elbow and gloves though. You're in Cleveland, Ohio. It's where he's it's from. Insane. Yeah, you're but, you ain't winning that decision. Yeah, I mean, I, but you Jake want Paul Jake to like win? Box, yeah, though. you know. I'm just saying based on the good fucking punches. cloud bullshit. I mean, they're yeah. gonna want him to win. Jake Paul yeah. looks good, man. He still looks How good. Dude, for only having those shitty fights, yeah, he's fucking. Looks he's only been fighting for about three years. He got rocked a little bit right there. He got rocked a little bit right there. I don't know. I don't like his technique. I don't like Jake Paul's technique that much. Woodley's being super timid. Maybe he's just sit, dra trying to drag him out and then open I up. Like, I like Jake's movement, though. He's keeping that jab in his face. Uh, uh, uh. He's, got, he's got long arms. Yep. Bol oh, both damn. are super timid to throw something. Brennan, you don't yeah. miss the shit at all? Not at all. <laughs> <laughs> no. Yeah, why are you retired so young? Fuck, man. Stand up. Oh. I don't I miss this shit. Tired doing other type stand up. Like, I have no desire Dude. to. I have no desire to do this shit ever. No dude. zero. None. Someone's like, oh, we like, now, now, now all this stuff. Do it, Rampage. You know what? You fight I, Shannon, maybe. Yeah, yeah. I don't. I don't want to. I don't want to miss it. I don't want to miss it because so many fights. You kind of done it all, dude. They yeah, retire and then they miss it. Oh, dude. Who got rocked? Oh, he can't get no, rocked. He's catching elbow and gloves, but but Jake is being more aggressive. Like Jake's actually doing well, which is freaking crazy. Jake's gonna have to open up though. Chin, did you, you did you think he wouldn't do well? I'm shocked. I am, because Tyron's a and freaking, that's fair because we don't know much yeah. about yeah. Jake. Tyron's You've a, only seen two right hands out of him. Yeah, Tyron's just, a real fighter. Yeah, but when you start getting Jake's into like movement, man, yeah, when you start getting man, into like conversations with people that have trained with them, yeah, yeah, yeah. people that have worked with them, and I boxing. get it, it's fight camp stuff, yeah. and I understand that, but it's still shocking though. Yeah, it is, man. Tyron. Like, uh, Multi-time champion. Jake's, it's Jake's keeping him shocking. Confused. I mean, it's boxing though. Moving it is. It just, it just, it just goes to show that anyone can I'm box. Chin though, it's crazy. <laughs> Yo, Jake is way like bigger. Like Jake. Love, yeah, love, anyone can box. I love it. anyone can box. See, he's not way bigger. Tyron's fucking. He's thick. Tyron's thick. like muscular, but yeah. Jake is just bigger. He's just. You give that round to Jake too. Yeah, that round to Jake too. Probably too. Which is crazy. We're losing it down the card. Just aggression. Damn. <clears throat> I just want to see someone get knocked the fuck out, man. <laughs> I'm going to be honest yeah, with you. Yeah, we all do. Yeah. What, what was the bet when you put it on with T. Wood? What? Plus what? Just has to win. Uh, Level plus one. Uh, let me see what I 180? Let me see what Earlier I today it was 160. Yeah, let me see. Jaleon, Jaleon Love. That's an interesting name. Oh, that guy. BJ Flores is the main coach, I think. That's him right there, right, BJ? The Leon Love guy. Uh, straight bet, uh, plus 170. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, plus 170 is the best line I got. What do you think he's saying to him right wow. now? Uh, throw a punch, dude. Yeah, get active. Yeah, be just, active. Yeah, be Let's more try and active. hit him this Who round. Is that? Who yeah. is this coach right there? Who's that guy? No, I mean, no idea. I don't know, man. I mean, if I'm T. Come Wood, on. I'm hiring the best fucking. He has good coaches, probably. Yeah? Yeah. All right. yeah. Come oh, on. Oh. <laughs> oh, you want to give Woodley fight advice? No, no, no. <laughs> Wait a minute. What oh, no, was don't. Please no, tell him what I'm to just do. Saying, <laughs> I, want, I want the best okay, coach. I want the ATT best boxing forever? coach with for Duke him. Rufus? Oh. That's, uh, that's true. But that's not boxing, though, is it now? He, he has good coach. Oh. oh, that oh, kind of caught him there. See, if I'm Woodley here, I'm hanging. Yes. I'm just hanging. Hang on him and just body shot. Hang on him body shot. Come on now. Let's get into this. Oh, nice jab to the body there. Thank you. Uh, there's a parry. Damn. Yeah, I would make it a little uglier if I'm Woodley. I'd make yeah, that man. skinny Steve Harvey break it up. Do you feel me? Sean Porter <laughs> just bulldog him. I'd turn him out, put his ass in the corner. Yeah, it's that's timid. what I'd do. I'd make it ugly. I wouldn't sit back here like he's doing. No, he's timid, timid. Yeah, he's, he's just... yeah, he, he, oh, 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 he rocked him. Oh, that's he rocked speed. Him. Big time. No, he rocked him. Speed, he rocked man. This why he rocked him. Yeah, yeah, get him. Yeah, this that's speed. This is why I want to see out of Jake. He gets hit. How's he respond, man? Get, get him. He didn't We're going to learn a lot more about this. He did Jump on him, Woodley. He hit him. Woodley's smart. Oh, oh, he landed a little bit there. That's the same combo he's been landing, though. Yeah, it is. Yeah, Woodley's smart. Straight Woodley's right smart. to the body. Patient. Yeah, yeah. To the patient. Same as that combo. Yeah, no mystery. Boy, Woodley had that was a crisp. You think he, you think Woodley knows that? I hope oh, so. Oh, oh, dude, they both look good. It's freaking a trip. <laughs> yeah, they are. Yeah, they do. Damn. Well, I tell you what, by this fourth, fifth round, somebody can drop. Yeah. yeah, I think so. Yeah. Oh, what? I think four. Oh shit. I think fifth round is done. I'm calling fifth round. Uh, I'm, no. yeah, yeah, fifth or sixth. Uh, by the way, fair. Jake, Jake hang, hanging just at the edge of the pocket like that. <clears throat> That's good, man. You think Boom Boom's like hating in the back of his head right now because Jake's making more money this fight yeah. than he ever than made he ever made. Career. Boom Boom won. <laughs> oh, 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 shit. Nice. Oh, oh, shit. You know he got hit if he shakes his head. That was nice. 
Jake Paul with a big flurry right there. Man. That was a uppercut. nice long uppercut. Damn, that's these gutsy. Paul Bros can fight a little, can't they? Yeah, they he can. just gotta throw, man. Come on, Wood, throw. Yeah, he ducked his head. Wood just, has to open up. Yeah, you just gotta he, throw. He has to risk. Jake it Paul's out. looking very good, man. How much time? He's gonna figure out. That, that fan cuts off the clock for me. Forty six. But then I'd rather also 45. have the fan than 44. have the clock. <laughs> Jake, Jake 40. is confident, man. He's getting more confident. Double up the jab. Assume, oh, 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 oh. That was, Damn, like almost he's right going, he's Damn, going for it. Snap. Bad intentions. Boom. Damn. Man, that, this that is actually catches. good. This is actually really good. Yeah, this is good. Yeah. Now, did Kyle pass away getting the food? or? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> they take their time. Like, That's going to be some good pizza. It's like one minute up the street. Don't kid yourself. Yeah, he pizza, went, like, pizza, rock. Kyle he passed away. Ride. Right, they closed the pizza shop. At Air One. So oh, we, good. We, or yeah, they did? Postmates. We Postmates one. Got it. God that's why. It. That's what's I happening I love right that pizza at Air One. Oh, so did he not go to Air One? He, he, he did. He, he got that. Tyron. But they ran out of pizza. He's making Tyron chase him, man. Yes. Oh, no. oh, that one rocked him. Oh. That one rocked him. Rock Jake. Yep. Oh, fuck. I missed it. That one rocked him. Yeah, but that was right at the bell. That was right at the bell. That's why he started talking. Yeah. That's why he started talking. Yeah. Okay, you hit right me. Right at the bell. Whenever you, they get hit, whenever they shake their head, that usually means you get hit. Or talk, right? Oh, yeah. yeah. That usually means it hurt. Uh-oh. Uh oh. So I yo, yo, show that replay. What is it? Oh, Julia Rose is there. Who's that chick? That's Julia Rose, right? What? That's Jake's fiance. Yo, that's funny. She's so much. She's rather pretty. Wow. I know you got some stuff. Yeah, I can't see shit. Here's here's the replay he missed though, Bradley. Sorry. Yep. Nope. That didn't land. That didn't land. That hit. Ah, none of those really landed. Did this? No. No. Slipped them all. Look at that technique. <laughs> that, was yeah, yeah, that was bad. Tech. But here, right here at the very end, right here at the very Ruby end. Lancer, Watch, saying? right here. Boom! Oh, that was a big right on the hit. fucking awesome. button. But he can take it. Down. Look, but he he's like, what? It. Look, he's, he takes it. He takes it. Whoa! I no, he it. took it. Jake but Jake Paul's a fucking fighter, man. He is. He's actually good. He's a, he's a fucking good technique right there. The that, that's good cornering right there. Throw some ice on the floor. Let your let your let your guy get another thirty seconds. No matter what happens, I'm impressed with Jake Paul. Yeah. No oh, there's no happens. doubt. I mean, Wood just got to throw, man. Oh, shit. Do. Uh, the, Come on, Wood. Fourth or fifth. Oh, no. Oh, oh, yeah. The boys He's are getting, getting loose now. Now we're getting Put loose. It. We're getting Put loose, it. Brennan. We're getting okay, loose. Here we go. <laughs> oh! oh! Little exchange. Let's go. Who landed? Oh, this is amazing. Come on. This is I good. I love this. Watch. I'm enjoying this shit now. Come on, T. Wood. You just stepped it. I'd say Wood just said that. He's hunting him down. T. was hunting him down. I would say Woodley's down two rounds. Oh, two one or two or three zero. T's got some one. T. Wood's got some fire right now. Yo, I think they're gonna throw some nice shit right here. Throw, baby, throw. If T. Wood throws, man, he, I think he can get him out of here. They're throwing right here. He just gotta throw. He just has to open up. Yeah, they're throwing. More action. He's so timid. Come on, T. What is he trying to like get decision? Why you? He's trying to bait him in. Yeah. No. No. Good straight. Oh, yeah, that was a power shot. Yeah. Nothing there. He hit his elbow, though. Yeah, nothing yeah, yeah. there. Yeah. Damn. No faints. I'll tell you what we don't want to have happen. This goes to the seven, and they're both really tired. That's going to uh, They don't look too tired. No, they look good. T-Wood looks look good. good. They look good right They're now. Are, are, the eight, th are there three minutes, right? Three minutes. Yeah, three, three minutes. minutes. I said earlier, man. I, I didn't oh, think. Yeah, I, I didn't think. I didn't think combo, but he, he bailed on it. I didn't think T Wood's gonna look this good in the, going into the floor. Yeah, you were Wood super looks, hating on. Yeah. The By the way, whoa, you know, whoa, whoa, whoa. Just, whoa. Yeah, it was, all, it was pretty much 100 percent hate coming from you. Yeah, well, you were. Really yeah, it was hating. dirty. Hey, uh, uh, Jake looks a little. Tired. You need to be careful, bro. Before I call Dylan Dennis. Call him. It's very interesting here. Don't make me call Dylan. He's oh shit. Wow. Oh, he felt just got to look up at the clock. You see that? Come on. Oh, who did? Jake? Yeah, yeah Jake's, Jake's getting tired. Then. Jake's getting tired. It's oh, such a bad when it's, Ever somebody looks at the clock, Jake's it's getting the tired worst here. sign. Yo, Jake's I getting tired. Jake's getting tired. Oh! 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 Come on, T. Hit him. Oh! Oh my God! I missed. Come it. on! Oh, oh he rocked. Oh, him. He, he yeah, rocked yeah, he's in yeah. trouble. He's actually hurt. He's yeah. in trouble. Yeah. He's actually hurt. Yeah. He's in trouble. And he's never been hit before. Nope, not like no, that. He was not yeah. like that. He's no. actually. Oh, he's fucked. Oh, he's up. done. He's, he's done. Fucked, Look at his bro. legs. He's done. Hundred percent, he's done. Uh, I don't know. Oh no! Come on. Just, what you mean? You don't no, know? No, no, he's T he just chilling right now. He's done, bro. Just relax. Oh, just relax. Oh, the right hand, Woodley. Left hook, right hand. Come on. Oh, T got hit right there. T got hit. Willie got hurt. 
Come on, Woodley. No, he's lit. Oh, my God. Look at Chappelle on the back. Yo, <laughs> like, this yeah. is fucking lit. I can't even... T, T. Woodley, they, he's a champion, guys. Don't fuck around. You guys keep fucking talking about Jake Paul. I've been telling you from day Yo, one. Yo, shut the fuck <laughs> up. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Nah, you switched up. Sorry, I get, a little, I get a little fucking... Come on. Fuck Come on, Woodley. Let's go. Let him go. Oh, yeah, he let him off. He's letting go. Out. Oh, he's loading up. No. Don't load up. Right. Just throw. Just throw. Oh, my Damn. God. Oh, we're ready to go. Woo. We're ready to go. Hey, by the uh -oh. way, hey, by the way, props to Jake Paul. Fuck Got yeah. fucking rocked and smiled. So you guys fucking are shitting on Jake Paul. He's tired. No, no, you're flip-flopping. I do flip flop. Hey, I don't care. Jake's in trouble, man. Yeah. Please, thanks. Jake's in trouble. Yeah. Watch it. Is this his big hit? Yeah, yeah. Watch. Boom! Oh, oh shit! Face, nah, right on the, the nose. Got him in the nose. Didn't knock him. No, I rocked him. That man. wasn't. That was the jaw, though. That was in the front of the face. That was nice. This is the bad one. Here. Yeah, that was in the front. This of the is face. the bad one here. The right hand. Oh, the right. Right here. Boom! Yeah, definitely oh, behind the ear. Behind, behind the, the ear. ear. Yep. I rocked that one. Rocked him. He. He. he uh, which again, is the one? Which is good, the one that wobbled? Good him, defense. Though. That one. I don't I think. know if that one. Or is it this one? Let's see. Oh, yeah, oh, that, that, yeah, that, that one, one, that one, that one. That's the one that, that, one that got him. That yeah. yeah, that's oh, the one. Oh, my God. Through the ropes. Yeah. Oh, that. his eyes are all fucky. Yep. 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 But you know what? Oh, oh he missed oh, that. That would have hurt. He could have ended yeah, If he yeah. didn't load up on that, he would have landed. By the way, by the way, Jake's never been hit. Paul's got back like this. Still on his toes. It's 2-2 now. Yo, if Jake comes back from this, he's on his toes. It's 3-1 or 2-2. It's 2-2. Oh, wow, that hurts. 2-2. Yo. That hurts in the old. Third round's close. Okay. True. It could be three one, but yeah, I, I I, two, two. I'll go two two. Jake also. Paul is on his toes and he's a real. F he's, oh, oh, did that? Yeah, dude, he's no. answering back. Oh, oh shit. nice big uppercut, woo! big uppercut. Dude, you know what? He's playing with the big boys, Brendan. I've always UFC. said, if you want to fuck, if you want to fuck with the big boys, you're gonna get caught. This guy's uh, a king flip. T Wood's right so here. relaxed right now. King flip flop. <laughs> why did exactly. why did he exactly. fucking fight like this? I know. Oh. Fuck. He's he fighting Jake, Jake Paul. Yeah, that's true. He that's true. He's fighting Jake Paul. He's fighting that's fucking Kobe Covington. Dude, this is actually a, a good fight. Yeah, this is it's a, a good, good fight. fight. This is a yeah. good and fight. Look at Wood. And look at, look at T. Wood. This is actually really Don't enjoyable. Don't fuck around with T. Wood. He's got three God one. on his side, man. He's yeah. not a social media guy. Don't fuck around. 3-1. Three 3-1 one. Three one or 2-2, two two, yeah. That third, oh. round was, that third round was close. It was close. Yeah, you can give it to him. Jake had more output, but T. Wood landed the harder shot. take over, though. T. Wood is there. T. Wood's backing up going on. No doubt he's taking over. Yeah, he's a, I, he's well, they just need to put combos together, Mike. Quit trying to land one big one. Mm. Oh, 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 I don't know. Seems no, he, to be I'm working. We're going to have to drop him for him to Stay win relaxed. the season. Correct. Though. Yeah, you exactly. Gotta, you got to make him hit the mat at least once. You, you are correct. Yeah. You know what? Jake's a little timid right now, and he's breathing heavy. Needs to be. t wow. got power and, still. And, and, and no, no. Oh. oh. He can still crack. I don't think... How much damage do you think the body shots are doing to, to Woodley right Nothing. now? Nothing. Nothing, right? Not much. This yeah, guy's okay. fucking stacked. If you stacked. have a good one, it's, it's... Bro, that guy got abs on abs. I think he's used to shit. What about the straight body shots like that? They don't really do much to it. No, we got to be careful of that right, right there, that little... Oh, oh that was shit. a good that hit. Good oh, hook. look, Woodley's starting oh, to shoot Let's go. That was oh, a big hit. That was a good left hook. Big hit by Jake Paul. Come on. That was. Hands up. Come on. He's, he would. Say what though? No matter what happens, Jake is the real. Fucking yes, he's he is actually the real good. Deal. Yes, he is the real deal. Yes, he is. He's tough as shit. Yeah. He took no two big no, he's shots. A legit yeah. Fighter. I like it. Yeah, me too. He's a legit dude in general. I mean. Mm. I mean, you know, come on. You know. <laughs> he's like, yeah, have you ever talked you to him? Oh, you just gotta oh, throw oh, more. No, I like him though. Have I you just, ever had I'm a conversation? No, I never. Oh, just kind of just. Shut up, Bradley. I don't know if you ever met. Hey, Bradley, it's not shit on Brian. It's his bike commander. Not shit on Brian. Sorry, dude. Sorry. I just want to make sure. Oh, oh, caught him again. Uh -oh. Caught uh -oh. him again. I met him, I met him one time. I Come on, T. Oh, oh, there's another I don't know one. which one I met. Probably Jake. I, don't know. I mean, Jake still put out more. At a uh, NASCAR event. Okay. This is one of our entertaining fights. Yo, this is, like, this this love is, love is actually mine. really entertaining. I'm loving this shit. You can tell because we're kind of quiet. It's funny. Yeah, and, and, we're like and, and T, was, T was a way better boxer yeah, than I, on it. I gave him credit for it. And shame on me for... Oh, you thought you were better boxing than Woodley? No, I never said that. Oh, you would have beat Woodley? Brendan, don't say dumb shit, all right? You would have beat Woodley? Oh, oh shit. shit. No, just fucking yeah, fight, that, man. That, that, was, that one's shit. tough. That's that's tough. Like, yeah, that was a tough but one. You could say, nah, I'm, 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 I'm give it to Woodley? I give it to Woodley. So 2-3 oh. based off Farhood's yeah. yeah. scorecard? Close. Yeah, he caught him in the same. But as going, Jake's kind of tailoring off a little bit. You have you have Woodley winning right now? No, I have him down 2-3. Okay. He's won the last two. Okay, I got him that last round. Now, I would have Woodley up 3-2 if I was judging, but according to Farhood, who does the non-official scoring for Showtime, he has him down. Where do you see that at? It showed at the bottom a while ago. Boom! Oh, that didn't really land. He kind of just picked his head up. Maybe. 
Are you sure? Watch you know what's going to suck is if Jake Paul does get knocked out oh, and you have those nice electric things on your shorts. Yeah, if that's playing that's while what's you're not knocked fun. out, yeah, it's, it's like, not fun. damn. What if it just said KO? Oh, what if it just goes to Z's? <laughs> no, what if it just said KO? What if it just goes to Z's? Z's? I'm seeing it. I'm oh. seeing it. Z's. Z's. Oh, so oh. Tyron caught him. He got caught him with that check hook right there. Z's. Look at him smile. Z's. But Jake caught him with I mean, the either way, it's money signs. Yeah, either way, either way, he's fucking. That makes me angry. I get angry. Lots of money signs. All right, let's do this. Let's do that. I bet Farhood has it three two. Who's Farhood? Why that? do you say Steve Farhood? Farhood. The here? Yeah, you'll see it. I think he has it four Steve one. Steve Farhood's the I, I, bet he, I bet he has it four one. Judge. Yo, Tyron's oh, firing right now. He's going now. Yeah, he's going. He's firing right now. Steve Farhood yeah, has been in boxing rounds. for 100 years. Oh, Might as well go. Yo, let him. What the fuck? The way this fight's going, too, the rematch, not mad at. No, me neither. Mm -hmm. Me yeah, neither. Yeah, I'll definitely watch it again. Same time, same bat Yeah, nobody's embarrassed. No, no, this is great. Fuck no. 10 rounds, though. Jake Fuck Paul, you. dude. You guys count. Oh, he's with, he's with me. Oh, no. Farhood gave it to yeah. fucking Jake last Yeah, yeah. 4-1. I think he's a little off, dude. 4-1. Well, I mean, remember. He's not the official judge. Ooh. Yeah. Caught him yeah, in the clouds. Yeah, That's a right. nice shot. They want you to. They want this direction if it's going there. Right. Okay, T. Come on. I don't like this. Because then it come back for a right He's got to throw, room. man. You're down on the cards, I, I don't know how you give Jake that last round. Oh. Why are you grabbing him, though? Well, coming in close. Listen. Remember what I said when this shit started? What did you say? It's oh, it's fake? Yeah, man. It ain't it, fake. Yeah, this is not fake, fake, dude. They are swinging fake. for the fence. But at the end, though. Oh, if it goes to judges? It goes to judges? Oh, yeah, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah I've been yeah, Jake yeah. all day. Yeah, boxing corrupt as fuck. Yeah. 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 <laughs> so, so that's what I'm saying. That's like, it's not know, fake, yeah. though, dude. Yeah. Like, yeah. yeah. And, and you're in Cleveland. If he gets knocked out, of course, right? Yeah. All right, all right. Come on, Wood, throw. Yeah, Oh, Jake, open it up. A lot of white people. Like yeah, that. he's tired. <laughs> Jake's real ground. tired right now. So does he, does you think he knows he has to knock him out though? No, no. no fuck. Tyron is fucking Because in my eyes, Tyron. I mean, he's, he's winning Tyron, this round. Tyron is patient. I don't get how far Hood scored it. Like, he's got to throw, man. You see, he's not cutting him off. He's following him a little bit too yeah. much. You well, because because Jake Paul, Jake Paul's throwing more. So that's probably uh, why he's giving him a round. Throw to get you in. just got to throw, man. And also cut him off. If he throws, yeah. he's going to win this fight. Someone's getting a little tired, though. Yeah, both You're talking about Jake? Both. Both. Yeah. Wood's, Wood's oh, slowing down. Man. They've definitely Come slowed on. down. Well, sometimes you take a, a round off. They don't got enough rounds to take one off. Yeah. yeah that's only eight, eight rounds. Oh. Oh. Hop up. Uh-oh. That grazed on the top now. of the head, too. Tyron just keeps coming forward, man. Damn it. Yeah, but he has to throw something. Yeah, he's he's forward, talking but about he's not your mama, man. He was talking about your mama. I know. Get in there, man. You're fired up, man. Up. Mm. Up. Oh, that was a nice day. Lots of this shit now. Yeah, I know. They're both, uh, Jake's breathing hard. You think he doesn't see that, though? Six Why rounds. Oh, oh, oh. I feel like if Woodley would put the pressure Come on. He could really... He could. I do too. He's like Woodley that round, yeah. right? Yeah. Mm, I think Woodley's I don't know, up man. one round. In he my scorecards, I got Woodley up one He didn't throw much, though. Superman. Yeah, that's more the thing. Than judges. More than Jake, though. Jake threw. No, I don't Jake think so. Jake caught him in the, the body a couple times. Yeah. You got, he is, he is kind of, he does have ring control. He is pushing the fight, right? right? Like, if you're going to score that, like, who, like, let's say the strike was even, you got to go to ring control. Right. Yeah. Damn. All right. Does online have Jake winning, or were they saying? Uh, chat. What do you guys think? Who do you guys have winning? Spam it in the fucking You're chat. Way off. Let's go. What do you guys think? Is Farhood off. Am I off? Spam it. Spam it. Talk to us. Whose phone is? I don't know, but I, yeah. Oh, Kyle. Oh, oh, that's the Prius guy. Right now. now, did he make the pizza himself, or <laughs> where do you go, Domino's? A lot of people are saying Jake. What Domino's? We also order at Postmates. A lot of people are saying Jake's up. A lot of people are saying Woodley though too. It looks. See, I, I think Woodley's up one round. That's how I have a scored. Right, I think it's go. tied. These, three, three. These, two, these next two rounds. It's 3-3 three, three right now. 3-3 three, three or 4-2 three, three. Three, three three for Jake. That's a good. Up. Oh, there oh. Go. This did take yeah. that round off. Now they're throwing. Shit. Yeah, 3-3 three, three or 4-2 for Jake. Yeah. Okay, let them apart, damn it. Come on, man. I think 3-3 three, three is the safest right. call to make. Here we go. Here we go. So if it's 3-3. Three, three. Wow. Damn, he gave fucking Paul that last round. 
Remember, yeah. man. He's just throwing more. Yeah, he's throwing more. You're telling me Willie's won one fucking round. You're out of your mind. No disrespect, Steve Farley. See, see the, and the, his corner probably telling him that he's winning, so he's Nah, not, he can't be doing that. You know what I'm saying? Do you think that's what I'm saying? Do you think he knows that he needs to knock him out? Oh, no, oh, because yeah. he's the, he's uh, the yeah. Wrestler, see, he's big Big John, Big John just said it's five one, Jake. What? Yeah, so he has it five one for Jake because what? Well, he's just too I'm square and he's not throwing that. enough. I think I think it's four two. Oh. Nice and nice. That's a nice cut. That's a, he just said the same up. thing. He's like, Willie's just not throwing enough. If he had more output, he'd be one of the fights. Listen, I ain't going to argue oh. with Big John. Why is he? If Big John says 5 1, it's fucking probably 5 1. Yeah. So we're off. I'm off. 5 1. Yep. Just throw him. So, so Willie needs to knock him. Yeah, he just needs, to, just needs to throw him. But do you think his corner knows? Because even if Big John's off of, of, well, by a round, that's 4 2, he's still yeah. fucked. I, I have it 4 2. John so, has it 5 1. Damn, then. I feel like this is it then. He, yeah, Willie needs a knockout. Calm down, buddy. <laughs> this is it. <laughs> you mean? You got it's one 20. more round. You got, you got 10 grand on this fight, don't you? Yep. 10. 11. 11. 11. 11. Yep. Yeah. Counting the grand to him. got to count that. Yeah, see, that's how I feel. When someone says they spent money, I'm like. <laughs> 5 11? What the fuck? Oh, damn. He's just not throwing punches, Jake man. Jake answered a lot of fucking questions. Well, kid can get hit. Yeah, he Stay in the hit. fight. Fuck stay focused. Yeah. He looks good. This answers more questions about Jake than Woodley. He looks good. And he's got endurance, by the way. So Jake, Jake will beat that, not, that, that, that Tommy Fury? Fury? That Tommy I think Fury. so, man. Yeah, 100% yeah, he's beating that kid. Yeah, yeah man. Be a good next step for him, too. Yeah, I mean, real boxer? He's, he's I mean, Grant, he's fought guys with no wins, but. He's still I feel like he's going to steamroll that kid. He would probably knock him out. Yeah. Come on, Tyler. Get, the, get, this, get this W, man. He Jake looks tired, him. though. He looks tired, but he's still fighting. Tyron might be tired too, though. He doesn't. Look Man, like the doing bummer much. is in Woodley's corner. They need to be like, dude, you're you're down fucking yes. six rounds, bud. You gotta, we gotta go balls to the walls here. Especially if you want that rematch. Well, to make he, money. he's following him, but he's just, you know, he's but just I'm not, saying, he's just not throwing. No, that's what I'm. Listen. Yeah. Oh shit. Well, he landed. Nice. No, that was nice. He caught him. He caught Woodley with that. I think he caught Woodley with that I'm convinced shot. that they just want the rematch. There's no rematch though. Yeah. Right. Yeah. yeah. Wins. yeah. It's if, only if Woodley wins. If Jake oh, wins, yeah. he moves on. He's doing great. He's doing Fuck. great. That's what. That's why it's. You know, if Woodley wins, you automatic rematch. If he wins, there's no rematch. Hey, what do you think of Dana's comments about, about the Jake Paul thing? Which you, which comments? He oh, he said he said because uh, Jake said it's a flash in the pan. Or no, J no, Jake <laughs> said that he's like he's like if I ever run into to, to oh, Dana, gonna knock I'm gonna knock him out. out. Which he would. He's probably not probably. What Dana say? Dana said, well, that's about par for what he would suggest. He's like, get in line. There's a bunch of people that want to knock me out. And he also that's said hilarious. like, it he seems, goes, it seems like it seems legit. that's like along lines because you fights people who are older than you and like that's hilarious. Yeah, yeah it's actually goes, pretty funny. That's he a goes, good comeback. Yeah, he goes, he goes. Uh, he's like, yeah, it seems like kind of in line with what he's doing. He's like, I'm 52. He's like, I'm 52. He seems like he'd want to fight me. That's what he's doing. He's fighting fucking 50 year. Olds. <laughs> uh, one one zero Dana. Ooh. Slipped Boom. and landed. Him. Damn, that's a great oh, shot. Oh, that was a good yeah, shot. Yeah, it was a big oh, hit. Oh, and blocked. No, that's a great shot, man. He's he won this fight. He won this fight. How insane is this? Let's see what happens. Come on. Yeah, he's well, clearly well, he has to know he's down this round. Jake Paul, you would think, great job. Yeah, you gotta, you gotta think, man. man. You gotta I'm think. I'm impressed that. with Jake Paul. Dude, if you had told me a year ago Jake Paul's gonna be Ben Askren <laughs> and Tyron, I know it's just so crazy. In your fucking face. Yeah, man. One more Damn. round. Come on, Wood. Just throw, else. man. Jake, when you open up, Jake can Jake oh. weather your storm and catch you. He just tried to throw a back fist. There he goes. There he goes. There he goes. Come on, come on, Wood. Come on, Wood. Throw. Think, my thing is, what does Jake do? So he fights Tommy, and then is it? Then where do we go from he there? He fights some real guys. His brother. He's gonna keep trying to talk shit to Connor. He wants to fight Connor. Yeah, oh. Dana. Well, the only way that can happen is Dana allows him to fight. That Connor. ain't gonna happen, dude. Connor's small, dude. Right. I mean, that's like I said. Connor's 170 when just yeah. walking around. Maybe like, like maybe one. He's a lot smaller. Maybe 180, Woodley, close to. Uh, you know, you know who the, uh, Dana might let him fight is one of the Diaz bros. Yeah, yeah. Oh, that'd be Nate. fun. I think, I, think he'd he'd fight fight I think he'd let him fight Nick. I think he'd let him fight Nick. Not he'd let him fight Nick. Not Nate. Still has some some years left to make money. They're not going to let him. Yeah, not Nick. They're not going to risk it. Nick's Nick's But let's say Nick fights Robbie Lawler and loses, they would let him take that fight. Yep. But they'd want to be cut in on the promotion. Yes. Right. Yeah. What's that do for Jake though? He fights Nick Diaz and knocks Nate, out yeah, Nick yeah. Diaz. Nick Diaz hasn't fought in he ain't be, he ain't 10 be, years. I'm sorry, but he I don't ain't think he. I don't well, think, that's why this I don't, is. A, I don't, I don't think, think Nick him. Diaz is is no. in the mind of a lot of Jake Paul's audience. Is the only thing. But that's the kind of the point, right? That's no, but, 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 but no, no, no. But, but here. Nick Diaz is a 
U- UFC Hall of Famer. Yeah, I love Nick, him. Nick, Hold on, no. he's a huge name. One of my Nick brings fight. Nick brings the audience that will watch. It would watch sell this. so much more. If, Hold you on, think so? I mean, it's yeah. Really? Jake Paul like, fights more compared to Woodley. Not even close. Jake Paul looked way more. Nick hasn't fought in five years, and he's fighting fucking Robbie Lawler. It's gonna be huge, dude. I mean, also Jake Paul fought Ben Askren. Like we're talking about people that are in line with his dude. fan yeah. base. Like he's yeah. going to fight anyone he thinks he could beat. I can't well, he's going to get the crossover because his fan's going to watch him fight a turkey. So he can fight anybody. He fights, and you get the Diaz crowd? Of they're, course. They're huge. huge yeah, massive. Now, does he beat Nick? No. Nick can fucking box, yeah. man. Yeah, yeah. And that's, that's the thing Nick. <laughs> Here's the thing. Box, box. The amount of output. Look how tired Jake is now. Yeah. Nick oh. is going to push him to the brink of just fucking yeah, just quitting all eight, all, eight all, all eight rounds. All eight rounds. All eight rounds. It's just going to be like, he be talking Tyron shit. Tyron's got to let it Tyron go, man. Tyron's got to let it go, man. You got 30 seconds. You got to finish, man. You've got to be thinking to yourself you're losing this fight. Oh, my God, dude. Jake Paul's winning this fight. He's going to win the fight. That's insane, dude. Good yeah, for I him. Got, I got what? Three Good K for him. You know? Good yeah, for him. Well, he's just nice. standing there not doing anything. The, the, Jake Paul obviously tired. Oh, oh shit. Yeah, Big right hand. Know. Break. Fuck him. He's not hitting him, though. Throw him right? off, he's man. Right. Oh, you're yeah. both trying to hold. Oh, he's in trouble. On, he's in trouble. Seconds, Get him, bro. man. Get him. Ten seconds. Throw. I don't think, I don't think he's not going to throw a punch. Oh, look. Jeez. He's making fun of him. He's Jeez. making fun of him. Oh, my God. Oh, wow. This is freaking insane no, see, i cannot he believe this no this is what i'm saying like, didn't win that fight he didn't man. win that fight nah, and i had him up on the cards a little bit well, oh this, man I, I, was, this was, I said he landed up the the harder punches oh but jake? jake paul just outworked yeah, no no yeah. tyron 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 lands a better yeah. shot yeah but he but just got woodley just got outworked yeah you're right yeah so that's why he thinks he won yeah i know man <laughs> the then we're losing again on the mic, and the guy was rod, blah blah blah. Yeah. But it doesn't matter. No, nope. that is fucking crazy. Like yeah, if your corner man ain't telling you, you you would think you're winning too because he's hurting him. Yep. But so big big John said six two Paul. Yeah. 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 Six that's two. Yeah, that's fine. That makes sense. Yep. That's fair. What the f- you know I would what? love to hear he what Jake it. says on the mic. He earned it. Look at his mom. I that's bet you Jake's pretty humble on the mic. He's gonna call somebody out, but I bet he's pretty humble. Yeah. Y'all would turn the subtitles on. Oh, uh, that's not that's not yeah. something. Yeah, uh, I want to hear this so bad. I do too. <laughs> Tyron Woodley. You have the headphones over there. Tyron Woodley did well though. You know. Hey Bradley, you were right, man. Those subtitles were fast. What? Those subtitles were fast. Subtitles in the bro. Those are the fastest yeah, yeah, subtitles those ever. Those things are so world. damn fast. Like everything involved. It, like what? What? The yeah. Thing, yes, anything, but yes, it. Ashamed of it. it yeah. Looks like it's Jake. You gotta be one of those Father fast Mario readers. I just flip through. Jake, regardless of the outcome from here, oh, LA, shit. we look. Oh, it's just you can't even do this. Holy this shit! Is Jake, Jake definitely outworked him. Look at that. That yeah. is so fucking crazy. You got especially oh the jabs. God. That's insane. The length. The length. Damn. That was great. It was a good fight. It was a way better fight than fight. I thought it would be. Yeah, more yeah. competitive than I thought. I thought way better. For sure, somebody was going to get dropped. Yeah, and Jake Paul showed. And you know that what? Woodley did kind of. He came to fight. He was in yeah, shape. Came to did. fight. It's he not did. like Jake beat some just bullshit no. dude. Jake Paul fought a real that guy. That is impressive. Yeah. Got, the yeah, main thing is he got rocked. So what do you go from back. here? If you're, if you're Jake's manager, what do you do? I don't. I don't give him to a a, a really good no. Boxer. I, I, don't I don't do the Diaz, I don't that. do the Diaz fights. No. I would do Tommy Fury if you want. Yeah. Tommy. Tommy be good. Tommy Fury. But you would fine. light Tommy Fury up. I think so. Um, but I think he's very serious, so he's going to want to push himself. The Nick Diaz thing, I don't, you know, I mean, not, Nick not Diaz can Nick, bop, bop, But box. Nick has to fight Robbie, but, yeah. Um, uh, Diaz ain't the way to go. If you're trying to get a win. Nick Diaz is not a good idea. Mm-hmm. No. Has Nick Diaz been training this whole time? Nick Diaz, all, all Nick Diaz, all Nick Diaz, he's okay. doing triathlons. triathlons. Yeah, okay. have, you, have you not seen him? Like, but how old is Nick? Probably about two, three years ago. He's 38. Mm. He hasn't fought in five years. It's a long It'd time. It'd be a good time to get him. I, I think it's a good fight. He's always trying. So, 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 so if you have fight. to pick the two, I guess you go with Nick if you want Man, to say an easier right fight. There. But yeah, Nate, yeah, Nate yeah, would yeah, mop yeah. the floor with him, I think. It's just a bad idea with his, their cardio, their yeah, chins, yeah. their boxing yeah, style. Yeah, been, yeah. It's a bad idea. <laughs> so I wouldn't do that. Um, They're not going to do Dylan Dennis because they've done that basically with Ben That was good. You got you got to have a real fighter. You got to have a real boxer. If you're going to step in there, you got to you got to have you got to know how to box, bro. Who do you think it is? I want to see. Too much. I want to see him fight a real boxer, man. It depends on what he wants to do. If he wants to keep going, it's like you do, look, look at this. Up. I like this though. 78-74. I, like I like this. I like the this. score. Seventy-eight, seventy-four. Yeah, it depends on what he wants Thanks to do. Thanks for taking if, that die. I appreciate if that. You, <laughs> if he wants to <laughs> fight convinced. for the next five years, then you do the next step. Yeah, you're ruthless, bro. You're but ruthless. if you just want to, you know, get paid, you fight your brother. There you go. 
But I want I don't I want to see Jake Paul fight who I want to see the what I'm, level I'm, you want to see him get to. The, this is a pretty good I don't level, see man. Him fight some amazing boxer. But what level you want to see him get to? You know what I'm saying? Like, I, that's like up what, to his him. ceiling yeah. at his age, like he's not gonna fight Canelo. No, no, he's not. What about Masvidal? What? Huh? Uh, they were talking shit. Split decision. Split decision. Split decision. That I'm actually I, I have very this close to the Big John. I'm We're actually not split, that's though, a split right? decision. Yeah, are you hearing this? 77, 75. Seventy-seven for seventy-five. Seventy-seven, seventy-five for Woodley. You know what? Yeah. If they're smart, they give it to Woodley, and we have the rematch. Correct. Yeah, that's, that's what I want to see. Let everybody get paid. Yeah. Let everybody make crazy. Seventy-eight, money. seventy-four. You'd have to. Jake oh yeah, that's out. right. Yep. Jake, Jake won. He deserves it. That's fair. That's yeah. fucking deserves incredible. It. The kid that's deserves it. Should have been a split, but yeah, Dude, that's but it was insane. So insane. I can't good believe this fight, is happening. Though. I think he's good for fighting, and I think he's good. It was for it was a good yeah, fight, man. Here's my question. It was a good you. fight. Yeah. Both of you guys. Yeah. Everybody here. Where's his ceiling at? Like, how far is he gonna go? Does he just a, fight like these old? And I'm not yeah. saying Woodley's washed up. That's up to him. Prime. I think like, it's up to is him. Is that the like that's the the I, I tell you model? What, I'll tell you what the ceiling is. I'd love to see him. Julio Cesar Chavez Jr. is 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 his his ceiling. Who? That level, Julio Cesar Chavez Jr., the that's one that Anderson call. Silva just that's beat him. Him, that's his ceiling right there. It was fifty and four, world champion though, four-time yeah, world champion. But he, How about this? The guy no, but hold on. Yeah. Wait, wait, wait. wait. It was fifty and four. Fifty yeah. and four. Uh, let me ask you this. <laughs> wait, <laughs> they're trying to make money fights though. But I'm saying no. He's saying what the ceiling is. Yeah, I'm, I'm saying like, like I'm serious? saying like in how a year, like two years, two three years. I'd say that's like. How does he do against that level? Masvidal is a monster. I would love to see that. Masvidal slows down. So Masvidal slows down. He's got the power. He's got the boxing. Boxing. Terrible matchup. Yeah, he's amazing. He's a bad matchup for him. But Masvidal doesn't. He's also a very slow paced fight. Yeah. So he'll he'll that's pick Jake. him apart. Masvidal will. Yeah, Masvidal. I think they keep pay, playing challenge. his game to make the most amount of money until he, just loses. until he loses someone that is like I'm losing to Conor McGregor. Fight, Everyone's gonna go like Logan? Oh, of course you lost yeah. to Conor McGregor. Yeah, I mean, but it's the biggest fight ever. Ah, and Conor is a much better boxer, but Conor yeah. is smaller. I know, no, that's what I'm saying. I'm, yeah. but I'm saying I think that's oh, the Connor's ceiling where that's the real better. fight. That's light years. Yeah, 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 Woodley or not light years. He is right. He's so good. I, he would. So, he would. He, he didn't beat Connor. It just seems like he that's doesn't beat it. Connor. No. It's, it's not a normal fight ceiling. I don't think it's like. Oh, you know, yeah, that's why I think it's hard to predict. I don't, I, don't, right. I don't know. Like, like look at like, the people who, he fought. Who knows Chavez Junior? It like that's not. He wasn't big in boxing, anyways. He was good. He was decent. But yeah, champion, I know, but because you know, of his dad, right? His dad, yeah. But he never like beat anybody. Like yeah, <laughs> here, I mean, like, but here. he lost Anderson Silva. What about Anderson Silva? Why, why, no, why, why not yeah, yeah. Yeah. Why I like not, that I, I like that fight. I like that too. Why not Oscar De La Hoya Oscar's fighting Vitor next Bigger guy yeah, da, that, you That's know. where he gets Too much of a shit show He wants to They want the popularity Because Oscar's though. gonna lose To Vitor I think he is I think, so, I think so too I think so I think too. Anderson Silva's the best next Who's he calling out Who's he calling out He's just saying Cleveland looks good Okay well let us know Because he's gonna Look, say man. He's gonna say Tommy He's gonna say Conor McGregor He's gonna say Tommy Conor McGregor Tommy Ferry Conor McGregor. He's gonna call it Conor because that's Connor. the most hundred percent Conor. Gonna happen. Yeah, 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 you're right. That's, that's Conor got it. a broken foot. I'm calling it right he now. Doesn't, doesn't that, matter. But him calling him out after this huge win is going to. It's gonna go viral. So much traffic. Yes. That's all he cares. Even yeah. though he's not gonna get the fight, yes. all he wants is the traffic. Conor McGregor, I guarantee. Dude, it. But his he's, ankle he's, is hanging he's off. He's worked so hard. Doesn't matter. I think Dylan Dennis. He's not gonna call out Dylan Dennis. No way. Dylan Dennis does not have enough clout to this guy. No, he's calling out Conor McGregor. I, I wish he called my fat ass out. <laughs> 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 You'd kill that guy, yeah, man. Yeah. See, all respect to Tyron. He's, He's a Hall of Famer. Famer. Yeah. Bit of a good fight. He's class act, man. I love this kid. I love him. Yeah. Come on, man. He's a fucking... He put, He steps in there and fucking does some shit. This coach on the right's eyeballs are popping out, huh? <laughs> hey, he's good people, man. Nah, his coach on the right, like he do a lot of drugs. I mean, his coach I mean, on the right needs to check his blood pressure. <laughs> <laughs> Is he, is he gonna say? Let's be honest. That's, that's bullshit. bullshit. Oh, that you gave him one. It's especially my hometown. Where's that at? <laughs> Where's that one judge at? Come on. He that one judge. Shot the whole fight. That, that one judge probably wasn't around when the internet started. Yeah, he's, yeah. he's <laughs> right. He's right. I mean, he he's. Dude, either we're looking looking all good. We still got the victory. Okay, come on, man. Yeah, waiting for the Conor McGregor to, to, call out. To be fighting for barely three years and be able to beat yeah. Woodley. Unbelievable. That's nuts. Unbelievable. Ooh. Boxing though, different game, man. He's so, talking shit about Tommy Fury right now. I knew it. Oh, the first time you see you see Tommy Fury seven zero, he goes four rounds. I think he knocks. Oh no, he's making sense. He's like Fury's been fighting. He has seven fights. He fought a four round fucking fight. Look yeah. at me. I think he knocks Fury. Chin, out. Chin, how's that pizza? 
We have a bunch of pizza boxes. Did you just get it from Italy? Yeah. Yeah, no, 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 the, don't bring it. We're almost done. Right. We don't want to eat on the mic. Okay. We'll be done. Literally. As soon as he just yeah, gets yeah. his opponent, um, we're out. I don't know who to fight. I like Anderson Silva. I like that. McGregor. I like not that happening, fight. Not happening, but Anderson Silva. Definitely not happening. But I like Jorge Masvidal. Yeah. I like Jorge. Oh, look, you have called out names. He's McGregor. Nathan. Nathan Diaz. Jorge Masvidal. There you go. No, no, no. No, he said Fury. He's Fury next. We'll see. I've been in boxing for 18 months. I've been a been to a I dentist. Mean, I barely got to cut my hair, uh, brush my teeth. My nose is crooked. They came the past eighteen months. He's a months tough fucking kid, man. To this, I might need to chill yep. out and wait for Conor McGregor. I made that up, but uh, yeah, yeah, like he, that's what he's doing. You know, you got to ask yourself for real. Like, okay, so you want to get really good at boxing? Is it worth the brain damage? That this is that when you're this age, you're making mistakes. No, no, you're no, fighting no. good guys. No no, 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 no. For him, is it worth the money? 15 million, million yes, 15, 18 million. It's worth it. You'll trade brain hold damage on. for 18 million. No, no, hold on. I wouldn't. I don't think you got much brain Bro, damage. Bro, we've, we've traded it for no, way less than no. that. What I'm saying. <laughs> you don't get much brain damage in MMA. No, you don't. You boxing, still get it, though. Boxing might be a little different because with boxing, if he wants to get really good and go the next level with Masvidal and guys like that, he's going to have to train his ass off. He's going to be getting hit by really good guys. Is it worth being dizzy, losing your memory? and Why do you say there's yourself? less brain damage in MMA than there's in boxing? Because more grappling and wrestling. You're not just taking shots. So when we train, and also, there's a lot more wrestling, so I take things to the ground, right? I'm not of just course. constantly getting hit. A different, in the head. a whole different approach. Yeah, and, and yeah, you know, yeah. in MMA, once you get dropped, you're bad. The fights over. They're gonna Bo- stop. Yeah, boxing, boxing, stand up. You got an eight you count. count. That's got bad. Half head trauma. They put you back out there. Yeah. You're not getting another yeah. eight got count. It, got it. Trauma. Got it. Got it. And there's just the jabs yeah, and, over and over. And when you get dropped like that, you, you're that's, that means you're concussed. Yeah. right? Mm-hmm. that's all it is. That's all it is. That's what it means. Yeah. Uh, I mean, he's crying, huh? Um, he just, prom- yeah, he's yeah, talking good about his brother. little brother, dude. Yeah, honestly, I, I, it's like you can't even hit on Jake Paul at this point. No, at all, no. at all, either at all. of them. What yeah. Logan did with Floyd? No, you yeah. don't love him, man. They're I mean, was dude, dope. it completely flips boxing on its head. Man. They're it's fun nice. to hate on because they're just they're so such showmen, but they're awesome. They're not gonna, they don't want to fight each other, but no. they're going to. They're close. Money. They love money. I've been waiting to post this after this fight, so I'm gonna post. What you posted? I was something that I was, I was excited about this fight. Tyrant of Chance, I want to say all the kids out there, if you ever get bullied, bullied, bullied keep your head up. Yeah. Confident. <clears throat> up to box. Some bullying. All right, we can wrap it up. He's not calling anybody out. Guys, thanks for watching. Love oh, yeah. you. I will be in San Jose September 9th through 11th, and then the big boy, San Antonio, September 24th and 25th. One show only at the Bud Light Event Center. All right, come on out. Tickets at FATKZ.com or ThickBoy.com. I'm going to be in uh, Buffalo the 9th of September to the 11th. Buffalo Helium. Then I got Denver September 23, 24, 25. And then Schaumburg Improv Chicago September 30th, 31, and October 1. I'm San Jose. My, I'm going to be at my gym all week. San Jose, buddy. I'll hit you up. I'll be at my gym all week. I'll be there. He will be at his gym all week. And I'm going to start working out there. And I'm going to get fucking Crazy Jack. Brad, TRT, Brad baby. Page. TRT. Mr. Thompson, <laughs> thank you guys. We Thanks, love you. Until next time, this is the funnest one. We love yeah, you guys. Yeah, man. Great to you. Thank you, guys.